，关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。
累了困了，喝东鹏特饮关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。
关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。
Greeting to everyone here and also those that are watching our live stream. Good morning from the Road of Asian Game Match Revenue. I'm Caster Luo Chen. I'm Caster Wang Mengyang. And this competition is jointly organized by the Olympic Council of Asia and the Asian and Electronic Sports Federation, operated by Jito Sports Asia. And first of all, we thank our prestige sponsor Audi Q4 e-tron for their strong support of our event, and also special thanks to Iku, the official game equipment of the RDAG, the professional choice to empower history, embrace the thrill of control. Let us also thank our official supporter Omen, new Omen, new journey to the road to the Asian Games. Let us also thank our official supporter Autofu, Autofu official gaming chair, partner of the road to the Asian Games. Be your own hero. Thank you to official supporter Easter Rock for their support. We would like also thank to our official broadcasting platform Bilibili, We Are Live, Douyu Live, Kaishou Games, China Mobile, Migu Channels, Tencent Videos, Weibo, Xiaohongshu, YouTube, and Twitch for their support. Okay, and. Today gonna be our first day of the uh, Dream Three Kingdoms. So, mm, okay, now we can see the group introduction, uh, and we can see in group A there are gonna be China, uh, Hong Kong, China, Kazakhstan, Nepal, uh, and on group B we gonna see Philippines, Thailand, and Vietnam. So gonna be seven team right now, uh, and today gonna be. Uh, uh, today will be five matches on live. The first uh, match will be China versus Hong Kong China at ten, and uh, Thailand versus the Vietnam at uh, twelve, and uh, Hong Kong China versus uh, Nepal and uh, fourteen, uh, Thailand versus Philippines at uh, fourteen. Uh, 16 and uh, Kazakhstan will, will, versus Nepal will be the last match of the day at uh, 18. Okay. So, mm, and okay. And so, this is gonna be a long day. There are gonna be five battles of three here, and the Mm, we can see like uh, so the Dream Three Kingdom is like uh, 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 we're gonna take the most uh, classic mode, the five versus five, uh, in this Dream Three Kingdom game. And you know some of the game well. Uh, five versus five mobile game. Mm -hmm. And. Uh, Players need to use uh, their strategical insight and uh, have playful skills to win the game. Yeah. So there are gonna be two ways to gain the victory in game. Like the first one, you can get uh, 60 kills like in one uh, team, and then uh, the second way to win the game is to destroy enemy base and. Uh, it is like a very classic mob mobile game, like uh, similar to some other mobile games. But uh, the 60 kills is like a unique, uh, uh, unique way to win in mobile game. Like in other mobile games, the the only way to win is to like uh, uh, like push enemy base, and uh, so uh, you know like the difference. The the hero selection difference. Uh, there will be five different positions in the game mm -hmm. for the players. Like the first patient will be the ADC or the carrier of the team, mm -hmm. and the second patient will be the uh, top top player hero, mm -hmm. most uh, useful for tanky or initiating the team fight. Mm -hmm. Uh, three person will be the mid player, mm -hmm. uh, usually uh, AP carrier, and uh, the <laughs> position four will be the candidate point. Let's see. Who we we have we have the starting lineup right now for China versus Hong Kong China. Mm. You can see in China team, their carrier is long. And uh, their position two is Xiao Hu, position position three Xiao Hao, position four Xiao Yu, and the position five Zik. 
Mm -hmm. And uh, for Hong Kong, China, we have position one long, and position two Zach Kate, uh, position three Roy Deep, and position four Tinky, and position five Martin. Mm. We know China has a lot of domains in uh, this game. Yeah, but uh, we can see like. Uh, I heard like yesterday they said Hong Kong, China has practiced a lot with some other Chinese teams and uh, so maybe we can see a very interesting um, battle here. Well, they learn many some career skills mm -hmm. or team fight skills. Yeah. Just uh, more joking in the team fights. Mm -hmm. Or oh, well, they just uh, rating in the game to make some tactical strength advantage. Yeah, and uh, uh, we can go back to the the hero position. Mm, oh, we can see this is the China Chinese play mm -hmm. on stage. I think it, it's a Chinese carry play. No. They are waiting for the game to start. Okay. Yeah, we can continue on the hero hero position discussion here. Like in Dream Three Kingdoms, the heroes are like uh, it's the game is very heavy based on their carries. Like if your carry is very mm, beefy, uh, you can win the game. Uh, however, the other position, their their role is to help their carry farm enough gold and get uh, the items that they need in very early stage. Yeah, they mm. need to make team fight and a cake in the early stage of the game to make sure their carry can keep farming in the jungle. Yeah, and uh, also there are very important. Uh, resource in the game that is the boss. Mm -hmm. uh, both teams need to kill their boss and uh, get stronger item to make out the advantage of their team, mm -hmm. like uh, the Kirin Arms yep. or the Phoenix Heart. Mm, the boss respawn on both uh, both sides pit at. Uh, uh, three minutes so like the earlier they can get the boss the earlier they can push their turret uh, and get enough uh, gold lead and uh, uh, control the enemy uh, control the enemy jungle so that they cannot farm so the boss resource is so crucial to boss team so the team fight will occur in the boss point in the middle phase of the game, yeah. and then we can see the uh, junking and the tactical about the boss resource. Yeah, and uh, also the third boss is the most crucial, mm, the most crucial like point in the game. Like uh, the first, the third boss, the sixth boss, and so on. They are like the most important boss. Mm, like they always drop the very uh, important item that can push lanes and uh, give very big advantage to the uh, carry heroes. Yeah, they can also get uh, ages from this boss to respond their heroes. Mm -hmm. So they can give the ages to their carrier. Uh, if the, the the counter team will initiate on your carrier because the carry carry player need to make the most uh, damage in your team mm -hmm. he, he can just uh, respawn and uh, give your team some uh, chance to take mistakes yeah we can also talk about the second position they only play on the top lane and the and their role is to harass uh, mostly is to harass the enemy carries farming like they invade the jungle they block their camps so that the enemy carry cannot farm easily yeah, and uh, the position 2 will have a really high magic damage mm -hmm. in the early phase of the game mm -hmm. uh, he will have uh, Position four and uh, position five most supporting in their team mm -hmm. uh, to gank in the early phase and uh, try to invade the jungle of, of their team. Mm -hmm. 
and uh, we can also talk. There's a uh, mm, in this game. There's a uh, wishing. <coughs> there's a wishing. Uh, so that like in the start of the game, the hero can pick one of the wish to like gain some advantage in game. Uh, we can see like uh, most uh, position fight uh, support hero they get the levels uh, there's a wish that can instantly go to level 3 so that they can gain some advantage in like lands to support their heroes and uh, there are also hero talent for the heroes like uh, you can pick some um, some there's only like uh, getting linked to their like movement speed or the life or like some skill enhancements or some other things I think the game is about to start mm -hmm. and uh, there's also many unique item in the game mm -hmm. like most carrier will choose to buy the twin swords mm -hmm to enhance their damage and uh, the position for the kindness position need to buy the kindness item for their team yeah. uh, to take advantage in the team fight yeah. and the position 3 usually is in tanky can, you know, can buy like uh, reflect uh, shields to counter the other team's carrier yeah. so mm. I think like uh, the we can talk about the creeps the I mean the ancients uh, it's a very important resource for the carry to farm like ancients are hard to uh, fight at early stage however um, they give a lot of gold and uh, the um, supports they are also like uh, pulling their camps in early stage and there will also be some essence in the river, like haste essence, investable essence, regen essence, drain essence, and the illusion essence. Mm -hmm. So the boss team need to port wards and uh, make a vision on the river side to uh, struggle with this essence. It's also a very important team fight resource. Yeah. So although like there are ways to like getting 60 kills to win the game, uh, mostly they um, still go push enemy base since it's hard to uh, get 60 kills in one game actually. Uh, uh, very hard to get 60 yeah, kills. Like we can see in the in the Dream Three Kingdom League, mostly they only like get. Uh, uh, maybe like uh, 30 kills for one team in one game only. But in the Asian games, I think uh, China will show show his dominance, mm. and maybe they will get 60 kills to end the game. Uh, we cannot <laughs> expect that actually. Uh, we can see the, the players. This is my maybe communicated with his coach. Yeah, they are waiting for the match to start. Mm -hmm. um, oh, we can see like uh, in this pack. Oh, oh, here comes the drafting um, phase. Yeah, drafting phase. We can see Liu Biao and uh, Wu Yong is banned, and they banned the uh, Yu Ji. Uh, Yu Ji is like the most powerful carry hero in this patch. And uh, turn for China to, to pick, pick their first hero. What will they choose? Most uh, team will choose port first. Uh, so the, their carrier can head in the, in the face of the drafting phase. Yeah. Uh, they pick a dream loop. Let me see. Liu Shan. Yep. Dream Liu Shan. Liu Shan. And uh, turn for the Hong Kong China to mm -hmm. pick their first two heroes. Yep. 
And uh, we can see Jin Liu Shan is like the so Kanye's point. Yeah. Oh, very fast pick. It for the dream role as the mid. Huang Yue is like the most powerful position oh, one hero. A very interesting pick. They pick their mid and the carrier mm -hmm. in the first two pick. Yeah, this gives they some advantage for China to pick some hero, hero to counter? against them to yeah. counter them. Yeah. Uh, and the China choose dream drawing. Zhou Yu. Zhou Yu. Mm. Dream Zhou Yu. Maybe they will choose a top line hero. And uh, Sun Quan. Oh, another support Sun Quan. Sun Quan is like a uh, very good support hero. The okay, they mm. pick Hua Tuo, and I think it's a support hero as well. Hong Kong, China pick very fast in their drafting phase. They yeah. must uh, make a very detailed drafting plan. Uh, I think so. Not time for China to ban their force here. Mm -hmm. Since Hong Kong China has already picked their mid and the carrier, they choose to ban Sun Lu Ban. Yeah. Ah, the last hero. And uh, they banned Yan Liang for Hong Kong. Yan Liang China. is a very good initial hero. The last band. Last band, the band of Yuan. And let's see what's a uh, China band for their last band. Maybe a top line here? Uh, I think so. Mm, the, the Hong Kong China need a tank hero. Yeah, a tank hero. Maybe Huang Gai or Liu Biao. Uh huh. Oh, Liu Biao is already on the main list. The Chen Chen Yu. Uh, they pick uh, Zhang Liao for their fourth pick. Still very fast pick. Mm -hmm. they must have planned it before the match. Yeah, thoroughly. Uh, Zhang Liao is the tanky hero on China. the Hong Kong China side. Uh, China pick Meng Huo. Mm -hmm. they still and last pick, they pick Ma Yun Lu. Ma Yunlu is the uh, very rare pick actually, <laughs> and like it's rarely picking the Dream Three Kingdom League like previous. Mm. Last pick for Hong Kong China. Have a long think, and they choose Sun Jian. Yeah, Sun Jian is the. Uh, Which drafting do you like? For? I think uh, China picked some very, mm, very good heroes, and uh, mm. some of the heroes it's uh, like beyond our expectations. Yeah, China has a very good skill in team fighting, like Sun Quan's out, mm -hmm. and uh, Dream Liu Shan. And the Hong Kong China, they really need to open the game in the early phase. Yeah. They mm. need to build some. Mm. There will be many pressure on their mid. Mm -hmm. Dream Rolly. I think the players is uh, ready to enter the game. Yeah. There will. Okay, here we go into the game. You can see China on the side. Mm. Went to the river. Yep. Have already made the awards. Yep. It's on the top river. Mm -hmm. And uh, Hong Kong China. A very strange move. Usually the wayside will move to their Asian point. Yeah, there are five people they start from the Asian Asian position to get the first uh, uh, essence. Uh, the most group of from China is mm -hmm. in the top lane. Yes. So will the China choose to invade the Asian points of Hong Kong China? Uh, They're just waiting to make words and yeah. make a vision. Maybe just wait for the essence. We'll see who, where will be the first essence. Mm -hmm. 
only five seconds. Game will start. One second. Mm -hmm. Oh, good for Hong Kong China. They are lucky speed essence. Mong Loli just uh, straight into the line. Yeah. Let's see the landing place. Yeah. We'll get the first last hit. Thank you on China side. There are three heroes just starting in the uh, jungle. Uh -huh. And W skill. Mm -hmm. Get the last hit. Roll it. Another double skill. We'll get a level 2. We'll say get a level 2. I think in the draft phase, the Huang Yuying is a better carry than Ma Yunlu, actually. Oh, the Xiao Hu choose to stun Block the their land. Yeah. yeah. So that, but uh, I think it failed. Again, oh. blocks the land. Yeah. Very nice skill. So he can get the. Uh, Full experience of the land. Yeah, they like uh, doing some the middle uh, land. Shaho, mm -hmm. Shaho already level three. And get his portion. He has to recover from the portion. Mm -hmm. I think Shaho is very healthy right now. While the uh, royal lip is uh, like a little bit uh, unhealthy. Mid Xiaohao. Very, very aggressive. Mm -hmm. And Hong Kong China. They don't choose to invade the top player. Yeah. And uh, we can mm. see Dream Liu Shan is uh, very aggressive in land. Xiaohao will get oh. the Guardian Essence in his portion. Mm -hmm. It will fool his portion. Mm -hmm. Uh, we can see like the Huang Yuying is like a little bit uh, uh, ahead of the Wu's carry. Yes. Ma Yunlu is uh, like uh, uh, she cannot farm very fast. Oh, we can see Xiao Hu continue broke his leg. Mm -hmm. The Martin. They're like uh, doing some so that the enemy cannot farm the creeps. Yeah, the, the land is always under his tower. Mm -hmm. Martin can only help with his carry to farm in the creeps. Mm, let's wait the first blood. No. Hard for the Hong Kong to oh get okay. his opening. You can see the... Uh, on both sides the uh, boss has respawned. Yeah, but it's... Uh, very peaceful landing phase. Why they choose to get their boss? It's hard for them to contest at first. You can see China and the uh, Hong Kong China. You choose to farming mm -hmm. in their main jungle. Uh, we can see on the kindness point, uh, uh, the Dream Liu Shan has like build advantage, like uh, nearly seven seven hundred gold. And uh, show how and Ru Yip. Ru Yip. Yeah, Very close. Yeah, China is in invading the, the enemy's ancient side. Yeah. Martin come. Mm -hmm. Only time to see. Yeah. Can you get her initiated? Mm -hmm. No. Yeah. Heavy hammer. Huang Yue Yin. And again, it's UT. Yeah. Nice force bro. I can force bro. Yeah, and uh, and uh, Ru Yip come. Can he get a dick? Xiao come to wait kicks. Oh, no, still died. Can but uh, she cannot make it out. Xiao gets to yeah. show you the zip. That's uh, two for one. Nice play for Hong Kong China. Yeah, however, they do not build a good lead. Xiao Yu come uh, jet back. They cannot escape. And that that will be two. Two versus two. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, yeah, on the top land. Uh, did, yeah, did not link to the uh, Asian side. Xiao Hao try to invade and then make the wards. Yeah, and uh, it's a very good ward. Like uh, many versions. 
in the Hong Kong China station. Mm, however, I think Hong Kong did not uh, like uh, make any words on the enemy side. Yeah, they make a very aggressive operation. Mm, we can they see Dream Liu Shan is very aggressive in land. And that kid cannot escape. Another gink okay. on top lane, Xiao Hu. Yeah, Xiao Hu can. Sh uh, can he make it? Okay. Yes, he can. Yeah, his, okay. his teammate can't. Royal yet. That's a very success gank. Mm -hmm. We can see like China already make uh, 3k league. Uh, Royal yet. She want to harass China's boss fight. She wanna steal the boss. Okay, to escape. Uh, okay, he escaped. Very oh, low. Oh no no. Long. Get Joey up. Yep. But yeah. there are three heroes. He live no out if from the room. Yeah. And uh, I think uh, if you get close to Ma Yunlu, uh, she cannot do enough damage. Yeah, and Huang Yuan is very powerful if yeah, you are uh, Cinco. Yeah, very powerful magic uh, damage on one single hero. Especially in the river. Mm -hmm. Still trying to get the boss. And mm -hmm. Meanwhile, in the bottom line. Yeah. I think China will get the boss. Yeah. They not say the other boss. There However, will be a big team fight here. Yeah. And Xiao Fu jumping and Roy Lip. Oh, that's three hills, but there's a high ground for China. Yeah, they're very hills. Only two hills. And the Sun well, Quan drop the out, and the Xiao Hao. A uh, very good team fight for China. That's not a good place to initiate uh, a team fight for Hong Kong China because China is on high ground yeah, yeah, on the river. They do not make good vision on the uh, Wu side. Maybe they sh should uh, choose to kill their own boss, mm -hmm. or not to invade China's boss point. I think so. Oh, here the kills come to 93. Xiao Hu with Xiao Hao on the top lane again. I think uh, Hong Kong China cannot just. Marty like and Long. Mm -hmm. They're and farming wait. the enemy jungle. However, like China's. Xiao Hao is closing. Yes, farming. everywhere. Get his ulti. However. Can get them. No, yeah, she make and it. Defeat the Dream Liu Shan. Xiao Hao still make damage. Yeah. Still make damage. But That's Huang Yue Ying get Xiao Hao. Oh yeah, here comes Xiao Hu, a counting. nice block. Yeah, Can yeah. he make? No, he missed the E, uh, but the loss still died. Mm -hmm. Royal Lip come later, and he has no mana. Four okay. versus one, and uh, she cannot make it out. Uh, I think that's a good initiation for Hong Kong China. But they, yeah, they, they he should uh, they should choose leave when yeah. they get first kill. They like they stay in the enemy jungle for too long. Yeah. They should get the first kill and then retreat. China. China's and that's our next is very fast. Mm. And we can see the net worth difference. It's like already nearly uh, 10k lead for China. Stranger. And Roy Roy Lip. Lip in the driver. Mm -hmm. And we can see the goal difference. Dream Zhou Yu is already built a 3k lead. In the mid, uh, yeah, and uh, the team knight was already 10k. Shelf, mm -hmm. very nice play on the top lane. Almost to clear every landing. Almost, uh, China almost uh, gets tied to tower in yeah. the bottom lane. Hong Kong China still trying to organize a new. And we can see Huang Yuan's build is very interesting. Oh, Xiao Hu! Oh, very Xiao. nice broke, but where is his teammate? Yeah. Here comes Xiao Yu. Yeah. Only two? Uh, his teammate is still oh, in Huang the. Huang dropped the out. Uh, three, three teammates. Oh, they are rushing the, the Hong Kong's boss. Yeah. Uh, that's why Xiao Hu breaking. I just mm. want to. Uh, let's continue our discussion. Like we can see, why she build a blink, which is very no. rare. Yeah. Oh, we can see mm. <laughs> Dream Lolly is down again. 
custom. Yeah, Huang she... Yuying is a very fragile hero. Yeah, but she people she wanna like invade the uh, follow his her teammates to like do enough damage. Or maybe just play key in the back end of the China team mm -hmm. and get uh, like a Sun Quan. We can see Xiao Hao is like invading <laughs> the enemy aggressive. base again. Almost on tie to tower. Oh my god. Nobody can stop him. Mm -hmm. It's a very aggressive dream Zhou Yu. And the China trying to push the mid tower. Mm -hmm. I think the Hong Kong gold China. league is enough for China to like do some harassment. But Hong Kong China organize a defense in the mid tower. Yeah, I think China just wait for well, the second boss to respawn. Very stubborn. Three hills <laughs> make difference here. China just try choose to invade the main jungle. Yeah, maybe to the top lane. And we can see Xiao Hu is uh, like uh, solo pushing their enemy top tower. Four heals for China. Mm -hmm. Can they Take get it. Jersey? Yeah, no. blink it out. Blink out. So oh. they can get top tower easily. Uh, we can see Huang Yuying already build the. So uh, it's choky. Yeah. The main jungle. And can leave? No, no too much damage. But the Huang Yuying, oh, that's not a very nice yeah, ulti. She missed the out mostly. <laughs> I'll live here, very low, but still alive. Yeah, I think Huang Yuying is like uh, very... His blink choice is not very good. Yeah, but uh, she's a little bit uh, too powerful right now. She got the uh, magic uh, immune item, mm, yeah. so she can do some oh. aggressive move in team fight. Since Huang Yuying has no ult, trying to choose to push mid, a nice initiation. And uh, it will be a follow up kill and get a tower to tower. Already blinked into the enemy high ground. Will that be the end of the match? Yeah. Really powerful skill for China. Yeah, it's like yeah. already a 25 goal lead, uh -huh. 25k goal lead for the China. Retreat will be. We get another tight tower. Mm -hmm. Can Dream Lolly make it out? No, no, no. not Dream. Long. Uh, Still under the tower. Long very. Okay. Aggressive, but Huang in out. Yeah, and high damage. I think uh, Long. Oh, Whoa. she's China still on still ground. Yeah, they still choose yeah. to keep this team fighting. <laughs> the, the the life leech is like but too high for her. Boom, still alive. Yeah, yeah. she's Very still high damage oh and make god. a lot of lead. Oh my god! Oh my god! Long, very powerful. You can see like and she's perfect, yeah, perfect she's skill casting and a powerful item make him alive mm -hmm. in this team fighting. And he came back to their own side and get the boss. Yep. And right now we can see it's like uh, 30k gold lead for China. <laughs> I think they just need to get the boss easily. Yeah. You can see the carry of China alone mm -hmm. already 25 25k gold. That is very horrible carry. I think Two item it. difference on the so carry. How? Huang Yuying with his OT button, there will there be enough damage? No, no. Xiao Hu get a nice block. Almost every hero is broken in yeah. his skill. A nice skill casting. And we can see Xiao Hao make it, Xiao still alive. Almost everyone of Hong Kong China is down. 
I think we they like with all the uh, all the skills on Xiao Xiao Hu, yeah. but they do not make it. His item is too good. Mm -hmm. uh, not enough damage for Hong Kong China to kill Xiao Hu. I think it's a GG call for Wayside. Maybe, uh, maybe last two fights. Yeah, Hong Kong China. It's yeah. like the dominant every land and every team fight in the game. Choose to retreat and then oh, that's another I attack. think they just need to push the bottom land and uh, push both lands. Yes, they are just push lands. Mm -hmm. The pinking and then initiation. Oh my god. Xiao Hao, very low. But still get, can he get Xiao Hao? No. no. Oh my god. Xiao Hao's damage is too high and he get a leech. Hmm. Still alive in the battlefield. I think uh, Dream Lolly made oh. very poor decisions in team fight. Like she always dive and uh, do not make the kill. His normal is not good. We can get enough damage. Mm -hmm. And uh, she cannot make it out always. China. No. Group in the bottom line. Mm -hmm. B. They will choose Xiao Hu here. Breaking in. Oh my god. In five heroes. Yeah. Where is the teammates? Come here. Xiao Yu. Mm -hmm. uh, Xiao Hu, nice block. Huang Yuyun with his ulti. Long is it's low. Xiao Yu is so tanky, no damage for Hong Kong China. Yeah, they can and not uh, get close to Long a little bit. Long is not even in the battlefield, he is still in the middle land. Yeah, she she just need to push the enemy base, the towers. The the Golden Gate is mm. too large. China even don't need their carrier to win the team fight. Oh my god. That that is it. That, that will is be a massacre, actually. <laughs> I think that will be the end of this game. Mm -hmm. uh, they are still defending the base. However, it's like barely make any difference. Another nice initiation with mm -hmm. Royal Yep. Royal Yep. Escape with his ult. Uh, China choose to push the top lane. The last tower. Uh, last tower, last barracks. Hong Kong China, no damage here. Show mm how -hmm. oh, in the tower. Oh Four tower. God. Nice block. Hong Yuying out, no damage here. The gold gap is too large. Mm -hmm. Can even not kill Sun, Sun Quan's out. They just need to wreck the enemy base. <laughs> Everyone is done, only Martin. Martin is still on the. <laughs> Stay in the fountain mm -hmm. to respawn. For Hong Kong China, that will be the last fight. Yeah. The base is under attack. Yeah, the base is half HP. Uh, they're pushing again. Oh, nice they, oh, they got, get, yeah, get they got Xiao Hao, uh, which is very good. However, Long is uh, like uh, undefeated in ground. Yeah, they have no more damage here. The base, yeah, the base is down. Base is down. Congratulations minutes. to China. China for the first game win. Uh, very good game for China. They dominant the draft phase and they dominant the early game. And uh, yeah, what do you think for the first game? I think Xiao Hu has had a very nice choice to block the first three lands mm -hmm. in the landing phase, mm -hmm. so he can get a very high experience. Yeah. And the Martin cannot gank him on the landing phase. I think Marine Lu is a very good pick for China since like uh, yeah. they need to blink in and Marine Lu can do the uh, the magic uh, uh, they can he, she can do very high physical damage and in the uh, team fight and then, and then he is just uh, too rich in the game yeah China make very good team fight choices however like Hong Kong China they do not make any mm, but, uh, but uh, Hong Kong should uh, very aggressive give play yeah. in the match 
Yeah, we can see like China is like very do very dominant in the early phase, so they can only do a little bit uh, aggressive move to see if they can make some miracles actually. But uh, they are in the Hong Kong China. Their mm. initial choice is not very good, especially mm. in the boss point. Yeah, the river. They choose to rush into the high ground of China. I think Hua Tuo is not a very good choice, since mm, Hua Tuo can only do some recovery mm -hmm. for the enemy hero. However, but no they, damage. For yeah, him. no damage for him actually. And mm -hmm. also, we can see like. Uh, Dream Liu Shan is very aggressive in land and make a lot of good team fights. But Hong Kong China still should be uh, aggressive. Mm -hmm. And we can see Meng Huo is a very good pick in land. Like uh, he blocked a lot of uh, creeps in land so that the enemy's uh, first position hero cannot farm. So they cannot build their cannons very soon. Like yeah. in the early phase. Yeah, and then take uh, many advantage in the early phase team fight. Yep. Yeah, I think both team has a very powerful execution pro. Yeah. They are uh, just execution, they are drifting strategy. And but China just uh, get a uh, nice skill, mm -hmm. uh, like team fight mm -hmm. and uh, skill casting. Yeah, so I think uh, uh, in the second game they need to make some, um, maybe in the drafting phase they need yeah. to pick more uh, maybe tanky heroes or some hero that can save the uh, save their heroes uh, to like uh, do counter initiations. And maybe they shouldn't pull their carry and uh, mid in the first two pick. That's mm -hmm. very easy for China to counter their carry. Yeah, I think so. He continues to pick. Mm -hmm. uh, but I still like Hong Kong China's choice. Yeah. They show many a great question and uh, didn't. And uh, Hong Kong China don't uh, should show any scared of the power for China team. I think like uh, the Hong Kong China Smith uh, play a little bit poorly. Okay. Okay. There will be some highlights of okay. the last match. Mm -hmm. Coming soon. We will see here.
Welcome back. And so nice highlights of the last game. Mm -hmm. And uh, there will be the second game of the best of three for China versus Hong Kong China. Mm -hmm. And we can see the China shoes are very powerful and the excellent team execution. Yeah. But uh, the Hong Kong China is uh, resistant. Is also very good. Yeah, I think uh, the I like their spread. Yeah, I think their drafting phase they yeah. show some very good uh, logic uh, uh, in the early phase, and uh, they know they should play a little bit aggressively in lane, both lanes and in draft phase. Yeah, and they got first blood in the game. Mm -hmm. And uh, they are like invading the China's jungle very early in game. However, the the skill gap is a little bit large for both teams. Maybe they should choose some tanky hero mm -hmm. to make an advantage in yep. the middle phase of the game mm -hmm. in a team fight. Yep, and they need to make some solutions to the carrier player of China Long. Yep. I think I he's think too powerful in yeah. the last game. Yeah. I think he's just free farming their jungle in the first game. And uh, Hong Kong China cannot do some uh, uh, like harassment, like useful harassment in the jungle to stop him from farming. Yeah. Because China has a very good defense mm -hmm. of their jungle. Yeah. Maybe they should, maybe they should choose farming their own jungle and uh, buy some item to counter the lost hero. And uh, also, like uh, during the uh, very early team fight in the uh, like uh, in the Wu's uh, hero uh, the the boss pit, uh, the. Uh, Hong Kong's choice is not very good. They do not have vision on the high ground, and they still choose to jump in. Especially Dream Lolly, like uh, she did a lot of silly moves in the team fight. Actually, yeah, they are a little bit cautious in the game, and I think uh, they could just uh, kill their boss first, mm -hmm. and uh, they can make a more jail Duke in the team fight mm -hmm. try to counter attack the China's initiation because we can also see China's uh, initiation is very aggressive mm -hmm. and uh, sometimes only one or two hills. Maybe Hong Kong should like uh, choose to change their strategies. Uh, they just babysit their mm -hmm. uh, carry and yeah. uh, farm in their mm -hmm. jungles. Yeah. And uh, do not do a lot of invade in enemy jungle. Maybe they should be more patient, mm -hmm. waiting for their carrier from enough item. Yeah. And um, make a uh, good position with best vision to make team fights. And especially their visions, they did yeah. not put a lot of force in their, uh, both in their uh, side and in enemy side. Mm, yeah, we can see in the in the game, Xiao Hu always invade, invades the uh, Asian points of mm -hmm. Hong Kong China and make some vision. Mm -hmm. So the China, oh, well, the China always know what is Hong Kong China doing. Yeah, and, and uh, also Hong Kong, their uh, their heroes' position are always not very good. So, like the. Uh, like China's hero can always control uh, two or three heroes, and uh, yeah. always their uh, yeah. carry or their main hero are controlled. Yeah, and uh, so they cannot do enough damage, or they cannot juke the enemy heroes. I think that's because of the nice play or playing of Xiao Hu. Yeah, I think so. Very, very powerful in Asia 18. Mm -hmm. yeah. Always broke more than two heroes mm -hmm. of Hong Kong China. Yeah. Uh, so think, uh, maybe they can choose some flexible uh, heroes mm, uh, either like to escape and retreat from the battlefield. Yeah, I think uh, maybe during second game they can pick a Guoja, which is very good for their uh, like uh, because the China 
playstyle is very aggressive, and、uh. Guo Jia can counter their、uh, playstyle very good. Yeah, and、uh, and、uh, for their carrier,、uh, I think、uh, he shouldn't buy the blink deck anymore.、Mm -hmm. Maybe just、uh, play a little bit,、uh, mm -hmm. a little bit of juking,、mm -hmm. just、yeah. waiting for the. Wait, waiting for the China to attack their team、yeah. and make damage. I think Luo Li is also a very good pick for Hong Kong China.、Uh, since Luo Li Sao can control the、uh, heroes and、uh, so that they cannot escape, and it's but it's also very good for Zhu King.、Uh, But、uh, Loli requires very high playing skills.、Uh, yeah, that's another thing to <laughs> say. Actually, <laughs> a very hard hero to play.、Mm -hmm. And、uh, I think Sun Huan is also a very good hero since uh, uh, she、uh, he's got a lot of、uh, escape skills that you need. Or maybe they can just、uh, pick Sun Quan. Yeah, I think because so. Because in the last game, yeah, Sun Quan. China, yeah, and then make many advantage in the team fight for China、mm -hmm. because Sun Quan's ult is very powerful. Yeah, and、uh, they can do the control, they can do the stun very good, and、uh, Sun Quan's uh, uh, union, uh, the minion of the ult is very good for pushing and、uh, doing the team fight as well. Yeah. So they can farm for Hong Kong China. They can farm more、mm -hmm. in the early game. Yeah, waiting for their crucial items.、Mm -hmm. And、uh, I think China can still waiting for what will Hong Kong China pick、mm -hmm. in the game, and choose some hero to counter the Hong Kong China's picking.、Mm -hmm. And、But、we can see in last game, like both team are like doing very aggressively. So the game like ends at、uh, maybe 19 minutes. Yeah, we can see the statistic、uh, of the last game.、Mm -hmm. China doing 44 kills,、uh, which is very like a real thing in the、yeah. uh, professional game. Hong Kong China do.、Uh, Hong Kong China was doing good in the early game. Yeah, however, no, however, when it comes to the team fight,、mm -hmm. China. Uh, China totally dominated the battlefield. Yeah,、And、they have seventeen assistants in the game.、Mm -hmm. And the one hundred. It's nearly a sixty lead. MVP, MVP will be long, surely. Very powerful player. Yeah, we can see during the top lane one team fight. Uh, she's like one versus five. Yeah,、uh -huh. and the、no. life leech for her is very,、uh, like we can see at one time. Yeah, she's very low, nearly dying.、Mm. However, like leeching for her is very high. Too high damage and too high leech.、Mm -hmm. Almost the invectors in the game. Long,、yeah. a very nice player for a carry. And、uh, she. Two parts in most of the team fights. Once she's in the battleground, yeah, she's like undefeated. One hundred and fifteen.、Uh, that is a horror.、Mm -hmm. Which is very good. Can see play the player、him. is waiting for the second game to start.、Mm -hmm. uh, that is long a China's carrier. Yeah. Mm, let's see what Hong Kong China gonna do in the second draft phase. The Hong Kong China's player is still very calm. Yeah, I think they expect the、uh, the first game gonna be a very hard game for them. Communication with、mm. their coach. Yeah, and、uh, we can see like.、Uh, Let's continue a little bit discussion on the hero positions, like uh, uh, the the support. We can see in the last game, the support heroes are very mm, mm, very active in games. Actually, Hua Tuo has、mm, so much damage in the、yeah. game. Yeah, Hua Tuo is not a really good pick for. 
and the Hong Kong mm. things. Because Hong Kong play very aggressive in the early game, but the Hua Tuo can just uh, cannot catch up to them. Like yeah. she, uh, he did not have any like uh, uh, blink skills, and uh, he cannot uh, follow their team mates while they are retreating. Yeah. Like you cannot do the healing anymore. Mm, yeah, I think if. Hong Kong still choose to pick Hua Tuo, they should focus more on the team fights, but not gank and early phase of the game. Mm -hmm. Maybe they can pick Guo Jia or Cao Zhi. Okay, we can see the second uh, draft phase is already on. Yeah. And, uh, on Wei side, they banned Huang Weiying and uh, Yu Ji and Jun Guan Yu. Yeah, China bans. Almost carry and mid hero. Yeah. Turn for Hong Kong China to pick. They pick Liu Biao first. Uh, yeah, they no, they did not. Uh, they doesn't. Uh, they don't uh, pick uh, carry or mid in the first to pick Liu Biao is a very good team fight point and a tanky hero. Yeah, I agree so. And uh, Gu Yong. China pick Gu Yong. Gu Yong is like one of the best support hero right now in this yeah. match. Still pick a support first for China. Mm. That's may, maybe still Dream Liu Shan. Yeah. I think there are still a very good hero remaining in the game. Maybe uh, they can be up. Oh. It's a Dream Zhang. Let's wait for Hong Kong second and third pick. Okay, it's a very rare pick for China. Dream Zhang Shao. And uh, uh, they can, it's a heal healing hero and uh, he can do some stuns. Uh, very powerful in team fight. So, Pu Yuan is coming. Uh -huh. Hong Kong China. This is Pu Yuan. Pu Yuan is a very good. Uh, Pu Yuan can make a lot of damage, mm -hmm. but it's very hard to play in the mid. Uh, maybe they just put him, put him in uh. the carry pick. Dream Xiao Qiao. Mm. And let's see what China pick for the so third pick. So the Pu Yuan will maybe will be the carry. Mm -hmm. and so the they pick Ma Yi. Turn for Hong Kong China to ban because uh, China still need their mm -hmm. carrier. Yan Liang, Hong Kong China ban Hong Kong China ban Yan Liang in their first game. Yeah. With their upgrade of some very powerful initiating game, yeah. uh, initiating heroes in the game. I think they just play a little bit uh, passively in the early phase for uh, Hong Kong China right now. Yeah, because they choose Liu Biao. Mm -hmm. Liu Biao is a uh, defense hero. Mm -hmm. Okay. T turn for China to pick. Sma Yi is. Mm. They pick Yuan Shao. Very quick pick. Yep. I think they put uh, Yuan Shao as the turn for Hong Kong China. Mm -hmm. Two picks. They still need their. They still need their Kenneth point. Yep. I think. I think Hong Kong China still choose to pick Kara first and they leave the support pick in the last two pick. Yeah. If they can pick some support hill to counter uh, Gu Yong. Maybe oh, Hua Tuo again. Again Hua Tuo. But uh, this time Hua Tuo with Liu Biao. Mm -hmm. That will be a very tanky in the team fight. And uh, Guan Yu is the last pick. Guan Yu, Liu Biao, Hua Tuo. Really tanky. Mm -hmm. Hong Kong China. Make another drafting plan. I think we, uh, I mean China, cannot uh, do very aggressive in the early phase. Maybe. Yeah. 
Oh, I'm trying to choose the uh, plan B. Mm -hmm. Use tanky hills mm -hmm. and uh, let uh, Puyuan farming. Yeah, and I think Sima Yi is very. Zhu Rong. Yeah. Zhu Rong. That's also a very good pick, pick. Uh, for China. Zhang Xun, Zhang Shao, and Zhu Rong. I think no. Sima Yi can counter the tanky hero very well in yeah. lane. Mm -hmm. My is out. Yeah. It's also a counter to Liu Biao. Mm -hmm. However, we do not know like uh, which lane he goes. I think he should be the mid lane. Yeah, I think so. And the uh, Zhu Rong for carry. Mm -hmm. We can see the player already in the game. Mm -hmm. Very confidence. Here we go. Uh, I'm now Hong Kong is like gathering the uh, bottom essence point. Yeah. And only their mid yeah. hero in and the make towards mm -hmm. on the top of the river, waiting yeah. for the essence. Mm -hmm. Xiao Hu here. Yeah, and uh, waiting for someone to invade the Asian grips. Yeah. Nobody come. Hong Kong, mm -hmm. China, mm -hmm. just stay on their own side yeah. on the high ground. I and uh, they, they don't make any words here. Yeah, I think Smai is played as. Now Xiao Hao was here. Oh, okay. He saw the Hong Kong China's hero. Mm -hmm. they, can, they can see the Hong Kong Martin hero. and the room here. Mm -hmm. Are they contacting for the first So China, China want to get this essence point. They want to get the both essence point. Xiao Hu waiting for the essence to refresh. Yep. Only eight seconds. Eight seconds. You can see Martin and the Long. Mm -hmm. Now they're there. Long come here. Guardian mm -hmm. essence. Yeah, uh, they're waiting Hon for maybe their carry to gather it. Hong Kong trying to get to the force essence in the last game. Very lucky for Tim. Mm -hmm. Okay, we can see the lines coming. Mm -hmm. And we can play. see Smaggy's play as the kindness point. Ryu Yap and Xiao Hao. Nice. W for Ryu Yap. Yeah. Xiao Hao on the high ground mm -hmm. of the wall. Yeah. Oh, another W. We're already level 2. Mm -hmm. Make a lot damage. Only half our HP in the land. We need his portion. How so level 2? Oh, we so attack attacked by the tower. Yeah. That's not very good. And I'm just done. Yeah, she's controlled. Yo ho. Don't want to royal yep to get his luck hit. Royal yep miss a skill. Xiao Hao very aggressive, but meanwhile the bottom line. Xiao Hu, Xiao Hu is very low. Martin, a nice game choice. Again, Hong Kong trying to get the first, first blood. blood. In bottom line, Xiao Hao will make his advantage here. Yep. Royal yep. Hard to get the last hit and on lands and once she's on the land she got harassed. Him almost out of the barons Yeah. It's like a two two levels lead for mid for China. Oh uh. he chose to <laughs> back home yeah. with a boss. And uh, yep come down. Mm -hmm. To the river. Yeah. Xiao Hao. Don't want him to see the creeps. Oh, again, use his skill. Mm -hmm. Ref, very aggressive. Royal Yip only level 3. Yeah. And his FTP is too low to back to the land. Yeah, she can barely make any last hit on land. And. Uh, Yip use his skill. He denied this. Denied. Nice mm -hmm. dinner for it. We can see. Let's defeat the Liu Biao. Yeah. Zhang, Zhang Zhao is like uh, defeated by Liu Biao in lane. Liu Biao 
up uh, under his own tower. Show yeah. how very aggressive. And Again, here, com here comes Xiao Hu. Uh, Xiao Hu take down the enemy hero first. Uh, so this time the <laughs> Hong Kong China's strategy is focused on the bottom lane. Yeah, I think so. Oh, Sma Yi defeated Guan Yu in lane. Meanwhile, solo kill for Xiao Hu. Okay, so it's so making some progression in every lane for China. Xiao Hu is chasing. Zero. Yeah, Xiao Hu is already level 6. Yeah. Is and there any teammates? Yeah, it's tricky. He's still chasing. Xiao Hu oh my chasing god. Chasing into tower. Oh my god. Gets a god. kill. Where are the teammates? Uh, I think they cannot provide any heal for him in lane. But uh, it's like level 3. They already make like a 4k lead for them. Yeah, and uh, 6. Six kills versus two kills for China. I think China. Uh, Hong Kong is playing a little passively in there. Yeah, However, definitely. like China is like invading everywhere. Yes, the hero choice is much pos more possible than the last game. Mm -hmm. Now comes Chunqi versus Xiao Hu. Uh -huh. Xiao Hu can you get get? Yes, enough damage. Ah, he solo killed him again. Mm -hmm. Should that be a third solo kill for Xiao Hu? Yeah, I think so. Oh, Xiao Hu are very poor player. In the last game, he played Meng Huo on, mm -hmm. the, uh, on the top lane. Also, it gets very useful in the mid game. Okay, so. Royal Yep, only level 5. Mm -hmm. No ulti for Royal yeah, Yep. Can he escape? Again. Oh no. And we can get it, Xiao Hu in the yes. jungle. Al and Xiao although Xiao Hu is low, but uh, Tinky cannot uh, recovery make the kill very already. low. And he get enough damage. Xiao Hu is still yes. running. Yeah, yeah, he's down and he got a kill. Uh, finally, finally. I think uh, Xiao Hu is play a little bit carelessly. China choose to lost their boss. Yeah. Uh, I think Hong Kong China should focus more on their own boss. Mm -hmm. And uh, let's lay the boss first. And oh, uh, yeah. Yep. Uh, again. Can she make it out? No. Oh, that's too bad for Xiao Hao. Mm -hmm. Almost uh, crushed the Royal Yep in the Madeland. Yeah, we can see the network is already making 7k lead. Xiao Wei. Xiao Hu don't want Tian King to go. Xiao Hu. Okay. Again. Tian King blink it out. Can she Again, make it? Again, kill no, Tian King. On. Under the, just under the Hong Kong tower. Yeah. And that is, uh, is like a three level, three yeah. level behind yeah. Xiao Yu. China, mm. mid, mid, China makes a very huge gap in the middle line and the bottom line. Yeah, we can see Sma Yi is very powerful in land. Maybe, oh, and we can see the three, three man gang. Can Xiao here. Hu. Can you get Xiao Hu? Yeah. But Xiao Hao is on the way. Oh. Fu Yuan's ulti. Yeah. Xiao Hu is down. Can However, Xiao get yeah, Xiao Hao is like, oh, Xiao Hao is down as well. However, one she take one. Uh, yeah. one. Yeah. And uh, Xiao Yu Dik just farming in the Asian yeah, jungle. We can see the top turret for Wu is already taken down by Sma Yi. And uh, they're trying to uh, steal <laughs> the <laughs> enemy boss, maybe. No. Mm -hmm. They retreat and. Uh, oh, they're pushing the second tower. Yes, maybe. and the uh, Xiao Hao here. Uh -huh. Again, Trinky. Why? There's so many hill. Just yeah. under my tower again and, and again. Is caught. Martin is dead. Can Trinky escape? No. Oh, meanwhile, no. on the top lane. Yeah, Jack it. Uh, can he make it out? No. Uh, okay. Long. Yeah. Very However, aggressive. Dream Xiao Chao is uh, almost against Dream Xiao Chao. Yeah, they do not want yes. to like do the. Uh, to tower is done. Yeah, they they focus on tower first. So that they can control the enemy uh, boss easily. Get uh, Hong Kong's Asian creeps, maybe boss. We can see uh, they make very deep 
uh, style They are rushing tone. to the boss point. Mm -hmm. Get it? Hong Kong. Mm. Hong Kong China, get the link. They wanna steal the can boss. Can Hong Kong get the team fight? Four versus three. Uh, yeah, nice salt. Oh, they already get Zeke. Zeke but is but almost one. done. Is yeah. he? Yes, he's done. But However, like a China. Xiao Hu, Xiao Hu come here. Yeah, and Roy Leaf is very low. She yeah. come back and uh, discovered that Roy no one is here. Whip. Yeah, and she's retreat. escaping and Xiao Hu is doing the ta chasing. Still chasing, try to find the room. And, and uh, we can see on the front battleground, like China is like everywhere. Still chasing trick. Mm -hmm. Why there are so many people chasing me? And uh, let's get. Yeah, we can see on like each hero's gold lead. And get Xiao Hu. Can they kill Xiao Hu? No image? No damage here? I think oh, blinking. I think China again. Item is like China is all almost uh, on the high ground. Then. Yeah, they are owning the team. Almost China. twenty k gold. Gate. Yeah, I think we can just like push their high ground easily. Xiaohao, Xiaohao, very down? low. No. And get the uh, recovery. Yeah. Xiao Yu is so controlled, however. So less damage for Hong Kong, China. They cannot get any one of China. Yeah. Everyone was survived in this team fight. Mm -hmm. And uh, oh, here comes Xiao Hu. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, here comes Xiao Hao, very aggressive playing and uh, kill the enemy on the high ground of Hong Kong. Yep. Again, he found the Royal. Yep. Yep. Can he escape? Yep. Xiao Hu. Jumps in and the main attacks a better tower, on. but still survive. Mm -hmm. No damage here for Hong Kong China again. Oh, we can see smile. Oh, nice see. initiation. Xiao Hu, can he got the roof? Chen She got it. Chen Qi, Chen Qi, Chen Qi on the tower again. Chen Qi. Chen Qi is down. Are they pushing the high ground? They can push the high ground. I think they need Roll to wait yep. for the creep wave. Royal yep. Yeah. Nice skill costing, but uh, his level is too low, only level 9. I think Hong Kong can send someone to cut the creep waves. Mm. There, creep waves is uh, on the tower. Yeah. Like Hong Kong cannot get into their own jungle. Yeah, I think it's gonna be a very quick. Uh, oh. The version for Hong Kong is stuck everywhere. Mm -hmm. They don't know where China is. Hiding. <laughs> Not hiding. They're like they can barely make one kill right now. Xiao Hao again. Okay. Solo kill for Xiao Hao. Really a uh -huh. uh, that's, a big, that's a huge mid here. Yeah. Yeah. China tried to push. They are pushing their bottom tower. Jadik. Get in, but no enough damage. I thought for Pugan. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This time, five people, five heroes, almost there. Can they long? Yes. And nice team Xiao fight, Hao. but uh, Xiao Hu already, already getting here. Xiao Hu uh, again got to roll you. Yep. And uh, Xiao Hu is too tanky and uh, make it and make uh. two more damage here. Yeah. Everyone in Hong Kong China is down. Though they get a nice initiation in this team fight and uh, get long first today, but uh, Xiao Hu is too powerful. Yeah. Xiao Hu is down by a uh, I think so. Xiao, Xiao Hu is down by the tower tech. Mm -hmm. Don't come back with his port. China want to take this tower for tour. Tower. So they are taking down the barracks. And the barracks. Uh, every hero for Hong Kong is one. Here comes again initiation. Nice initiation. Xiao Hao. And the get level one. Is like oh, nice team fight and skill costing for China. Every every man in Hong Kong China is down. Yeah. We can get a response to crack it for their level is too low. Yeah. Uh, uh, so they're doing it. damage, but the damage is too low. 
I think they use the King Xiao Chao out. Again, Xiao Hu jumps nice. in. Nice initiation, almost in the fountain. Oh my Can they come back in the fountain? No. No. Again, everyone's done. Yeah. Oh, this is really, I really brutal play for China. Yeah, I think they just need to push the mid towers. Who blinking again to find anyone is in the towers to tower? Yeah, they just need to no. harass the Hong Kong like uh, hero back so that they can push the barracks. Get okay, mid barracks. Again, self blinking to initiate. They got Guan Yu. So, are they pushing the base? Nothing Hong Kong can do here. Yeah. Okay. More damage, their level is too low. They their carrier is too poor. Mm -hmm. Again, nice initiation and out here from the Smiley. China is still, still on the battlefield. Yeah. They get the last high ground tower and the last bricks. I think after 8 minutes, like uh, uh, Hong Kong, China only make uh, 3 kills maybe. Yeah, and it's already like uh, 50 gold lead for, okay. for China. China. Okay. Can, can it get in? Yes. Yeah. Xiao Hu is lonely in the middle and he got caught. Xiao playing too high in this game. Mm -hmm. On China, choose t uh, they choose plan B, choose tanky hero in mm -hmm. this game. However, it does not make any difference actually. They even lose uh, advantage in the landing phase. Yeah. Like in last game, the landing phase is maybe, uh, I, I would say, even. Yes, even. And uh, almost 41 streaks for China in this mm. game. Yeah, right now, Hong Kong China, China cannot leave their high ground. Hong Kong China still try to resist, but can they get enough damage? Nice. We take down. No, no. Xiao Hao again. Oh, oh Xiao Hao nice salty. Yeah. Xiao Hao is down. And, and Xiao Hu. Long. <laughs> oh, here comes Long. Yeah, carry is uh, too powerful. Yeah. Okay, here we want. And Long has not many magic. Mm -hmm. I think China yeah. picked very interesting two uh, heroes. Uh, Zhu I mean, two carries. Zhu Rong and the uh, last game, Marin Lu. Yes, mm -hmm. this is also a very interesting pick I to counter the tanky hero in the game. Yes. And uh, this game, China picked Sima Yi, which is very good in the landing phase. Yes, I'm out for Sima Yi. They're pushing the enemy base. base. So the attack by China, very mm -hmm. low here. Mm -hmm. China still resistance down. And the base the is down. Good. Congrats, China, for their victory in the best of three. Yeah, series. very good gameplay. Mm, and uh, in, I think it only takes like 40 minutes for this best of three. Yeah. And uh, I but think Hong Kong, they expect their loss, maybe. Yeah, still seems very happy. Uh, I think that's a spread of the Asian games. Mm -hmm. I think they just need to do a little yeah. bit better in the later games. They still have chance. Yeah, they got detailed plan. Mm -hmm. And they know what to pick and choose in the game. Yeah. Just the uh, uh, gameplay skill is too far away from the China players. Yeah. But still, they uh, show a very excellent team execution capability mm -hmm. in the gameplay. And in the first game, they built some advantage in the early phase. Yeah, and uh, they got first brother in both both games. Yeah, and uh, I think like uh, they maybe they can win the fall, uh, like later games today and maybe tomorrow. Yeah, mm -hmm. I think they are still very talented players. Yeah, and they has a very good team. But we can like discuss a little bit about uh, the game choose picks. 
I think Pu Yuan did not make very good uh, uh, <coughs> plays in the. No. Uh, we can see Pu Yuan make a lot of damage. That uh, should be the Hong Kong's plan, but uh, Pu Yuan is too fragile. Yeah. Uh, well, is they die in the team fights? Yeah. And uh, almost uh, every time Xiao Fu can Pu Yuan, the Pu Yuan is just down. Yeah. And uh, also, like. Uh, uh, Hong Kong China is doing damage in the uh, like uh, we can see in high ground they are like uh, spamming the skills on China's heroes however uh, we can see it here they do not do a lot of damage um, I expect that's the gold league and uh, the XP lead for China yeah. like it's way too high for them yeah Hong Kong China can get only one hero mm. in the China's team yeah. Like uh, Xiao Hu or Xiao Hop, <laughs> the long will come come lately and mm -hmm. get everyone down. And also, I think Sma is a very interesting pick mm. and made very yeah. good play for China. Uh, Hong Kong pick a lot of tanky heroes, however, yeah. uh, Sma is a very good counterpoint for yeah. China to counter the Hong Kong's heroes. Yeah, Sma Yi, Sma Yi's ult almost uh, ruined uh, mm. Liu Biao. Yeah, and also the passive is very powerful in land. Yeah. And we can see like uh, he like versus Guan Yu in the top lane. However, uh, Guan Yu is like three level behind him after maybe seven or eight minutes. Mm. Yeah, and uh, they and China make uh, uh, many advantages in landing phase mm -hmm. uh, in the mid lane and the bottom lane. Yeah, I think <laughs> they know that uh, Hong Kong gonna play a little bit passively in yeah. the second game. Uh, so yeah. they play more aggressively. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, very nice drifting strategy mm -hmm. for China. And uh, also Zhu Rong and uh, Ma Ying Lu. I really like these two pick for their carry heroes. Mm, especially Ma Ying Lu in the first game, <laughs> like yeah. uh, we can see the. Oh, there will be uh, highlights of the last games. Mm -hmm. uh, let's
come back. Where is the plan? The highlights of the last game. Mm -hmm. I like Shaw's place dive very yeah. upset and uh, almost uh, uh, ruined the trick in the landing phase. Uh, yeah. We so do Shaw how do in the landing phase? And Shaw yeah. how is doing very good in landing, and uh, we we do see like Hong Kong China is play a little bit better, like uh, in the second game they. Their drafting is uh, like uh, sort of more thoroughly in the second pick. However, they do not expect Ma Yi and uh, maybe yeah. Fu Rong for China for their second pick. Yeah, who do you think will be the MVP of this game? <coughs> I do not know. <laughs> maybe Lang? Maybe? I think uh, I prefer Xiao Hu because he's playing in the lining is rarely straight mm -hmm. yeah. and. You know, there's almost uh, two or three hills yeah. on his land. And uh, he's trying to play him back. Yeah. And uh, also, mm, during drafting phase, I do not know why uh, Hong Kong China likes Hua Tuo this much. Mm. Maybe Hua Tuo can do a lot of healing. However, I, like in both mm. games, I cannot see like uh, Hua Tuo is doing very critical uh, by doing very important uh, healing in the like maybe team fighting phase maybe they they just uh, think uh, Hua Tuo is a good point yeah. for Cantonese and uh, they can make their team fight uh, make a juke easily yeah. but the team fight skill for China yeah. is far uh, too much higher than the Hong Kong China once they do the damage, uh, once they do the they healing, the China do more damage yeah. actually. The initiation is really good for China. Hua Tuo can hardly to save any hero in one team fight. Yeah, I think so. That's a very nice team execution for China. Yeah. When they get an initiation, everyone just uh, make their full damage to the hero yeah. they choose. And I think like uh, Hong Kong, on Hong Kong China side, they cannot contest the boss fight in yeah. the early phase. Maybe. Yeah, they should fight their boss earlier in the game. Yeah, however, like uh, they, I think during like early phase, especially in like five or six minutes, they just stay in lanes or stay in jungles, do the farming. And uh, so that uh, China catch a point uh, and invading the enemy jungle and invading the lines, since their play player skill is gap is like a little bit too high. Yeah, China has a very good plan of farming and uh, ganking and uh, team fights, then get both. Yeah. Uh, and uh, I think both two team China get the Hong Kong China's first boss. Mm -hmm. And uh, also, like in the second game, like Hong Kong China may make some better words than the first game. Like you can see in the first game, like their vision is like nearly uh, dark in the enemy side. Mm However, -hmm. in the second game, they do make some good words. Yeah, but uh, the landing phase. Mm -hmm. Gap is too large for mm -hmm. Hong Kong China. They cannot get out of their high ground to make any vision in the later game. Yeah, and uh, I think like uh, maybe we can see like in the following games, maybe the vision on both sides can make some difference. Since like in this kind of, uh, I mean in Dream Three Kingdoms, like uh, vision can make a lot of difference in both the early game phase and the late team fight. Mm -hmm. yeah. Like if you can see the enemy side, how their people, how their heroes are like positioning, then you can make some mm, like uh, good strategies to do a good team fight. Yeah, they should focus more on their boss and the division. Yeah. I think Hong Kong China will versus Nepal later this day mm -hmm. on 12 o'clock. Yeah. Uh, they can make uh, some uh, strategic plan yeah. at their drafting versus Nepal. Mm -hmm. 
And uh, since they just finished their first pass of three, and uh, it's a very quick pass of three, I think they do not feel very tired, and maybe they can keep their uh, keep yeah. their energy and uh, doing well in their second pass of three. Yeah, the players of Hong Kong Travel seems uh, quite happy mm -hmm. after the game, though they lose to China. Mm -hmm. But uh, maybe they have the expectation of losing. Mm -hmm. uh, and they think that they have played their best in the game. Mm -hmm. And I think like uh, their the playstyle is um, mm, good for them in the uh, maybe later games since they play very. Mm, I think they make very good strategies in the early game. And uh, although we do not see the late game, their their picking heroes are very powerful in the late games. Yeah, mm, and I like the picking Puyue. Mm -hmm. Puyue are very hard uh, to survive in a team fight, but it can make uh, really a lot of damage. Though they the the Puyue is do, doing the Hong Kong is doing better in the landing phase, so the Puyue cannot uh, make it have his chance to show in his skill in the team fight. Mm -hmm. But I uh, like their uh, but I like their determination yeah. in the game and mm -hmm. choose Puyuan. And also we can see like uh, in this path there are a lot of like heroes that haven't uh, been seen in this thing in this scenery. Uh, like uh, Sun Huan, Dream Guan Yu, Huang Kai and Maybe uh, Luo Li and uh, Liu Biao. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they are all very good heroes, and uh, mostly they are banned in the early phase so that they cannot pick. Mm -hmm. And we can see, like uh, in the uh, second game, in Hong Kong, China pick some very good heroes at a uh, very early phase, and both in the first game and second phase. Like Pu Yuan, Huang Yuan, they are all like uh, very good uh, carries. Mm, yes, and China has mm, China has showcased a level of game game play mm. and uh, yeah. left their opponent in out. Yeah, I think their hero pool are very deep for China size uh, players. Mm. Mm. They have like a very good uh, understanding of this kind of game. Yeah, and uh, very good s skilling cost. Uh, the victory is a testament to the countless of hours of practice. Yeah, and uh, yeah, we know that uh, uh, this. Uh, maybe we can talk about the. Uh, maybe we can talk about the. Uh, uh, performance for both sides mid heroes uh, mid players yep yeah I think uh, in this pass of three like uh, Ch China's mid player play Xiao Hao yeah he make he is play very aggressive in lane yeah really lose the mid lane uh, mm, he, he even do some solo kills in the lane I think yeah and, no and I think Hong Kong side uh, their player do not uh, do very well in mm. both landing phase and in the team fight. Mm. I think it just uh, that is just because of mm -hmm. China's play is too well, too good yeah, in the game. Uh -huh. mm. I think Hong Kong can play back in the afternoon matches versus Nepal. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Because I think they are also very good player, just not as good as China's play. Mm -hmm. uh, but but uh, the next uh, match will be the Thailand versus Vietnam. Yeah, um, and yeah, this is like uh, uh, very interesting for Thailand mm -hmm. right now for this kind of game. I I think Thailand is a very high skills and a strong team yeah. in the Asian game. Yeah, we can know that uh, there's one game called Heroes of New Wars. Like, uh, uh, they just terminate their server. So, uh, there are a lot of Thailand players that are playing 
uh, Dream Three Kingdom right now for uh, maybe not a short time. Yeah, mm. um, and we will see Thailand mm -hmm. versus Vietnam. Oh, here comes the yeah. statistic for Game Two. 47 kills for China. Mm -hmm. This game ends even earlier than the first game. Actually. Yeah. And uh, Hong Kong barely touched the uh, China side's tower. Yeah. Mm -hmm. China already get to the high ground of Hong Kong, China in I think 15 or 20 minutes in the game. Yeah. They got 63 assistance in game. And uh, 116 kill damage. Mm. Uh, we can see, like, although Hong Kong, they have a lot of heroes that can spam skills, uh, they do not do a lot of damage actually. Mm, yeah, mm. they have Liu Biao and Hua Tu. Yeah. Mm, we can see the MVP is Xiao Hao. Yeah, Xiao Hao performed very well in the second game. Yeah, um, show how rude the midland. Yeah, and, uh, and uh, make huge gap in the yeah. mid. Show how oh. show how is show who almost domin dominates the the game since I think a ten minutes. Yeah, mm, and uh, seventeen kills, seventeen assistants for show how. Yeah. Really horrible stat. GPM one one thousand and three hundred. Yeah, that's not that's also very horrible for a mid player. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's make very aggressive move in lands and make some solo kills, which is very impressive for him, mm, which makes him the MVP for this game. Mm. Yes, and uh, I think uh, Royal yep, also a very good player, but. Mm -hmm. was totally the the by the Shaha. Yeah. And uh, okay. we will have a mid mid match break. Yep. See you later in the next match. Mm -hmm.
关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。
，累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。
累了、困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了、困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了、困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。
累了、困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。Okay, welcome back from the road to Asian Game Match Revenue. I'm Caster Luo Chen. I'm Caster Wang Mengyao. And this competition is jointly organized by the Olympic Council of Asia and the Asian Electronic Sports Federation, operated by Digital Sports Asia. And first of all, we'd like to thank our prestigious sponsors FAW, OTQ4, Etron for their strong support for the events. And also special thanks to iQOO, the official mobile game equipment of the RDAG, the professional choice to empower victory, embrace the thrill of control. Let us also thank our official supporters Omen, New Omen, New Journey to the Road to the Asian Games. Let us also thank our official supporters Autofu, Autofu, official gaming chair partner of the Road to the Asian Games. Be your own hero. Thank you to official supporter East Rock for their support. We would also like to thank our official broadcasting platform: Bilibili, We Are Live, Douyu Live, Kuaishou Games, China Mobile, Migu Channels, Tencent Video, Weibo, Xiaohongshu, YouTube, and Twitch for their support. And、uh, we're gonna see the second game,、uh, Thailand versus Vietnam,、uh, in the main stage. And、uh, after the first game, what do you think for like? Uh, uh, this patch in Dream Three Kingdoms. Do you think like there's a、uh, very,、uh, very important to build some lead in the early stage in early games? Okay.、Uh, uh, we can see the starting line here. For Thailand, Carrier Artify,、mm, Offland Never the T, Solo Cow, Gank Tapasia, Supporter This Die. For Vietnam, we have Alex, Shy, Ellie, Joyce, and Key. Okay, so yeah,、um, I think like、uh, mm, during last game, like both both、uh, team play very aggressive in the、yeah. early games. So I think this will be a, a blood bloody contest for these both two teams. Like in Southeast、yeah. Asia,、uh, view、uh, they play this kind of mobile game very aggressively. So、mm-hmm. I think、uh, Dream Three Kingdom is also very、mm, uh, they support the early stage team fight, early stage compact. Yeah,、mm-hmm. I think in the first match today,、mm-hmm. both team are very excited、mm-hmm. and、uh, show aggressive in the game、yeah. and.、Uh, And、uh, I think Thailand and Vietnam are both very strong team、yeah. in this、uh, in this game.、Yeah, and I heard like Thailand, they have very、um, this game is、um, a little bit po- popular in Thailand, and I think both in Vietnam as well.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, <coughs> I think they have 
take uh, many hours mm-hmm. practicing yeah. and make strategy mm-hmm. in the game. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and talent the coach mm-hmm. uh, I heard is very professional yeah. in the game. Yeah, they do drafting very professionally. Like uh, their draft uh, mm, strategy is similar to uh, China and uh, yeah. Hong Kong China, I think. Mm. I think uh, they have a remarkable ability to read their opponents and uh, adjust their strategies on yeah. them in the match. Mm-hmm. And I think like uh, during last um, best of three, <coughs> the <coughs> the China like uh, they barely make uh, mm, around uh, 50 kills in game so mm, so it's maybe it's fun to see uh, which gonna be like uh, Vietnam or uh, Thailand they gonna make like six, 60 kills to win the game maybe 60 kills uh, that will be really hard yeah but uh, you I can think see in the last game yeah I think if it's an uh, even play, mm-hmm. maybe one team will get his 60 kills mm-hmm. in the game, mm-hmm. and when while other game, other team will get like 40 or 50 kills. Mm, yeah, I mean like uh, <coughs> in the uh, the best strategy is still to push enemy base. However, like uh, killing 60 uh, get 60 heads is like not. Uh, uh, it's not very common. It, it's not very common, but not that kind of hard. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you can expect that, since it's like uh, Southeast Asia region. Mm-hmm. Like they, they prefer to do team fights while while farming jungles. Mm-hmm. And uh, they need, to, I think, it, talent coach mm-hmm. and the Venus coach have. I've already make detailed plan yeah. what they are drifting. Yeah, I heard like they have practiced for like several months for Dream Three Kingdoms. So I expect a very interesting and a very bloody match. Mm-hmm. Yeah, to show their skills and the passion in mm-hmm. the game. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And uh, yeah, although like uh, we can go back to analyze the. Uh, positions for the like uh, each positions like uh, you still need to farm for your carries however you get enough gold you can like uh, get enemy heroes for enough gold it's still like a way to gain the advantage in the game you don't need to farm that more actually yes and then you can design a brilliant mm. farm route so you can farm and then, then gank and then get your boss. Yeah, there are a lot of resources in this kind of game, uh, especially in Dream Three Kingdoms. There are boss pit, there are uh, there are essence, and there are the ancients, right? Yep. Mm-hmm. So like there's lots of place to do the team fight, yeah. and it's good for both teams to like build the team fight around these areas. And the both is a very crucial mm. resource in the game. Yeah, I think uh, Thailand and the Vietnam mm. need to focus on their boss because mm. we can see in the first match Hong Kong China uh, did not uh, do good in their boss fight. Yeah. They lost uh, their first two boss in the last games. Yeah. And I think like in the second match, uh, maybe they will do a li- little bit differently than the first match. First match is like uh, uh, very, uh, I think a very common match, uh, like uh, carry stay in the jungles and uh, the top hero stay in top lanes, while the uh, the support who needs the kindness farming the lands. However, I think uh, in the second, uh, in ver- uh, Vietnam versus Thailand, uh, they wanna like fight more. Maybe like they do the gank more. Yeah, in the early phase of the game. Yeah, and maybe the support will uh, leave the jungle mm-hmm. uh, and then get to the bottom lane or the top lane. 
to kill to kill the solo hero of the other team. And uh, there's also many unique items in this game. The yeah. players I can choose to buy mm -hmm. and make an advantage in the team fight. Like a uh, carrier heals always buy always buys uh, uh, twin sword. Yeah, and the uh, golden glove, which yeah. is my favorite item as well. Uh, we, this is a very common item in other MOBA games. And it's very crucial in Dream Three Kingdoms, mm. like the carry heroes, and I think the um, I think the top lane heroes who need to do some more farms, they gonna get the they gonna grab the gold gloves first to make them even richer and uh, make more experience. Yes, and uh, both team need a candice point yeah. to build the candice item. Yeah. Uh, to make uh, revenge in the team fight. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and, uh, we can see in the last best of three, like both both teams, they pick very uh, like team fight heavy heroes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, which determines this game. Like team fight is everything. Like if you make one good team fight, you like make very big progress in games. I think we will see much. We will see explosive play style team fight in this match. Mm -hmm. uh, since Vietnam and uh, Thailand are both famous for their aggressive play style. And we are still waiting for the match to begin. Yeah. Uh, maybe we can discuss a little bit about the mm, like the most popular heroes. Uh, maybe we can discuss Pu Yuan. It's picking the last game. Yeah. Uh -huh. mm. Yeah. Very interesting picking. Yeah, I think it's a fragile hero in land. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but uh, yeah, as we can see, the some um, in the Dream Three Kingdom League, yeah, it's also a very common pick. Mm -hmm, because Puyan can make a lot of damage in the team fight or in the landing phase. Yeah, he got the magic skill, like uh, which can do um, some damage in the early phase. Like wow, mm -hmm. like he's following the team to do some ganking or uh, mm, like doing some solo kills even. Mm -hmm. Yeah, fragile but yeah. Uh, powerful. Yeah, L uh, in late game he's not that kind of fragile. But, but still can make a lot of damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a true. Ni nice carrier in, in late game. Yeah, and uh, I think uh, Huang Yuan is like a better pick than Pu Yuan. Like if you know how to use her rightly. Huang Yuan can make a lot of damage with his ulti. Yeah, that's uh, magic damage. Like while well, in the later phase, uh, he can she can do a lot of physical damage as well. Or maybe Ma Yunlu uh, in the first match. I yeah. think China pick Ma Yunlu as their carry. But it's really seen since Ma Yunlu is like a unique, very good skills. She does not have any. Uh, Escape skills. No. She cannot do a lot of blink. All you can do is just hit and run. Yeah, hit so and run, juke the enemy heroes. So that requires a high skill of cutting yeah. and uh, team fight position choice. Yeah, that's true. You need to hide in the dark, waiting for the opponents mm -hmm. to their fragile point. Mm -hmm. And I also like the Chu Rong pick from yeah. China in the last game. Yeah. Not a very common pick. Yeah. Chu Rong and uh, Sma Yi, but uh, make a huge sense in the game. Mm -hmm. and, uh, for the Kanis point, uh, Liu Biao is always picked, is it? Yeah. 
in the last game, Luke. Uh, I think in the first game. Uh, first game, Liu Biao is picked. <laughs> like Liu Biao can like do some uh, stuns, can control heroes, and uh, can do a little bit damage in the early phase. Mm -hmm. However, in the like in the team fight in the mid era, like uh, you can stun the enemy heroes mm -hmm. for a long time. Maybe not a long time, but that's enough for them to do uh, like uh, a lot of damage. Yeah. Very good team fight here, mm -hmm. Liu Biao and like uh, Sun Quan, Liu Biao, and uh, Liu Bei also. And, and uh, Sun Jian is also a good choice for mm -hmm. team fight. Yeah, I, I think in Dream Three Kingdoms, it's uh, it makes sense like. Uh, it makes sense like um, no one can, uh, I mean support, support does not need a lot of items actually. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like uh, the kindness point, they just need a... They can just use their wish yeah. to take care of the advantage in yeah. the early phase of the game. And they just need to build kindness and the other um, items they are like uh, add up to <laughs> their heroes. And for the support, you just need to build some item to gain gold uh, while like buying some sentries or wards. But they can still buy some crucial item, yep. like sealed item, yeah, to sa save their own lives. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think the sea region is famous for their high risk and the high reward price tag. Yeah. Maybe they will choose Southern Pure, yeah. both very fragile carrier, mm -hmm. but can make a lot of damage in the game. Yeah, I agree so. So when you choose Southern Pure, you need it to be aggressive in the game. Yeah. This is a game that uh, congr uh, like uh, encourage you to um, like uh, attack yeah, in the game. Like be aggressive in early phase. Like uh, if you play aggressively, you can build advantage easily. You can attack enemy jungle. You can attack enemy like uh, boss pit, doing some wards there. And so that when they do the, uh, they are rushing the boss. You know that, and yeah. you can invade the enemy pit. Yes. Mm -hmm. And the uh, things, Britain and the Thailand are both aggressive team. Mm -hmm. I think there will be little space for any team to retreat once they are in a passive situation in the game. Yeah. And uh, they need to take good vision in their in their own jungle yeah. and uh, the river side. Mm -hmm. Because the their opponents will attack and invade their jungle, definitely. This remind me of like uh, one league league match, like in early phase. Uh, like both teams are play uh, very cautiously in the game, and uh, when it reaches the end game, like one one enemy hero is always like cutting down waves, uh, which like makes a lot of interesting move for him. I think that's uh, Sun Huan, maybe. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, like uh, this hero is very. Uh, mm, it has a lot of uh, uh, like initiation skills mm -hmm. and can like move very easily in mm -hmm. maps, so that the enemy hero cannot catch him very easily. Yeah. So he's like cutting down waves while their team is like very. Mm, lost like uh, is very behind the other team. Yep. However, he can pull down their push waves a little, uh, uh, a little bit, so that uh, his teammate can find the item that they need 
although they do not like uh, win the last team fight and lost the game mm-hmm. uh, it gave me a lot of um, vision to see this game's potential like you do not need to do the team fight mm-hmm. uh, you do not to win every team fight actually like you can like clear the land yeah you can push lands and uh, maybe uh, you know the word rat a little bit yeah like, uh, you can push the lands out so that the enemy are like uh, they have to separate their heroes to um, push the other lands however this makes the chance to like uh, the, the other four guys can like catch the uh, hero who is like uh, going back to the base maybe and clear the land yeah clear the wave and then he's caught maybe yeah since Sun Huan is a hero with high mobility mm-hmm. and uh, he can be really tanky with items yeah so it's so very he hard for him to take down yeah very hard to take down maybe needed two or three heroes yeah. to gank him in the uh, in the later game mm-hmm. And uh, Sun Huan is still very good uh, in a team fight. Yeah. He can make a good uh, initiation. And there's and a play for him to block the enemy carries uh, uh, creeps and the, the quick camps. Mm-hmm. Yeah, which is very, mm, a very common move, like for the professional Dream Three Kingdoms. Yes, like to seal the creeps. The, the, the top hero, the top lane hero's uh, duty is to uh, harass the enemy carry mm-hmm. to farm, mm-hmm. like uh, to slow the farm as slow as they can. Yes, and sometimes the support will come to the top or bottom lane mm-hmm. solo hero yep. and help him to invade the opponent's jungle mm-hmm. to stop the opponent's carrier farming in their own jungle. Mm. And and uh, maybe they will block the creeps with wards mm-hmm. or sentry. So in in this game, you can block the creeps with your unit mm-hmm. to stop the the carrier farming in the jungle. Mm-hmm. And uh, when the carry player must uh, go into the land and uh, clean a land for gold, you can gank him. Yeah. And the mid player is also very crucial in the game because mm-hmm. mid player can make a lot of magic damage in the early game. Yeah. He can support bot lane and the top lane. Yeah. And the mid player is uh, mid player easily controls the essence in the river. Mm-hmm. Essence have powerful. Yeah, it's like. Uh, one can like double your physical damage and the one can block some damage for you the uh, there are a lot lot of kind of essence i think a mid hero likes uh, magic essence yeah much more than other essence yeah, the as the magic enhancements mm-hmm. and the uh, haste essence is also good for the mid hero to gank bottom lane or top lane and help uh, his teammates make an advantage in the early gameplay. Mm. <coughs> you know, like there are there are wealth fortune and uh, career fortune, mm-hmm. like uh, for the support hero, mm. uh, which is uh, one kind of item that uh, you just need to build and uh, give you a salary. Uh, yeah, kind of like salary, but uh, the career fortune it's like uh, mm, you will not get the uh, you will not get uh, experience in land like well the. Uh, the other like uh, carries nearby. So there, uh, we are still waiting, waiting for, for the game to start. Yes. And like just like other mobile games, teamwork is a lifeboat in the match. Mm-hmm. 
players must uh, communicate, coordinate, and to secure their victories. And the, in the heat of the battle, it's not just about the individual skill, but also the collective effort that, will, that determines success of both teams. We still need to wait for the game to start. And you talk about the teamwork. Yeah, I think like the individual skills for the player is still very important. Uh, especially in the landing phase. Yeah, like uh, uh, some of the players, especially for the okay, we can see it, like. Mm. They are already in the Vietnam player. Mm -hmm. They're setting up the uh, just the uh, equipment. Mm. Mm. Uh, That's a Thailand player. Thailand player as well. Not I sure. think they are very prepared. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think that that that's Thailand scary mm -hmm. and. When a player is communicate with Lots. his coach and the teammates, yeah, we 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 are talking about the individual skills mm -hmm. on like each players. Mm -hmm. You know, like the map awareness, like uh, uh, some players are really hard to caught. Mm -hmm. You think what is the reason why they are hard to caught? They have a sense of radar. <laughs> they, know, they know where the often the hero is yeah. uh, in the map though maybe the map is dark no vision there yeah I think that's awareness yeah that's like a kind of the team skill the the team communication as well like if you communicate enough like your team will tell you like uh, there's uh, like uh, mm -hmm. the enemy hero are missing on the map so you need to be aware like yeah. some hero, they uh, some player they go aggressively. They are farming enemy jungle maybe, mm -hmm. while some other players they just farming their own jungle. But they are aware of where the enemy heroes are. Yeah. So yeah, that uh, mm -hmm. requires a lot of training and communication. Yeah, this related mm. to communication as well. I mean, this kind of game are like always like. A Team orient oriented, so you need to depend on your uh, communication skills. Yeah, you need uh, team chemistry. Mm -hmm. You can see the reference mm -hmm. on the screen. Our reference team of Asian games. Mm -hmm. And uh, some other players, they are very strong in like. A psychological factors yeah like uh, they're taken down a lot of times while they still do not lose any confidence or hope yeah they're always confident and calm yeah and they can do a lot of impact in the late games mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and i think they then are nearly setting up and mm -hmm. ready to go waiting for the drafting phase yeah, we, I think we are just waiting for the game to start. Maybe in minutes. And I expecting them to put up a really good team fight yeah. for us. A good team requires mm -hmm. effective communication, mm -hmm. respect, willingness to understand and adapt to each other's strengths and of course weakness. A good team should cover the every teammate's weakness. And it is an ongoing process to building relationships. Yeah. You can see the Vietnam player very happy. Mm -hmm. I think they're all very happy. Uh, yes. Like this uh, road to Asian game, it's uh, related to the uh, Asian games. Yeah, but uh, like it gives a chance mm -hmm. to feel the atmosphere of Asian games uh -huh. first. Yeah. Yeah. Right. 
we can see on the auto full chair the AESF road to the Asian Games 2022 thanks to the auto full our official gaming chair partner of the road to the Asian Games be your own hill very happy Benang players Um, focus on the game. Yeah, I think Southeast Asia have very mm, historical. Uh, of esports? Not only esports, but only also in mobile <gasps> games. Mm -hmm. Like yeah. uh, uh, both in East Asia and Southeast Asia, there are very huge population of players who are like uh, kind of catch up to like. Uh, League of Legends. Mo I mean, mobile games <laughs> like in their early age. Uh, yes, on PC and uh, on the on their phone. <laughs> the, the, the Vietnam player is communicating maybe with his coach. <laughs> They're making the drafting plan, or oh, he's communicating with the reference. I don't know what kind of hero they will pick first. Uh, maybe some that rarely show up in the professional games. Maybe, yeah. Like in last game, we see, uh, we see, uh, we see the Zhu Rong mm -hmm. and the Smai, Smai, which are really rare. Maybe this like uh, give them inspiration for these two teams. They and then pick some like very interesting heroes. And Dream Lolly and of course, Dream Lolly and the Lolly. Mm -hmm. Dream Lolly is very both very interesting hero in the midland. But they are very popular. Oh, mm -hmm. we can see the dropping faces here, and <gasps> the on Vietnam side they ban Huang Gai, and the on the Thailand side they ban Liu Biao. Mm -hmm. Co very common ban for both teams. And then Dong Zhuo, which is a tanky hero. Yu Ji and the Dream Liu Shan. Mm -hmm. so Very confident in Ben. Let's see what's Wayne and Ben first. We can ban the Yan Liang. Oh. Yan Liang was banned in street games today. Thailand choose Gu Yong as their first pick. Very nice port here. Meng Huo uh, for Vietnam. Mm -hmm. And uh, Huang Yuying. And we can see Huang Yuying in the last game as well? Yes, in the first game today. Mm -hmm. Hong Kong China choose Huang Yuying as their carrier. Uh, and uh, now Thailand need to pick two heroes. They are dropped. Mm -hmm. Will they choose their carrier or mid hero? Or just like China's choice? Yep. Choose the support first. Yeah. And uh, Wang Yuying and Meng Huo, they can do very powerful team fights in the gaming phase. Mm -hmm. My very long thing. And uh, pick the a dream. Guan Yu. Which is a very like uh, common pick. And Dream Xiao Qiao for Vietnam. Dream uh, Yuan Shao. And the Dream Xiao Qiao. That uh, was a very common pick for Vietnam and Thailand. Here comes second uh, turn to ban. I think they need to ban some, um, let me see, maybe support heroes, uh, maybe Sun Quan, which is a powerful, mm -hmm. uh, powerful support that can control the crowd in team fight. We can see Vietnam choose, choose to pick their mid carrier mm -hmm. and, uh, po and uh, top solo. In the first uh, three pick, yeah, so very confident for them. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, Yuan is banned okay. by the villain. So they think uh, Thailand still need some Carrier. carry heroes. Still sinking. Mm -hmm. Maybe another carry hero? Yeah. I think Dream Cao Cao still in pool. Because already banned Pu Yuan and Yu Ji for winner. Um, I think Dream Yuan Shao is like very damage fit, like very focused on magic damage hero. Zhao Yu. But uh, he ben cannot Yu. control the crowd very easily. Mm -hmm. Yes, so maybe pick another hero that can stun. Or control last the hero. bam for Thailand. They're mm -hmm. thinking. They are thinking. Yeah, still like uh, about 120 seconds left. Take a very long time thinking. Yeah. Things in the first games. Uh, oh. oh, Trying to pick very fast. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I think. To Vinan should uh, okay, so the Sun Huan, which yeah. we talked <laughs> before, yeah, very interesting a, hero, yeah, yeah harass yeah, enemy very easily. Dream Zhang Shao mm -hmm. and uh, look, oh, very fast pick for Thailand, they have their drafting last pick mm -hmm. for the Vietnam. Luko is picked. I think it's a. Uh, oh, Hua Tua again. It's very popular. Yeah, Hua Tua appears in the first three game today. But Hua uh, Tua loses his first game mm. in, in the last match between China and Hong Kong China. Yeah. Will, Vi will Team Vietnam make uh, some difference here? We will see. Because they make Sun Huan and Hua Tu as a combo. Sun Huan is yeah. very tanky here. Both team they both pick very um, heavy team fight heroes. Mm -hmm. and so we can see a lot of uh, like a lot of kills in games. Same so a little <laughs> bit nervous here. Mm -hmm. We'll soon get him into the game. Yeah. Let's see who will win the first game of the best yeah, of three. Here comes to the game, mm. Thailand. Versus Four three. heroes <laughs> gathering in the bottom, bottom. jungle okay. of the Wu side. I think they just need to control the essence. Maybe. Yeah. Uh, very common <laughs> words choice yeah. here for Thailand. Where will Vietnam put their words? Yeah. The wards can make vision for the team. Mm -hmm. And this and uh, with vision you can see the opponent's hero invade your jungle. Uh, also a very common words for the Vietnam. Mm -hmm. uh, high ground words. Oh you can see mm, maybe so high is played as Joy. What maybe? Oh no. No, it's just you a solo hero? Yes, still oh. solo. Joy is early. Okay, let's see where is the essence first essence. Uh huh. Uh mm, six seconds for the essence to respond. Messenger slowly moved. Mm -hmm. I know what's here. Clone essence. Uh nice essence for carry player. Yeah. But the choice take it. Oh, he wanted to make uh, Essence a ward. Yeah. Ali in the Midland. Mm -hmm. Alex, come down. Oh, uh, they, they dewarded the. Nice dewards. Uh -huh. It's a very. Alex oh, blocks the no, <laughs> lamb, but he misses it. Yeah, they do not make the block very. Oh, he can come down too late. And the choice is jo the illusion menu? of oh, the choice. Illusion. Help uh, Ellie. I think that's not in the middle. He got one. <laughs> he got one range creep. I think. The creep. 
I'm trying to kill Joyce in Lucian. Yeah. Ellie and oh. Call here in oh, Midland. Oh, nice call him. Nice call for Neva uh, die. However, Sun Huai is very highly mobility. Clee, so no, Joyce nearby to help Klee on the line. Mm. I think Sun Huai will <laughs> not die that easily. Mm, yeah. But uh, the Sun Huan just uh, have half of his HP. And, oh. and there was a pass in the game. And uh, I think it's very unusual for Sun Huan. Like he's the only top lane, I think. Okay, so. Okay. Yes. So there's a technical te pause. Yes. We were waiting for the game to restart. Uh, what do you think of both teams' draft? Uh, I think uh, V9, their pick is very... Mm, mm, I think it's good for them. However, mm, Thailand, they have very strong endgame, maybe. I think Team V9 has a uh, little bit nervous. Yeah. They, yeah, uh, they, they missed, missed the, the first uh, blocking creeps. Yeah, and... Uh, I I really like Thailand's player never die. His play style. Very yeah. aggressive. And uh, you can see like they put Song Huan on the top lane, which is very well seen. Like uh, Song Huan's most duty is to harass the enemy mm -hmm. farming, however uh, you can see but like, uh, mm -hmm. you go ahead. But if Song Huan is uh, Venus Kenneth point yeah. Uh, he must come to the team fight. Yeah, very interesting move for them. So, so his high mobility. Mm -hmm. uh, so is a hero with high mobility, but he must uh, come to the team fight since he's a cannon's point. Yeah. Uh, so maybe he will lose his ability to push lands and uh, writing in the later game. Yeah. And uh, oh, I think uh, during the end game, Thailand will do not have enough damage for them S since they do not pick uh, very like uh, there are no common like physical carry mm -hmm. for Thailand in late game. Yes, Mo Guan Yu and uh, Sun Huang are both tanky hero. Yeah, and the Dream Yuan Shao, uh, magic damage, like cannot do enough to get down the enemy heroes in the uh, late phase. And while the VNAM, they have Huang Yue Ying and the Dream Xiao Chao, which are also like very good at the end game phase. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, you can make a lot of magic damage with his ult. Uh -huh. and, uh, I think during, uh, but uh, there's still like not a um, team fight going on, so we cannot see if both team are play very aggressively. Mm -hmm. uh, we can see the landing phase, and their um, their team build is very like heavily based on the team fight. Yeah. But uh, mm -hmm. the support use is an illusion. Yeah, to get one. Maybe that's not a very good choice. Because yeah, illusion so. can, can be a word in the, in the ancient creeps mm -hmm. of the opponent's jungle. Mm -hmm. Or when just to block the creeps. He just uh, use the illusion in the middle line and uh, attacks the creeps. We are still waiting for the game to restart. Yeah. It might take a little bit long than we expected. Um, maybe we can focus on the uh, Huang Yue Ying. So it's a very interesting carry hero. And very powerful. Yeah, since she's got the magic damage and the uh, physical damage in late game. His passive skill mm -hmm. is a very powerful physical damage skill. Mm, actually, that's a 
Uh, that's an active skill. Uh, yeah. Like uh, doing the bounce on heroes and oh, we can see. Okay, it's restart. Yeah, restart. Early in the metal then. Try to redemption to call, but yeah. cause yeah. HP is far more way to call Blinker onto the Alice face in the top tower. Yeah, however, it does not make make it. No, Alice's HP is really low. Mm -hmm. and Again, uh, get Kelly, never that, right? We are going separate. Can just play. go back to. Yes, that's Sun Hua. That is Sun Hua. Higher play, mobility. Mm -hmm. Alice. Uh, Ali only yeah, level like 3. Yeah, they are just farm um, peace 40 in the hand. And uh, so far is already level 4. Clay. Alex, uh, well, the bottom Alex left. is suffering in the bottom left. Yes. Oh, he's caught. Again, caught Curly. Never die. Can he get him? So far. Yeah, oh make no. it. Why so far is dashing in front of yeah, Alex? Never the dies face. First blood. I could first blood here. Whereas uh, yes so and uh, call <laughs> still make damage to Ellie and in the middle and doing a lot of damage. Ellie level five but still low HP here. Drink and some potion. And uh, no but magic. call still waiting for Oh yeah, and never there. Three heels get never there. Can you date it? Miss one skill, never there, still down. Oh, he died. Never died. <laughs> uh, ooh, but shy. Get down by the creeps. Mm -hmm. Call. Waiting, waiting for Ellie to come front. I'm waiting for level six. And you can see the bottom is like empty. Again, get curly here. Never die. Oh, already level six tougher. Mm -hmm. Alex suffering the landing face. And uh, so does Ellie. You can now smile the creeps. You need to make some last hits. I think uh, Meng Fu does not block the first creep wave, so that he yeah. suffers a lot. Yeah. Is Very someone caught again? No, someone can run away. Call mm. already level 6. Smell Huang Yuying come here, Huang Yuying, shy. Huang Yuying was his ulti, but, but uh, never die. He blinked out. Dash down to the river. Can follow him to the bottom. Can he do enough damage? Uh, Joy is still chasing. Never no. die, very confident. And uh, he's pulled back Sun again. Huan put that. Oh no, he cannot uh, yeah, he block Sun Huan. Dash. Very good uh, juke for both oh, teams. Never there. Uh, very confident play. Now they can, they can't kill him. Yeah. And uh, we can see the enemy. Alex, do not level six. And Huang Yuying does not farm very good. Tay, Tay, tracing Alex. Mm -hmm. In the tower to tower, tower attacks Tay. Oh, tower still attack Tay! And uh, he's uh, down. That, that's some huge mistake for Tay. Yeah, it's a huge <laughs> mistake for him. Cause, do. He's already uh, two levels like uh, above. But uh, he didn't make any, make any chance to uh, solo kill Klee. Mm -hmm. uh, never die back to the land. Wow, very powerful and uh, will he? He wanna harass the enemy carry to farm. However, Clay is pushing lands. Uh, okay, back into the land. <laughs> Find the Clay. Yeah, Hello, he Clay. He wanna make some progression mm -hmm. in land again. And clear the land. And get he's put again. Clay, oh. get pulled again. But, but Clay, can he make it? No, never the too tanky here. Yeah. Another catch for never the oh, Clay. I don't know if he caught the illusion or the the real one. <laughs> he's pulled nah. again. Nah, but uh, he can just uh, make it out. We want to fight back. 
but no, no enough damage. So Where fast is damage is very low actually. I need my teammates to clear. Uh, Where is my teammates? There's a solo kill. A solo kill for never day. It's very good for him. Beautiful play. Mm -hmm. While uh, Huang Yin is still farming jungle. Yeah. Try farming the ancient creeps and yeah. find the guardian essence. It's already level six, I think. Uh, they six minutes. Yeah. Those team. Oh, Sun Huan okay. get it back, <laughs> and call. the call makes it here and defeat the Sun Huan again. Yeah. That's a nice comeback for Sun Huan. Huang Yin is out here. Out here. Out, and uh, a that's nice a kill. very successful gank for them. Nice kill. Banana, oh, nice pushing Bolton Tower. Mm -hmm. Alice doing the banana. Banana will get the first tower. No, here comes the top. It's really tanky here. Three hills. You know, they don't make any damage to top. Still chasing. And here comes the Alex. And get the two people down. Yeah, and the other one just keep it out. Yeah. Are they. Going to push Just the die. tower? I think so. No, turn for Thailand to push the bottom tower. Yeah. Ellie come here, clear the land. The yeah. tower's still down. Yeah, the first tower is down. The first tower is down. And I could be laughing. Embrace this room. Cow. Cleaning the land. And the blinking on the other mid lane here. Yeah. Make some damage, but he found it's too. He does not have any control. Too far away in yeah. the tower. So they're pushing the <laughs> Get Alex again. And Alex. Is caught again. Alex. Alex down. Uh, only level 7. Yeah, and. Really huge mistake for him not to block the creeps. And already pushed never the die. Power. Still here and a call come. Oh, you inside out. But never die. Dash away. It, oh, never die. He doesn't want to retreat. It's a want two to fight versus again. Four. It's a two versus four. No, no, no that's the illusion of the Sun Huan. Oh my. Two versus three. Okay. And never die. Still make damage. And Very tanky. Oh, oh, here comes the teammates of Thailand. Okay. Hit another. And a call. Oh. Waiting for Klee. Uh, Can Klee run away? Sun Huan is very. Any skill. Okay, Sun Huan retreat with yeah. his mobility skill. Oh, that's a very nice playing of Never Day. He absorbs uh, every damage of the Venan team. Yeah, and, and uh, successfully pulled the top tower. Again, call from the alley here. Oh Hello, God, Ellie. It's uh, easy kill. <laughs> Hello, Ellie. Goodbye, Ellie. Another, another attack organized by Thailand. I think Thailand already pushing down. Ellie, shy with his uh, ulti. Can he make enough damage? The damage is too low. No. Not far, still away. Kelly is slow. Just one last hit. Can you get him? We're chasing the. Comes Alex, but just miss. Yeah, I think Alex need to farm Le a little bit more. Alex, the level is too low here. Mm -hmm. And Alex only. <laughs> level 8. 15 code. <laughs> I never die come to the bottom map. To steal the uh, <laughs> ancient. Alex, very angry. Get very his uh, ancient. Yeah, he, he just need to farm me a little bit more. Ah, uh, the vault. Mm. Uh, and the talent start to rush their boss here. Very good. And uh, they slay the their side's uh, boss. It's already 10 minutes, so the second gonna respawn like in mm -hmm. 5 or 6 mm -hmm. minutes. And Again, <laughs> call clean. Uh, they just opting and they yeah, get, get every the hero they need. Ellie, wrong away, wrong, Ellie, wrong. There's too many heroes here. You need your teammates to defend this tower. I think it's a free mid tower for, for Thailand. Not Thailand, they just. Uh, 
retreat into their jungle. They want to save this town. And the call clear the Venice jungle. jungle. Yeah, they do not want them going to farm. Meet Shai. Hello, Shai. Is Shai down? No. We didn't use his ult mm -hmm. because Kali is back. Never die. In the, in the bottom of the map. I think. Mm. Mm. Will he meet it? I what think they. What is Ellie doing here? Waiting for the creeps. Uh, and again, on the top map. Try with his ult. It's a nice initiation. There are too many people of Vietnam. Can tell to make this. Can he retreat at all? Can absorb many dam damage, but still down. Yeah. A nice team fight for Vietnam here. They make a four with a three, but mm -hmm. Carl. Carl is back. He's and back. Jumps in, uses his ult. That's too much damage for Carl. Oh and nice no time. skill leave for Whitney. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and Ellie just cannot do anything. Yeah, so nice playback for Carl and the R2. I think Carl is like uh, uh, just very powerful mm -hmm. in, in the enemy jungle. Mm -hmm. Never die and Paul, very powerful player. I think Vietnam do not make very good strategy. They just need to push so far in the bottom lane. Already 12, 5, 25k K gold escape for Thailand. And uh, here comes Shai, hello! That was so. Yeah, she even used his out. Oh. And then you can get the uh, Venice boss here. Mm -hmm. Let's leave their boss too long. Uh, so they get both, both uh, boss. This should be curing arms mm -hmm. for Artify. I think they just try need to, to push. Oh my but God. Ellie! Too much damage here! And the Alex is Muscle retreat. Can, can he retreat? No. Lee, and Lee still the seen. They want to take by artifact, oh but he God. has curing arms too tanky. And Comes and early again. Lee. Does he got it? Yes, enough damage and the curing arm is on the ground. Can she make it out? But early is die. Uh. The curing arms. Call pick it. A nice try for winner, but their item is far away from the Thailand. Yeah. Cow waiting the jungle and pushing the line. Uh, now they make very poor strategy in the landing phase. And the boss? Yeah. They just give their post freely. I like barely see any vision on the site, on, on, on wayside. Yeah, Alex level is too low. Uh -huh. Really suffering in the landing base. Cow, mm. struggling, hunting. I think Thailand they just wait for their second boss to respawn and then let's get it. We can ward the blink here and the call come. But uh, nobody was in the jungle. Then mm -hmm. try to make an uh, initiation from the call. And out of try, but no damage here. And uh, uh, they're all down. Joyce tried to escape. However. And the clear is down. Mm. That's a nice initiating for the Vena, but their damage is just too low. Mm. And yeah, no, there's nothing you can do here. Uh, Thailand can get to the top tattoo tower and it can get to the high ground of, of Vietnam. Yeah, Thailand, although their, their decision is very poor, their goal lead is just too high for them. Oh, Artify getting to the base of the Vietnam and then get clear here. Can clear escape? No. Oh. Alex. Come again, but Alex give levels too low, his item is too poor. Alex die again, call, get Ellie here, artify yeah. and never die. Oh, nice okay. play for call. 
it's a massacre for Thailand. Everyone of Twina has already dead once and twice. Yeah. Look at the Thai ground of Twina here, Thailand. Really aggressive. And pulled back, Alex, again. They had a Hua Tuo. Oh, yeah. they, they, they caught like three heroes, however, they cannot do any damage. Yeah. Is Artifact down? Oh, that's okay. all. No, it's very good. Almost a miss every out here. Mm -hmm. Since Thailand has Hua Tuo here, they can heal every damage that they've been caused. I think Thailand just need to retreat a little bit. Uh, they are both yes, yeah. already refreshed. Reform a little bit and get their items. They can rush their boss now. They are just retreating to their side and the way to farm the second boss. Maybe get That's the another king. Yeah, maybe get the other side boss as well. Oh, mm -hmm. it's caught. Ali is caught again. However, yeah, enough damage. They nope. do not have interest to like get him. Yes, but they got the boss. Mm -hmm. Still gathering with that. Yeah. And never but never die. Yeah, he chose back shy. Oh, what's and five the call, people and call the call is in the back. A nice cutting for call. Oh Everyone was on his out. <laughs> oh, call! <laughs> what a monster! That will be our ace for Thailand. Yeah, it's very beautiful team fight for them. Call is cutting just like a beast mm -hmm. and uh, ruined the, the total team of yeah, winner. The call is like. Jumping to the high ground. He's caught. He no, he can jump back. Oh my god. Nobody can stop him. Call. What a player. Oh. But. Uh, but uh, we is down. The, this guy is down. Uh -huh. And they're chasing for Wenan. Can he make this choice? Can you take the choice? Oh my god, the call again. The damage is too high here. Yeah. Shy with his ult, but uh, not enough damage. The call is down, I think. But the call has already killed everyone in the Vietnam team. Yeah, they just need to pull, push the high They are ground. waiting for the creeps. Yeah, creep oh no, is the Vietnam pills are already spawned from the fountain. Mm -hmm. They get bad and they're waiting for the boss to refresh. Uh, there's like I think in 60 seconds for the wayside boss to respawn. And the golden gap is so large now. Mm -hmm. They will get their fire demon. Yeah. Thailand. Very aggressive pace still. I think the I think the team fight is like. Uh, Beyond our expectation mm -hmm. for oh my god. Call again, you see it's OT and one kill. Uh, and they're blinking. Mm, they they try to get call, but the call is tanky. And he's got teammates. And his teammates come, but yeah, what heal the call. And the oh, that will be four down. And the only shy on the high ground with his OT, but no damage here. Never dead, die, will back. not die. Never die. Uh, really never die. Yeah, they just pushed What the was enemy. still hearing? Again, the last high ground tower. Mm -hmm. Alex tried to make an initiate. But uh, no, his, his level is too low. And his damage is too low. Another beautiful call and blinking. Oh my god. Call. Low here. But Hua Tuo, another heal. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's this spell for Rick. Everyone is down again. And just push the uh, barracks. Here is the base. Nothing Whitten can do to stop Thailand here, Alex. Dead again. Base is on the attack. Everyone is out of the fountain. Must fight here. And base is down. Congrats Thailand for the victory for the game one. Yeah.
really blatant game. I think mm. that would be an even game, but Thailand, yeah, really brilliant, especially Cole and never die. Yeah, I do not expect <laughs> this is too brutal <laughs> for Thailand. Thailand is like a really uh, strong team I in the Asian their, games. Their their mid player is beyond godlike. Mm -hmm. A really good move for them. And um, yeah, I see they're very happy about their performance. Everything for Vena seems lost control since Alex didn't uh, make his block to the. Yeah, I think the that's a mistake for their landing phase. Their strategy is wrong. Mm -hmm. They just need to put Sun Huan in the bottom. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and Sun Huan need item and uh, gold and uh, experience. However, Sun Huan is like caught by never die too much. Yeah. <laughs> Clearly was totally controlled by Nevada in yep. the landing phase. Mm -hmm. Really nice play for Nevada. Yeah, we can see like Thailand is making dominance in the team fight phase. Do you think Thailand uh, has a uh, uh, equi equivalent skill with China? I think they can contest China, but I don't know if um, their ceiling is like. Uh, yeah, I, 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 I'm not so sure about that. However, I think their team fight is very beautiful. Yeah, mm. but I think uh, China's carry long. Yeah. Uh, is a better player. I think their China's maybe their hero pool is like better than Thailand. Since Thailand, they still pick the common heroes mm -hmm. that uh, like always show up in the games. Mm -hmm. yeah. And they have much more magic parents. Yeah. That uh, will be the first game of the best of the three between Thailand and uh, Vietnam. Really yeah. nice play for Thailand. Yeah. There will be a highlight, highlight. here.
welcome back to the best of three between Vietnam and Thailand. And we can see uh, Thailand has made very good performance in the first game uh, with the combo of uh, Zhang Shao and the uh, um, Yi. Yeah. So uh, this is um, a very I think uh, the second game Vietnam should uh, think up more like how they can contest the uh, team fight with uh, Thailand and evenly uh, they should just mm, just not to fight with Thailand in the early phase since they are too powerful maybe they should just uh, separate to farm a little bit and uh, we can see the biggest mistake for Vietnam is to put uh, Meng Huo in the bottom lane on the wayside at the first game, uh, which like uh, make uh, the Meng Huo miss the first creep block, block in the early phase. And then we can see the Sun Huan is very struggling in the uh, early phase of the game. Uh, so, what do you think about uh, like uh, how can Vietnam improve a little bit in the second game? I think it's very hard for Vietnam to play back because we can see Thai's team they get the personal team fight mm. they want and uh, their engagement were executed with a surgical precision, mm -hmm. especially Cole. He played really good in the middle line. Mm -hmm. And uh, every, every cutting of call and his ult make huge damage to the team of mm -hmm. the Vietnam and almost uh, kill two or three heals in yeah. one team fight with his ult. And uh, landing critical crowd control updates and combining with devastating area of eff effect spells. Yeah. Really nice spell casting skills for the for the Thailand team. I think Never Die is doing very good in mm -hmm. the first game. He caused Sun Huan a lot of times mm -hmm. and uh, he can do very important uh, crowd control and uh, uh, hero control yeah. in the first game. And uh, Let Call can like in, like invade the enemy uh, back, uh, enemy back like in the very early phase so that uh, the other hero cannot uh, mm, contest the uh, call, maybe. Yes, never die absorbs the damage mm -hmm. and the call makes them. I think uh, they, will be, they will be the twin star of Thai team. Yeah. And there's one interesting thing, mm -hmm. like it's very different from the first best of three. Like Thai is very interesting to post the towers early. Mm -hmm. In the early phase, I think uh, around 10 or 12 minutes, yes. Thai almost pushed down the, uh, first bottom tower. Two, the bottom two towers and the first tower on the top lane, yes. so that the Vietnam's uh, farming place are limited to a very small place, or they have to farm dangerously yeah. in the enemy jungle or the like in the land. Yeah. I think th that will be their strategic decision mm -hmm. to to s making the Venice map smaller and smaller, mm -hmm. control their farming zoo, yeah. and make uh, Night War escape yeah. of Golden Experience. Yeah, and also you can see like uh, Vietnam, they are um, Vietnam, like they do not go to like save their towers. Mm -hmm. They do not do the team fights behind the tower. Oh, we can see there's a statistic board here. And in the first game, uh, Thailand makes uh, nearly 60 kills. So They're almost yeah, the yeah we, we can see that uh, like uh, it's nearly 60 kill. Uh, like I said. Only three kills to, to win. victory. Yeah. And, uh, and 100 assists, 114 assists. That's very, uh, very powerful team fights for Thailand. Mm -hmm. And you can see the they get ten tower, and the Vietnam get zero, zero towers. Tower. Mm -hmm. it's uh, very this 
there is a discipline in the Thai team, I think, to yeah. make their strategic decision. Mm -hmm. And the MVP is Carl, obviously. Carl. Yeah, 27 kill. He is like one or two times beyond God, like I think. Yeah, he makes a lot of like kills and Ma uh, uh, a marvelous play. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, for several times in the game, you can just see Carl cutting yeah. and two or three heal on Vene just get done by his ult mm -hmm. immediately. He is so confident mm -hmm. to make an initiation of team fights. Yep. And the only problem is like if Carl can make performance like this good in the second game. Like, I think the first hero mm -hmm. is Ben, obviously. Yeah. So, how about the other hero for him? I think uh, he can play every hero in this game. Yeah, maybe. Uh, so talented skill yeah. in the first match. Yeah, I think so. Mm -hmm. You know, in the individual performance, mm -hmm. Carl has uh, so ma so so great magnetic powerness mm. and uh, perfectly timed skill shot to crunch sales and his potion potionness. Yeah. I think never dies mm, play really good as well. Yeah, like we said before, he absorbs most of the damage, so the mm -hmm. carry and the mid hero nice. can do a lot of damage freely. Yes, never dies has already destroyed the top lane, mm -hmm. and they can so the tie can easily push the top lane and uh, control the zoo. Farming zoo and make version into the jungle of the yeah. Venan. Um. Okay. So well. this is what I said. Like being impact uh, mm -hmm. on the mid lane, so that uh, your uh, your other hero can just uh, mm, uh, maybe farm a little bit or doing other things. While the mid hero is doing a lot of impact in games, like in the team fight phase or in the. Mm, not only in the team fight phase, but in the end game phase as well. Like in early phase, he destroyed the enemy mid hero, uh, uh, and lately he mm, can just carry teams and uh, kill the enemy important heroes first, like the control hero or the carry hero. Okay, we can see both teams are ready for the second match. Yes. They have an uh, outstanding performance in the first game, so Thailand. Thailand. A big win today, mm -hmm. undoubtedly be interested mm -hmm. in the Asian Games history. Mm -hmm. uh, Look forward to seeing them continue their journey. Yeah, sadly they are in group B so that uh, they will not contact China. However, um, they, I think they're gonna be in the like uh, in Asia games like mm -hmm. lately in September. So maybe we will see a match up. There. Yeah, yeah. See you in the uh, in the match of the Asian Games mm -hmm. 2022. Mm -hmm. And as for Vedan, mm -hmm. though they lost, they have demonstrated their reliance and talent. I think. And uh, we're certain they will learn from this experience. Yep. Um, and maybe they will come back in the second game. But yeah. uh, they really need to have a detailed drafting plan in this game. I think the. I think during the first phase plan, uh, the first phase peak, they do not know what like strong points they have. Yeah. Uh, and they pick Sun Hua and uh, Meng Huo. Like these two heroes are like uh, nearly the same tanky hero, and uh, they're nearly putting the bottom lane. Mm -hmm. They do not know which one to go to the uh, kindness point. Yes. So and okay, we can comes see drafting the phase. Uh -huh. They ban Jing Guan Yu for Vietnam first, and they ban Huang Gai uh, for Thailand. Thailand has shown the crooked way to use Hua Tuo in the last game. Yeah. Outstanding skill cost. 
healing everyone in his team. Will they choose Huatua again in this game? No. I you don't think, think so. You know? hmm. I think Huatua is really playing good in the last game. They ban Yuji first. Yes, Thailand ban Yuji in the first game. They banned a lot of carry uh -huh. hero in the first game. Yeah. And let's see what two heroes they're gonna ban for the second phase. Doing much help. The second one. The third ban for Vinan. I think uh, Huang Ruiying does not really perform well in oh. this mm. in this uh, tournament. Mm. Yeah, Huang Ruiying almost <laughs> lose every game. It's no. like a, Maybe. it's like a trap here. <laughs> Huang Ruiying need to farm fast. Yeah. But uh, if your team is far behind since the landing phase, Wang Yuying can cannot get enough damage in a team fight. Yeah. Yan Liang again. Yan, Yan, Yan Liang was banned in every game. And the Liu Biao is banned. So. Gu Yong. Gu Yong first. It's like. Uh, I think Thailand picked Gu Yong no. first yeah. in the last game. Very useful support here, Gu Yong. Mm -hmm. And uh, Thailand need to pick two pick kills. Two and they uh, pick Huang Yuying. Oh, very quick. <laughs> Thailand want to teach us how to use Huang, Huang Yuying. Yuying. Yep. Huang and Yuying and the Jim Liu, Liu Shan. Liu Shan. Uh, very combo, combo, hero combos. Jim, yep. Jim Liu Shan and Huang Yuying. Jim Liu Shan is very strong in land. I mm -hmm. think they will continue their, st their style to do some harassment. <sighs> Dream Lolly for winner. High damage mid hero and, and Pu Yuan. Yuan. So winner. Yeah, it's very I mean Should, skinny yeah. for the Venus lineup. Should they are confident? Yeah. Pu Yuan and Dream Lolly. Oh, also fragile heroes. Fragile heroes both. Yeah. And, and they have already picked their carry and the mid hero uh. in the first phase of pick. Yeah, they are very confident to show off their hands. Just get me Puyuan. Mm -hmm. I will show you my power. What will Thailand choose for their third pick? Yeah, uh, it's very interesting to see what they will choose. I think they can just choose another support hero. Or show up their uh, top lane hero maybe. Or maybe another mid hero for Kao. To count uh, Dream Lolly in the mid. Mm -hmm. I really want to know what will Cop play in this game. Yeah. Still thinking. Uh, there's 137 left for Thailand. That's a lot of thinking for Thailand. Maybe they are also planning what uh, what they will ban. Sun Quan. Sun Quan. Yeah. Uh, nice hero for team fight, Sun Quan. Yeah. And the second ban phase for both teams. What will Vinan ban here? I think they need to ban some mm, mid hero, maybe. Yeah, Kao is so. Uh, maybe Luo Li, or let me see. So. Uh, Dream Yuan Shao. Oh, so last game they pick uh, Dream Zhang. Zhang Shao. So maybe they should ban that first. Yeah, outstanding playing of Dream Drum Shaw for Kao. Yeah. Another long thing. So they ban Sun Huan here. <laughs> which is picked uh, lastly by their team. Yes, because Huang Yuan they picked last game is already picking by the Thailand. They don't want to be taught by the Thailand in this game. Mm -hmm. Another. Uh, this a long thing for Thailand. Two bands here. I think they should ban the maybe top tennis point top hero. So Lu Ban. And the last band for Vinan. Really, just ban. <laughs> Just been the cost last hero. 
just been called, but uh, maybe cost poor is too deep. large. Yeah, I think both teams they do not uh, contest a lot, so they don't know like uh, mm. hero pools or their drafting uh, strategies. Okay, so they banned that. Dream Zhong Shao. Mm -hmm. Call. So let's see what call left to pick. I think uh, they're like uh, Dream Xiao Chao, Luo Li, and Liu Bei. They're all very good picks. Maybe some hero can make a lot of damage. Mm. I agree because so. uh, how call you really aggressive playing style in last game. I think uh, Luo Li is very good hero to pick. You can do a lot of damage and it's very aggressive place there. And many crowd come true. Okay, Zhang Liao Zhang is Liao. picked. And it's the pity boy. And so as Dream Liu Shan. So one has to play as the top hero maybe. Mm -hmm. Oh, Zhang Liao it, it can play as the top hero actually. Yu Jing and Meng Huo. So both they believe they have good uh, strategy uh, both for Meng Huo. Tanky hero to make space for Pu Yuan. Yeah. And the last hero for Kao. Mm, there's a lot of mm, choice for them to pick. Oh, Dream Xiao Chao. Dream Xiao Chao. Let's see. <laughs> There are two heroes that are like pit lastly on Vietnam side. Yeah. Let's see how they perform this time. Thailand really want to show the crooked way to use hero. Yeah. Well, with Vietnam, let them do this. Because mm -hmm. Vietnam pick prayer in the first picking phase. Yeah. They are. Uh, they want. They just want to shoot their aggressive, like mm -hmm. picking Puyue. Yeah. We will soon start the game. So, you think what side have better picking the drafting phase? Now I'm a big call fan. Mm -hmm. I will definitely, definitely choose Thailand. But you can see Dream Xiao Chao does not perform well in this tournament. Mm -hmm. You think it's the yeah. hero's problem or mm. the uh, <laughs> player's problem maybe? I, should, I shouldn't mm. say that, maybe. Mm. <laughs> we will see in this game. <laughs> now, <laughs> game starts. Okay. Benen gathering on the bottom essence point again. With some commons starting. Yeah, waiting for the essence yeah. and never die. Never die is on the, on the Asian oh. Korea. Uh, he make a word here. Devote. Yeah, he rewarded it. A very mm. nice move for him. Nice move. Never die. Still hunting in the river. Yeah. Like a really warrior here. Mm -hmm. <coughs> okay, we will start in just five seconds. Well, well, the first essence refresh. Let's see. The bottom. Oh, yeah, Art they five. saw the Dep second. <laughs> they was here. Oh my god. Thailand yeah. is very disciplined. Thailand, very precision devote. Hmm. Alex. Oh, nice finally. Nice proc. He will not. Uh, uh, what? No. He still makes some uh, creeps. I wanna say, Cross. Yeah, I no. wanna say that uh, he maybe he knows how to block on the way wood side, but not on the way side. Ta and uh, this Pai come here. Yeah, they wanna Alex. grab the first kill. Oh, Alex again suffering on the landing base. Yep. <laughs> not good for him. Ellie and the call in the mid lane. <laughs> Offside is choose some conservative here. Kawa skill, skill uh, costing okay. again. We got the wrench crew. Ellie. And the Ellie's level 3 actually. But uh, two creeps here. They are waiting for their portion. 
Oh, Alex again. They wanna get Alex first. Alex back to the tower, but only level one. Again, suffering. Never dies like uh, farming freely in lane. Cow. Cow used all his mana. But the SHP is low. Mm -hmm. and, uh, Alex, don't you dare smile the creeps. Alex will be for this Maybe game. Maybe he should practice a little bit more with this hero, Meng Huo. Clay. Mm -hmm. oh, come to the base, never die. Okay. Invade the jungle. Uh, yeah, you want like a delay a little bit of Shai's farm. Yes, devotes the hair and the broke the creeps. Shai, Shai and Joyce want to stay. Okay. Never die, never, never die. die. Died. First blood, IQ, first the blood, embracing hero. And uh, Carl. Carl wanna grab the room? Yes, the SS it? in okay. his portion. Okay. Go back to the middle line. Mm -hmm. This time Ellie do a good good job. A nice knife call. Yeah. Oh Alex. Alex is still level two. Level two. You cannot oh, farm the What lane. can I do, Alex said? Clear. Oh my god. Oh call. To his barely, aggressive hair. Barely make it. Ellie, can he come back to the land? No. Oh stand on the high ground. Yeah. Only smiles, the creeps. Okay, uh, he stunned him. In the tower. The, okay. Oh, nice kill for Carl. Solo <laughs> Another kill. solo kill for him. Really outstanding play of Carl. Yeah. Clear the never die. Meanwhile, in the bottom lane. I think although never die is a little bit uh, mm, behind. The, he's still better Can farm than Alex. At Alex again, oh and the call with his ulti. Another solo kill for Carl. Oh. Oh, what an unbelievable performance for him. Really outstanding favor. Mm -hmm. Never die in way to the jungle of the winner. Mm -hmm. yeah, oh, Alex. Uh, Alex down again. Please, Alex said. He, he, I think he just needs to focus on blocking the waves. Not to oh, like just, uh, uh, help, or just help uh, his carrier to farm other ancient creeps. Yeah, maybe. Or farm in his own jungle. The land is too hot for him. Yeah. Uh, they are farming the other side of the jungle. And, uh, but uh, we can see who is farming uh, Carl, fast. Carl got the speed essence. He's hasted. And yeah, call, uh, come here. And then shine. And oh yeah, my god! Nice damage is calculating. And the uh, call again, but he has no magic. Can he make it? No. He has the haste essence. He can make it out, I think. I know. Oh, Joyce is good for that. Yeah. Almost level 8, but lack of mana. Mm -hmm. He needs to. Go back to fountain. To he spawn. got the bottle. He can like uh, heal a little bit. Mm -hmm. I'm still waiting in the middle line. Okay, we can see the wins for me. Though he has died once, mm -hmm. really fast. Oh my God! Kelly can never die, but yeah, yeah. never dies. Really tank here. Can mm -hmm. never die. Gets out. Retreat yeah, fountain. Every the man is getting here. Okay, he's done. But we can see Thailand already make a 3k gold lead. Ah, and and Alex again, Alex only level 4. What can he do now? Uh, yeah, he cannot stay in lands. He's too. Okay, Kao is getting him. No, he's getting best. Level up. Never there again. Invade the jungle. You wanna see if. The enemy is farming mm. on this side jungle. However, they are farming the other side. The boss is already in the boss point. And we can see 
this kind of Huang Yuein playstyle is very different from mm -hmm. the Vinance Huang Yuein. Like this uh, oh. Thailand's Huang Yuein just farming the jungle. Mm -hmm. Never die. Never die. Yeah, and guys the cow. The cow. Yeah. The twin star of Thailand. Yeah. Yeah. The Yuqing. Uh, now it's still level 5, not level 6. Need the experience. Where is the experience? Mm -hmm. Alex, can he get this creeps? Talent oh, one he's blinking. He my other creeps. And the oh, Huawei nice ulted in and make it out. Oh, oh Alex. And okay, nah. we are use his out and uh, a very good move for him. That will be a one for one. Mm -hmm. But uh, Alex is totally wrecked. Now what the here again invaded the jungle and the creep chasing him, but uh, here comes Carl. He needed to retreat. Yeah. So it's like a uh, 4k lead for Thailand. I think Venan uh play a little bit better this game. Carl moving bottom. Yeah. Kali, yeah, have some damage. Never die here. Can you get Kali? Yes, never die. Last hit. And Ellie is here. Now but Ellie only level 8. Barely see Ellie doing something. Again, in yeah, the top lane. Joyce. Joyce I think Fuyan should go farming in his jungle now. He should not go into the lane. Yeah, I think so. However, it's like only 1k behind the farming, maybe. Yeah, we are in the farm now. Oh. Okay. So Sun Quan use his ulti out to push the tower. And they are taking down towers first. First turn embrace the throne from Acre 11. And uh, already get his twin sword for yeah. Thailand. However, I think both teams have not thought about getting the boss. Yeah. Maybe they're just not aware of that. Still drinking the jungle. Uh -huh. And Alex TP down. He wanna, s he Alex. wanna take never die down, maybe? Alex level is too low. Okay, so Thailand is taking the enemies uh, uh, boss. Talent rush, Venus boss. But uh, out of okay, five, he's out. Mm -hmm. Yes, he can okay. get it. It's done. Again, Venus lost his boss. <laughs> Not a good news for them. And it's nearly a eight k lead. Never Dash it to Reva again. Alex miss it. Alex is too low here, he need to farm, but nowhere to farm, the top tower is already down. Stop. I think they should uh, try to make some way to invade the bottom for Thailand. Or take their own boss. Oh yeah. Nice ulti here, can you get yeah. never die? Oh yeah. Never die is too tanky I think. They, they the only two heroes. They should. Yeah. They should wait for well, the Alex. Alex, to come. Alex yeah. will have a block. Please, not that. Fu Yuan is still very high net force here, but his team is already eight eight k behind the Thailand. Fu Yuan needs to farm more. He is the last hope of winner. Never there. Drop in and yeah, get Alex. Alex. Alex's level is too low. Oh. And he's going back. He's going back for Krebs. You can see in the bottom. Drop his out. Uh, both out are dropped. Yes, Fen Chen is his out and uh, Huang Yuan cast his out. And they're pushing the second tower. Second tower will down here. Okay. Again, Tark. Get uh, invaded up. Get uh, Kali here. Yeah, a nice uh, performance for Kao. And uh, another tower for Thailand. Nelly blinks in and they wanna get Kao. However, <laughs> well, not yeah. a good choice for Ellie. Yeah. And you can see the Thailand. good difference between the two mid heroes. 
It's like a 5k lead mm -hmm. for Kao versus Ali. Yeah. Yeah, but then I tried to push the bottom tower. tower. It's a free turret, I think. Okay, the Thailand is pushing tower and uh, come through the farming zoo when uh, Alex come again to clear the land. But uh, never there, just too tanky. Okay, oh, some shy. Here comes shy. You see out, but uh, barely. Mm, not a nice block here. Mm -hmm. Never die. On to fight back. His yeah. teammates is close. I'm yeah. 30. And never this die. die. Okay, never die. Never die dies. Force. But here Hard. comes the shoot. Here comes the uh, Sun Chen and the, the Liu Shan. Targeting to uh -huh. the jungle. Yeah. Nobody was here. Mm -hmm. And this guy tall and uh, I think they cannot contact mm, after the tower. Yeah, they need to give the tower maybe. Artifice, really good item. Okay, so get again. Yeah, the blinking and the cow blinking as well. Use uh, all we his skills. Everyone's uh, done. This game is hard for winner now. Yeah, and the never is pushing the mid tower as well. We are gonna fight too much. We need to do a lot more farming. Now he is about uh, 4k behind, behind the, the artifact. I think it's wide and behind. Yeah. And Thailand try to control the map. Get again. Oh See God. and uh, Joyce here. Joyce is not oh, down. Oh, we're coming here. Oh my. Nice out for Pu Yuan. Yeah. They still have a lot of damage. And they get down Kao. Uh, Artify. Yeah, now the good difference is like pulled back a little bit. Yeah, but the player still need more items, much more items. Thailand uh, getting their first boss, and uh, I think they need, they left the uh, never fire for Kao. It's the magic enhancement item for them. Again, invade the jungle and get two people here. A nice player for Tau, and yeah, here artifact. comes the artifact OT. Everyone is down here. A nice Three initiator down. for Tau. Three hero down for Winman. And oh, they there. just need to push the maybe mid tower yeah. or the bottom uh, lane. Yeah. I think the uh, last game was a performance of Kao and this game is a performance of the stream Liu Shan. Mm -hmm. uh, we are main nice in Asia 18 here. Yeah. And they play a combo between Liu Shan just jumps in with uh, out of the uh, Yes, Artify with his out really high damage and Artify hit 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 again. Clear with his out. Can he live? No. no. Huang Yuying really hit damage here. Yeah. Though he has no ulti here, yeah. never die. Uh, never die is um. playing with these two heroes. Very and tanky. Uh, yeah, Ali has the magic damage. So. Call. But Call is back. Try to revenge for the never die. And they get the first yeah. high ground tower. Meanwhile, the bottom tower is Again, down. Again, Tau breaking. We almost hit out. But uh, the. Cannot to resist the uh, damage from Huang Yuying. Yep. Artify. Push. Okay. Artify was out blinking. Oh my nice God, choice. Three people got caught. You get a ca every crawler controller and. Oh. Uh, this is like a textbook and team fight. Yes. And the shy Joyce mm -hmm. want to fight with. Sun Chen's out. And mid tower is done as well. No, there's no, ma no, no many magic artifact. Mm -hmm. they retreat. Call yeah. with his ulti and still okay. costing skills. Shai, Shai haven't seen Call and already. Again, Tao into the high ground of Vietnam. Oh. Nice team fight for Thailand. Sweet. Uh, we down. Down. Oh. Only Puya is alive. And but the artifact was killed by the tower. Last hit. Yeah. Those artifact, but Kao is still alive. Kao, hide them here. And 
in town shy. Cow is very low. Cow still make dies, damage. But he Kao has didn't the want leeching. Cow didn't want to retreat again on the high ground. Will die jump scene. And uh, oh, that the cow. Yeah, they do not have uh, artifact here. They have to wait a little bit for him to push the tower. Since they're... That's Dream Illusion. Yeah. Really I think they can do the again. combo again. <laughs> Combo oh comes again. God. Everyone was in. Huang Yuan is out. Yeah. Uh, Jun Liu Shan, Fu Yuan was in out, but not enough damage. Jun Liu Shan come back to his teammates and they get uh, four people down off the net. Okay, so that's uh, three mid barracks for them and also the top barracks. Maybe the game will end. In Maybe this, they just uh, push the base? Never die. Uh, they retreat a little bit. Maybe they want to kill the second boss. Okay, so Still hanging just under the high ground of the uh, Thailand. Very aggressive. Just uh, go straight to the last high ground tower. Again, Dream Liu Shan with Huang Yuan is out. Oh my god. And Kao blinks out and he got a hex. Kao. Kao. Kao, can, can he make it? Kao, Kao is that? Let's and play early. You make your revenge. However, now you can go to your fountain. Unstoppable. And it's 42 versus 9. Yeah, very big Thailand. score. Outstanding play. In Thailand, like, we are. Dominate Fuki maybe. I get into the high ground tower and, and the uh, shy is put back? Alex Alex gonna go. Alex was too low. Yeah. Alex everyone blinks into the high ground. Will that be the last team fight? Mm, I think so. Can't come back from the base. Mm -hmm. Destroy the last tower. Yeah. Nothing. Uh, that's a mega creep. And yeah. shy down. Thailand didn't want anyone left yeah. in the base. And, uh, they just need to push the end case. This will be a GG call for the map. Alex died in the tile 4 tower mm -hmm. in front of his base. Oh, Ellie, Ellie Jin, he, he wants really to get, wanna get artifact. the artifact. However, but artifact is like, uh, like nearly dead. Still surviving and never die. Oh, he's like <laughs> too tanky and they dive into the, the fountain. fountain. The tower is down, base is here. But when I when I don't want to this match end here, they yes. chase uh, chase out of the base. They make some progression. I can see the uh, Venus player uh, like smiling in Thailand, their face. Yeah, Thailand uh, need to wait for never day respond. I think they just get the uh, boss and then push. Yes, there will be they a are get, call. Yeah, they are gathering. Uh, Alex cannot even contest <laughs> the. <laughs> Alex, what are you doing? Oh my god. Oh my he's, god. He's Alex was killed by the creeps. He creeps. <laughs> And uh, meanwhile, no. Thailand slayed their boss. Okay, Artifact is like on the. Oh, Artifact has a. Uh, illusion on the. An illusion. So the Mega Creep are like really beefy. Uh, oh, yeah, you see, it's out to clean uh, the creeps. Okay. All creeps have destroyed oh, the God. base. Uh -huh. Congratulations to, to the Thailand. Yeah, what impressive performance Very for Thailand. Very nice play, yeah. Yeah. It's a really good play for them. They are very excited. Yeah. I think Vietnam play better in the second game at the early mm. stage. Yes, but... But the uh, once the team fight is on, they cannot contest anymore. They have a really great uh, hero combo uh, of with Thailand. Fu Yuan and... Uh, uh, was, uh, I mean Thailand, Dream Liu Shan okay. and Huang Yuan Yin. Yeah, really Dream good uh, combo. And 
they have Zhang Liao and uh, Sun Quan as well, which are very yeah. heavily on team fights. Yeah, they dominate every team fight scene. As the game. I said in the like early stage, uh, this is gonna be a very heavy team fight based game yeah. in this best of three, and we see very good performance on these two teams. However, Thailand is beyond our expectations. Yes, and, uh, I think Alex really needed to train his block creep skill. Yeah, like on both sides, they, he did not block the waves. Maybe uh, he should train a little bit more. Uh, I think uh, on Thailand, uh, uh, Kao did very good in both two games in this mm -hmm. best of three. Mm -hmm. But uh, in this game, I think uh, Ta, the Dream Lucian player, mm -hmm. uh, make a much outstanding playing than Kao in this game. Yep, I agree so. His initiation was so beautiful and uh, splendid. Mm -hmm. And they should cast the aggression. Yeah. And, and I think like uh, Thailand in Group B, they show their dominance. Mm -hmm. Maybe they will be the top team in the Group B. Yeah, really nice play. Uh, however, uh, Vietnam, I don't know if they can come back in the later game. Yeah, maybe. I think uh, Vietnam still have uh, potential. I think their uh, drafting mm -hmm. is very professional. Mm -hmm. They know how to come back in the second game, but Thailand is just uh, too well skilled. Yeah, uh, they play too aggressively and they cannot contest. Who do you think will be the MVP of this game? I think uh, maybe. Uh, let me see. Tay. Yes, who is the yeah, case will be we'll Tay? play as the Dream Liu Shan. Great initiation for him. Yeah. Help team winning every team fights in this they game. Need. Yeah, really impressive play for him. I think like Thailand's team fight skill are like very textbook. Mm -hmm. Like, uh, like every skill they make is like uh, you can copy in other in drafting phase. Yes. Uh -huh. Like even oh, there will be uh, highlights here mm -hmm. in seconds. Come back, really marvelous highlight replay here. We can see in this game, 
the Thailand star player. I think the Thai, the most dream losing player, mm-hmm. really make、uh, outstanding play skills. He his skill casting,、yeah. uh, his cutting choice and、uh, timing choice,、yeah. and、uh, his combo with his carry player. And、uh, I wanna say one thing that there's a really one interesting s- s- thing. Like Thailand, they pick.、Uh, oh, I mean Vietnam,、mm-hmm. they pick、uh, Dream Xiao Chao and、uh, Huang Yueying as the first game,、mm-hmm. and Thailand they pick the same player as、mm-hmm. the second game. Yeah, and、uh, Thailand win both games. Yeah. Yeah. They have a really good game skill. Yeah, they have really good understanding of these both heroes. They capture like combo with other、mm-hmm. team fight heroes, especially like Dream Liu Shan and Zhang Liao, which are very heavy team fight base. And Sun Quan. Yeah, Sun Huan is not a really good pick for like to. Com- like、uh, to combo with both heroes. Yeah, so one is more like an individual playing here. Yeah, so V Nan they maybe、uh, they should、uh, learn more of, like in this RTAG games. Yes, and the Thailand really great、uh, team execution skill. They just uh, uh, just after the landing phase,、mm-hmm. just、uh, keep trying to make every initiation in the map. Yep. Keep team fighting, keep team fighting because they know the advantage of their drafting.、Yep. Uh, really good、uh, team fighting skills with Sun Quan, Zhang Liao, and、uh, combo of Dream Liu Shan and、mm-hmm. Huang Yueying. Yep. So they know how to win in this game. That's very important.、Uh, I think、yeah. that they have a professional coach to make drafting and strategy in game for them, and also I think、uh, Pu Yuan do not perform. Oh, we can see their statistic board here. Yeah, and、uh, again, fifty-three kills, almost sixty for Thailand.、Uh, really great play. Really remarkable play for Thailand. And the damage is like ten, one hundred k lead for Thailand.、Mm-hmm. Uh, I think the economy is like because they they lost one or two heroes in the last team fight. The the net worth is pulled back a little bit. However, they they destroy、uh, all the towers. Well, Vietnam have not touched one tower yeah. yet. Yeah, eleven tower in this game. <coughs> one more tower than the last game. <laughs> Yeah, and、uh, we can see like,、uh, who do you think will be the MVP? Okay, Artify, Artify, Artify was Dream Liu Shan really make huge damage in、yeah. the team fights. He perform, although like、uh, he did、I、not、yep. see very more highlight in the team fight. We can see like he make every right decision in the. Uh, team fight and、uh, also in the landing phase、yes. and in the early early phase, and、uh, he has a very good chemistic、mm-hmm. reaction with his potent dream Liu Shan. Yeah, maybe I think、uh, in the following games, just like one or two two people in one person. Yeah,、mm, they are really seamless coordination here. Mm-hmm. Uh, and I think the、uh, tall and、uh, or artifact could both be the MVP of this game. Yep. And the、uh, I think like、uh, in the late phase, like uh, uh, Thailand, uh, maybe the only way. To okay. So we、uh, will be back in in a while. See you soon in the next match. <laughs>
关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了，困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。
了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。
累了、困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。
了，困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。Good afternoon from the Real Situation Game Match Revenue. I'm Caster Luo Chen. I'm Caster Meng Yaofang. Okay, this competition is jointly organized by Olympic Council of Asia and the Asian Electronic Sports Federation, operated by Digital Esports China Asia.、Uh, first of all, we like to thank our prestige sponsor to FAW Audi Q4 Etron for their strong support for the event. Also, special thanks to iCool, the official mobile game equipment of the RDAG, the professional choice to empower victory, embrace the thrill of control. Let us also thank our official supporter, Omen. New Omen, new journey to the road to the Asian Games. Let us also thank our official supporter, Auto4. Auto4, official gaming chair partner of the road to the Asian Games. Be your own hero. Thank you to official supporter Easter Rock for their support. We would also like to thank our official broadcasting platforms: Bilibili, Huya Live, Douyu Live, Kuaishou Games, China Mobile, Migu Channels, Tencent Live, Weibo, Xiaohongshu, YouTube, and Twitch for their support. Okay, so、uh, we have seen the best of three be between Thailand and、uh, Vietnam before. And the Thailand is like make very impressive、uh, performance in the、uh, in the game,、uh, and、uh, right now we gonna see the upcoming matchup between、uh, Hong Kong China versus Ni Nepal. Nepal, and we can see the Hong Kong China's lineup: Long, Cascade,、uh, Roy Ip,、uh, Tinky, and Martin. And, and we can see Nepal's lineup:、uh, Guido,、uh, Dreamy, Air Wave, Woody, and Snow B. And、uh, so we have seen the Hong Kong China's performance before、uh, in the first match between China and、uh, Hong Kong China. Yep. And uh, uh, which is、um, I would like to say not a ten tense matchup.、Uh, however, Hong Kong. China has shown their、uh, has shown their、um, uh, tactical, yeah,、uh, in the game. So we would expect there will be a threat to uh, Nepal. Uh, however,、um, since、um, we haven't seen Nepal's match before,、uh, we would expect them to perform、uh, better than we expected. Uh, and uh, uh, Let's come back to our previous match to discuss a little bit about their、uh, the combo lineup between the、uh, Huang Yueying and the Dream Liu Shan,、uh, which is very,、mm -hmm. which is very、uh, powerful combo. So, uh, like uh, 
Nepal, if they do not, uh, they have like uh, uh, get into the game like in a very early stage, like uh, they cannot understand the uh, maybe the deeper strategy very well. They should focus on the team fight. Uh, however, for Hong Kong, China, uh, I think they have built a better understanding in the game. So, uh, how to uh, build around their most important hero is like one of the crucial things in the uh, game. And uh, also, um, things like uh, we we would like to get back to talk a bit about the carry positions a little bit. Like uh, in Dream Three Kingdoms, the carry position are like one of the most crucial position in this game. However, like uh, you have to f like. Uh, the only thing in the early stage for this kind of hero is to farm enough gold so that they can get the crucial items like the uh, like the damage item or the magic in new item uh, so that they can do some performance in the middle mm -hmm. stage. However, like uh, we can see in the previous uh, previous match. Okay, so we can see right now it's the players yeah. on the screen. Mm -hmm. It should be the Hong Kong China's player, and, and here is the Nepal's player. Yes, and uh, uh, they are communicating with their reference. So I think in the first game today, Hong Kong China versus Hong Kong, their carrier didn't show his skills in the game. I yeah. think it's just because of the China's pressure was too high. Yeah, I think uh, they can perform better in mm -hmm. the second game. Because in their drafting place, face, uh, Hong Kong China has showed their tactical thought yeah. and uh, understanding the game. Mm. But uh, I think uh, they need uh, much more easier health combo, just like in the last game, Dream Liu Shang and uh, Huang Yuying. Yeah. And uh, I think uh, Hong Kong China should uh, focus more on their both Russian because they lost almost every Russian in the first game versus China. Yeah. Uh, they need to control their version, mm -hmm. their own map, and uh, their boss. Uh, they, they should slay their boss first play in the game, so they can get a boss item and uh, make uh, demon, demon Slayer uh, re re respawn in their own side. Yeah. Mm, I think like uh, although Nepal is a small country, uh, they still have very talented players to yeah. Yeah, play in the RDAG, both in this, uh, this tournament and in the coming up uh, mm -hmm. uh, Asia games. I think uh, they come from the Southern Asia region. Yep, and uh, yeah, I play with the other Southern Asian players uh, to play some other mobile games. Mm -hmm. I think. Uh, India, India players are very fascinating in this genre of games. Yeah, I think so did the uh, Nepal players. Yeah, India, Nepal, Pakistan. Mm -hmm. They are both. Their population are both mm -hmm. uh, have a high passion in mobile games. Yeah, and uh, so I think uh, during the draft draft phase, we can see the pattern pattern of uh, Hong Kong China like uh, they wanna build around their carry heroes mm -hmm. and uh, although they do not perform well okay we can see there's the drafting phase mm -hmm. and they bend the yeah Hong Kong China on the wood side and, and uh, uh, Nepal on the wayside side. we are waiting for Nepal to do the first, first two, two bands Nepal have a long thinking in their first two bets. Yep. That's not common because uh, usually before the they matches start. Yeah, they will think up uh, how to. Okay, so they ban Luca. 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 And uh, their second ban will be. Mm -hmm. I think, uh, I think uh, they should ban some carry here. Yeah, they ban. Yeah, Pu Yuan. Yuan. A very strong pair carry here. You can see it uh, in the... Two ban for Hong Kong China. Uh -huh. They ban Huang Gai and uh, Sun Huan. Mm -hmm. Both are the top lane hero, right? Yeah, solo hero. Mm -hmm. 
And uh, both are very tanky here. Yeah, and can harassing lands. And uh, I think a way they should focus on banning the carry heroes as well. There, there are still dream Cao Cao in the pool. Yeah, and, and uh, maybe Huang Yuying. Huang Yuying. Yeah, we can see in the last match mm -hmm. between Thailand and Vietnam, Huang Yuying plays an uh, outstanding performance. Yeah. Still thinking for Nepal? Yeah, it's a really long sink. I think they're coming up with the whole strategy for the for the drafting phase on Nepal yeah. since it's a really long thing. So they're building up the um, strategies yeah. in the in the optional time phase. Yeah. Only one hundred and twenty seconds left for Nepal. Maybe Dream Cao Cao? Yep. Or oh, Huang Yuying or oh, Yu Ji. We can see Yu Ji was banned in every early game yep. today. Still sinking. Okay, so they banned Dream Guan Yu for Nepal. Hong Kong, and China turn to pick. Pick first. And they pick Wu Yong, a uh, very uh, usual pick. Uh, very cool. safe pick. Yes. To pick the support hero first. I think Nepal, they just need to grab the two most powerful heroes, maybe. Like Huang Yuying, maybe. Oh, well, they have some combos. Yes, tactic combos. Hua, Hua Tuo again in the game. I think Hua Tuo is a really mm, safe pick, I would like to say. Yeah. Same as Gu Yong. Yeah. Hua Tuo and uh, Diao Chan. Diao Chan. Diao Chan. It's very unusual pick. But uh, Dream Wen Shao and uh, Yu Ji. So the Hong Kong China, mm -hmm. Yu Ji and the Dream Wen Shao, both most powerful game, yeah. a powerful hero in this game. It's turn for the Nepal to choose. Yeah. They let Hong Kong China choose Yu Ji. What will they choose to counter Yu Ji? Because Yu Ji is uh, really the tier zero hero mm -hmm. in this version. Xu Chu, a tanky hero. Yeah, I think Diao Chan is played as uh, the kindness point mm -hmm. since he got a very good out which can control like uh, every hero, uh, both. Uh, ally or enemy hero mm -hmm. for uh, like longest time is six seconds hong kong trying to bend the dream lolly yeah i think uh, nepal should uh, pick a uh, mid hero or they they haven't show up their carry as well right yeah <laughs> true it's a tanky mm -hmm. the carry here only Huang Yuying or Dream Cao Cao. Yeah. Uh, it's a even strength as Yu Ji. Ban Xu Huang. Hmm. It's not a normal ban for Xu Huang. Yep. We can see what uh, Nepo wanna build up with since I think Xu Chu and Diao Chan they do not suit very well in the um, both landing phase. Yeah, I just think they do not fit well in the landing place. Let's wait and see what they're gonna pick. Last bet for Nepal, they only got 16, 16 minutes. 60 seconds 60 for seconds. the last band. And uh, to pick, they are still sinking. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Nepal, still sinking. I think they should. Uh, uh, a tanky hero. Yeah. Yan Liang. Yan Liang yeah. is a very good band for them. Um, Yan Liang is actually Yan Liang is banned in every game today. I think they can just ban Huang Yuying. Oh, they ban Luo Li. 
uh, very unusual pick. I think it's the first band in today's matchups. But I think Hong Kong China just want to restrain the Nepal's mid choice. Yeah. But there's still plenty of good uh, Xiao Chao. Okay. Nepal pick Xiao Chao. And uh, turn for Hong Kong China to pick two heroes. Yeah. Liu Biao. Uh, a strong tanky and the team fighting heroes. They still need to choose a kind of nearest point. Yeah, Pan Feng is very. I think uh, it's an uh, unusual pick for yeah. Hong Kong China. Maybe it's the training drop tank. Yeah. What will the pole pick? Sun Luban. Sun Luban is a very powerful kindness hero yeah. in this game. Mm -hmm. Okay, both team has finished their drafting. And Whose draft uh, do you like? I like uh, Nepal's draft uh, a little bit, uh, mm -hmm. but uh, I don't know if they can understand their lineup very well. Since Xiao Chao and uh, let me see. Xiao Chao and uh, Diao Chan can do a combo and uh, mm, I think uh, they will be very powerful mm. in the um, like uh, team fight phase if they can perform well in the early mm -hmm. stage. Mm -hmm. But I like Hong Kong China's drift because uh, Yuji with Guyong is too powerful in okay. this game. Yeah. Okay, here we go. The game start. Mm -hmm. You can see Hong Kong China is the wu side and Nepal is the wu side. And uh, the five heroes on the wu side, Nepal is a oh, very unusual moving of yeah, Nepal. They all go top lane and they make a ward just on the top of the mid lane river. Uh, as for Hong Kong China, okay, they are going a little bit early to put a land, in, but uh, I think Hong Kong already see that. Yes, they can put a sentry and reward it. Yes, Jets. but I don't know if uh, they have checked their items. Jets kit, will he reward it? No, I don't think so. I think they have not checked their items, so they do not know. Uh, put a but ward this in. strange moving. Yeah, <laughs> I agree. So. Yeah, and here's the landing phase. 10 seconds for Essence to refresh. Mm -hmm. we, who will get the Essence? I think uh, Nepal did not want to contest the Essence. Mm -hmm. They, they okay. just want to block so the waves. Liu Bei get uh, Magic Essence. Mm -hmm. uh, Nepal, okay. Nepal is saving the Essence. Or just waiting for landing phase? Is that mm. retreating? Let's see the mid lane. Dreamy and the royal. Royal up in today's play. Uh -huh. Lose to the China's player. Mm -hmm. And uh, Dreamy. Nice last hit. Royal up waiting for Charles. His first last hit. Oops. Dreamy, really confident with his skill costing. Mm -hmm. And the Jazz kicked, stay in his own tower. Dreamy mm -hmm. control the land in the river. Very good play. And nice last uh, hit. Yeah, and uh, really uh, when I use the skill to keep the food <coughs> well, in the bottom lane, Tiki with the body. Farm his body in the long, lane. long farming in the jungle. Mm -hmm. So it's Martin might help him. Yeah. You said that uh, Yuji is very powerful. Yep. Mm -hmm. I think he is the most powerful oh. carry hero now. Okay. Roll up and the dreamy, both slow. Yeah, but to really have better health, I think. Jimmy, oh, he's, uh, he's down, and he blinks away. Oh and no, oh. last attack by the tower, Jimmy. Too oh. aggressive. Okay, that's the uh, Iku first blood. Embrace the thrill. Drinking versus Woody. Mm -hmm. 
morting. Getting close, but just uh, pull the creeps. Yeah, pull the quick camps to save some uh, equip for their uh, for their carry. And, uh, they and are uh, just farm peacefully in the bottom. Yeah. Farm besides the land. And Woody what is a little bit say? too low. Martin get Woody. Woody get the blink. I think no. Oh. She did not Tinky. make it out. We can get a Woody. And the Dreamy is. Okay, Dreamy. can Dreamy make yo, it? Yo, yep. Can Dreamy make it? He's stunned again. Enough damage here? No. Nope. Okay, he missed some skills. And uh, Relic can still chase him. Okay, it's like one last hit. Uh, he did not make it. And yo, yo, okay, he blinks nice in and uh, get the kill. A really? nice card for Royal yep. And got a recovery. No, yeah, he did I'll not check it. Oh, come yeah, on. I think uh, he can see it. Uh, recovery SS. Oh, he just uh, wants oh, to <laughs> move back to the base. Okay. Okay. <laughs> um, not really smart move for Royal. Yep. Yeah. Jet kit and the uh, air wheel on the top lane. Royal, yep. Come back to the mid lane. The enemy just found me me already level 6. Mm -hmm. Okay, invading the jungle and the dash out. Just kids waiting for some trades. They are way back to the land. And uh, the dreamy was down again by Royal yet. Is Royal. that our solo kill? I think so. I think uh, Royal is the dominant one. No yeah. one noticed the recover recovery essence actually. Yes. Thinking already level 6. Level 7. And Woody only level 5. Creeps mm -hmm. is into the tower. And uh, she's got level 6, which can give her some chance to make a solo kill maybe uh, juke someone back to the tower in the outing okay let's we see. find a dreamy oh my god we barely go. make it they miss both two skills and one more and uh, the Hong Kong China already rush their boss uh, they get their boss. boss and the dreamy saw the recovery and uh, she took it as granted. And the relief goes back and see a very healthy Xiao Chao, maybe. She okay. has a kid. Yes. No, be, no, be only life 5. Guido mm -hmm. got she's out. Guido is out. But However, the damage Snobie. is too low. Can he retreat? Okay. Snobby survive and get Jet's kid mm -hmm. in their own jungle. Nice yeah. player for Gord. Mm -hmm. I think uh, <coughs> I think they have miscalculated the damage. Yeah, and the uh, greedy has out. Yep. Drinking, farming in the jungle, and uh, just get back to land. Yep. Yeah, we we'll waiting for the land come back. Oh, Martin get dreamy in the jungle. Oh, really? Martin nice and along. Yeah. It's not a very usual for carrier to mm. go get yeah, Royal Leap is like farming the jungle. Yeah. Carrier and a sport go kank. Mid uh, farming the jungle. I think Nepal did pulling the farming phase. They already like make a ten K lost in the early networks. Yes, and they need to slay their boss quickly or Hong Kong okay. China will take their boss. Nice cutting for Royal, yep. And the Dreamy does not make it in time. Dreamy was totally controlled by the Royal, yep. Mm -hmm. Although he makes some good movement in early stage. <laughs> okay, we can yes, see the power of the face fighting. As comes along and marching along. Uh, there are three heroes in the top. So blended support for now and Martin. Jazz kids will get back. Will China Hong Kong push the tower? 
But uh, Nepal has already organized defense on the uh, top tower. Is it a uh, 3 vs 3 in the top? Or they just want to defend their tower? Yeah. Just kids behind the tower. You see Snowdy and the air wave. Yeah. Just kids again. Can he get an initiate? Air wave. The tower is attacked. Just kids. Hua Tuo and Haley. Long, it's down the air wheel, air wheel, uh, initiation, but his uh, HP is too low. Oh, uh, nice! OT okay, for OT. Yeah, Jimmy, come here! Okay, Jimmy, enough damage for Jimmy. And no, Grudu, can she still make damage? Jimmy is still chasing Martin. Can Martin survive? I Martin see. is still come. Here comes Jet Kid again. Jimmy is down, and Jet Kid chasing Snowbeast. Snowbeast back. Can he retreat? Yes. No, just kid, don't want him to go, but here, here we have a strong from the base and TP out. Oh, Yuji come! Again! A long team fight here, and uh, Hong Kong China get 11 to 3 in this game. Well, really nice play for Hong Kong China. And, uh, we can see that uh, Guido uh, makes some good outs, however, the outs do not have any damage. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, the hero herself does not have any damage and the uh, other hero does not come in time so that uh, although Dreamy Xiao Chao comes later in game yeah. but uh, they only got their uh, they only got their hey, chasing too th far yeah chasing too far so that uh, uh, I think uh, Just Kids uh, goes back in and uh, slay down the Royal uh, with his ult and call in and, and the here comes the tricky comes in as well Snowy and can uh, Woody up. got uh, a lot of Royal damage still making damage Woody, Woody is down so Woody is down as well so does the Groody oh Hong Kong China really nice play that will be a 3 to 0 yep. A really good performance for Roy Lip. He used mm. himself to jump into the high ground and uh, uh, Roy Lip again jumping onto the Dreamy's face. Roy Lip with his W. Can he get a Dreamy? Dreamy is twisting. Dreamy is strong. Oh, Dreamy oh. take him first. I think Dreamy got. Xiao Xiao get a really high damage. Yeah. He, he's just played too carelessly for Roy Lip. Roy Lip show a lot of confidence. Uh -huh. And the Chenki gets the oh. air waves stunned. Air wave just died yeah. in front of the Tire 2 tower. Mm -hmm. Hong Kong China. Trying to farm the other side's boss, but uh, they, uh, they know they it. cannot make it. Created from the boss point, but uh, still gathering in the mid line. Mm -hmm. Long has already 17k gold. He yeah, is a very it. powerful Yuji. I think they take down both the tower on the wayside for a contract. And there's already a. Oh. Again, Ruyu is calling with Blink and Ulti, and the Tricky wants to stun the Nepal's hero. Yes, Guido is down. He has, he has all cast his ult. Yeah. And uh, Snow the Okay. Uh, we well done. And the Snow P, can he leave? No P. Still really jumps down. in and uh, grab his. Jenki and Martin, Royal Whip like a monster in the battlefield. Take down three heroes, I think, in this team fight. And the Snowy tipped out again. And Royal Whip is yes. chasing from in the enemy's jungle. Mm -hmm. I think. Oh, this is a second boss on Hong Kong, uh, Hong Kong China side on. Yeah, Royal Up and Long is gathering around the boss point. Yeah. And the Jazz Kid mm -hmm. pushes the bottom line. Yeah. Jimmy cast his skills. Jazz mm -hmm. Kid just want to kill him. Jimmy line. really wanna get Jazz Kid. Hong China, and that's a bot. It's a carry. Yeah. Along. Along will get carry on. I think they need to push mid, get a second tower. Or 
They just want to on the bottom to side. On the side. Jet is caught. Jimmy get just kid in the bottom lane. I think Jimmy is perform really well in this game. He she, maybe he's just a little bit nervous in the star up laning phase. Yes. And that he just like uh, uh, just calm down a little bit and then got a really good kills. Yes, Hong Kong China gathering around the Asian creeps. Maybe they want to come to the boss point mm -hmm. of and the Jimmy Nepal. Is, uh, Jimmy was caught by the just kid and here comes the long. Really high damage. Jimmy is down. Hong Kong China, can they get the boss? No, they were not contest the boss. Like all heroes are. Woody, why are you here? Uh, Woody blink out. out. Blow you up. Don't want to let it go. Yep. Woody retreat to their own high ground, but, but a tricky. Yeah, he's still caught. And I think, I think that will be the end of the Woody. I think that's a waste of our yeah. own Roy Lip. Roy Lip, <laughs> really confident and aggressive play. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, although, like uh, Hong Kong, China have built some very big lead, gold lead. They do not know how to like make the lead into victory. Yeah, right tricky. Now. Again, get the Guido in the top lane. Uh huh. Guido does mm. not have blink. Oh, there's a oh, pass. Pass. Right now. Maybe there's a. Uh, there's some technical there's issues. Maybe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Hong Kong, China. I think they should uh, control the map too. Yeah, control map. most of the areas and uh, give more pressure to the Nepal, just like uh, China and the Thailand do. Yeah. Mm. However, they're just like uh, killing the solo heroes, like uh, which are farming jungle or farming lands. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they have uh, high skills of uh, uh, spell casting. Mm -hmm. And uh, time interesting, but uh, they need uh, more strategic uh, in uh, in sets of this game. I think they need more discipline. Yes. Yeah. Uh, like uh, in the previous game, like Thailand, they <coughs> when they have the advantage, they just push push the tower, and they know the enemy cannot defend the tower. And uh, they need to push the tower more quickly and uh, control the boss. Mm -hmm. uh, the map resource is very crucial in this game. Yep. And I think uh, mm, the, the Diao Chan and the Xu Chu Peak are not very good actually. <coughs> yeah, Especially Diao Chan. I think Xu Chu is too passive. Yeah. And uh, I think uh, Xiao Chao performed better than the early stage. Like uh, in this game, actually. Yes, Dreamy get mm -hmm. some, get some crucial streak in the game. Mm -hmm. But he also okay, okay. We are back into the game. Okay, let's see what. Yes, Guido's wife. Yes, Guido's wife. Oh, that's that's strange. But uh, Hong Kong, China try to push the uh, to tower or the. Of the yeah, top lane. They should just push tower section. And uh, the top tower is already taken down. And right now they need to build some. No, yep. Okay, another out. Yeah. Another kill. They're taking oh, down yep. solo ban. <coughs> no, yep. Really aggressive in this game. Yeah. I think uh, maybe Dream Yuan Shao should just play aggressive like this or mm -hmm. yeah. just like uh, Thailand play the dream we saw in the last game mm -hmm. this case pushing the bottom lane. yeah I think uh, Nepal is doing the right thing staying jungle and uh, pushing out the lands <coughs> so that uh, Hong Kong China's player oh, are get like out uh, but uh, Hong Kong China has a version here oh yep yeah they take down the enemy boss you can see Hong Kong China has many vision in the jungle of the Nepal. And uh, Long has both to uh, the, the boss island, the, the, the pole and the... Oh, you see the Woody? 
Yep. Doing well, this uh, ulti and the kill. Yeah. is done. Mm -hmm. Nepal and needed to devote that vision in their jungle. Mm -hmm. The high ground vision can can give too many information to Hong Kong China. They do not have the damage to take down tower. Now Long is here. So Long can take that. Oh, Long jumps in, so Hello. it's a relief. And the uh, is already, already controlled. He's down and the long is very low. Long use his ulti. And uh, uh, oh okay. Long use uh, uh meta steel. Use the illusion X to get uh, in beauty at uh, uh -huh. one second. Yep. And, and evade uh, the I think tower uh, attack. Here comes the Woody with the initiation. The but the Jazz Kate has down the LVP and the Royal Lit. But the Jimmy oh. get the Royal Lit really had MG. I think nice play for Jimmy, but uh, can he go out? Jimmy. She will not make it out. Oh, Jimmy's she down the tricky, but uh, still be uh, ended by the Jazz Kate and the air wave. wave. Nowhere to run, air wave. And the Jazz, Jazz Kate, Kate got him as well. Got him. So who do you think performed the best in this game as like in Hong Kong, China? Royal Whip. Yeah, mm, I, I think uh, maybe Jaskit performed better since he does uh, every control that he needs and uh, uh, help his teammates yeah. to build up some team fight. Yeah, he helps his team win every team fight. Yeah. I think Roy Lip is like a little bit played a little bit carelessly. But that is how Dream Ren shall play. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yep. Only on the, the high ground of Nepal. Yeah. We are see like it's nearly a mid game phase and uh, Hong Kong Gaming is still finding ways to push their high ground. They are afraid, a little bit afraid to, like, go to enemy's high ground. Oh, oh again. Jumping in and uh, in the battlefield. Yeah. Oh, sweet tongue when they pull. Roll your whip. And that's the initiation. They that can take the mid barracks as granted. Mm -hmm. <coughs> and the top is pushed by long as well. And the Jimmy jumps in, use all his damage skills, and so has Woody. But Long has his ulti and uh, evade every damage. And that the is Yu Ji, the strongest Terry hero. Yeah. And uh, we can see that uh, although Diao Chan make a good out, but. Uh, Yo Yo again. Mm -hmm. Get uh, Snowy. Yeah. I think they will go straight to the enemy base, maybe. Break this down. Mm -hmm. Only one tower left on the high ground. I think they will go straight to the. Uh, they are pushing the bottom tower, or they are just pushing the enemy base. Okay, well if it jumps in. Does not find a good position to cut in, and uh, I think he takes a kill. Nope, died. Yeah. Only four, four heroes. Four living in the base, and, and the uh, long jump long was his out. Yeah, got every hero that he needed. But the air wave went a Guido. And the dreamy is died. Oh, <laughs> so okay. really bit Royal Yip dive into the fountain. And, uh, but Long is the real monster. Nobody can take him down. Yeah. Tricky and the Long destroy the last tower in the yep. base. Yep. The base is now on the attack. Uh -huh. And uh, they just, they just need to right click the enemy mm, base. Not a good uh, initiation. Woody, yeah, Woody miss uh, every hero in his ult. No, he he caught three enemy union uh, minion. I mean, <laughs> the and, uh, retreat the to his fountain, but uh, their base cannot retreat. Yeah, the base is too low. And GG here. And Congratulations to Hong Kong China. Uh, I think they play very 
good in the early phase. Yes. And they just need to like improve a little bit in the mid game, how to end the game. Go yo up with the early game mm -hmm. and along with his Yuji yep. with the end game. Yeah. Nobody can kill uh, Yuji with 20, uh, 20k or 30k gold. And I think uh, Nepal, Nepal, they just need to um, choose some better heroes maybe. Like Delta is too weak in lands and in the um, mid game things like uh, she cannot make any damage but uh, uh, her teammates they do not do a lot of damage as well. Yes, Hua Tu Delta is too passive heroes. Yep. The Nepal lack of damage. And I think Nepal they need pick Gu uh, Yong at first during the second game. Oh, just uh, pick uh, Dream Yuan Shao. Yep. Dream Yuan Shao, I don't think they can do very well since you can see like in this game, really does not perform really good in the early stage. I, I mean in the mid stage. Like he, he got some mistakes and uh, got caught or got taken down. However, uh, the damage is still a little bit too high. So at the end, they still like dominate the late game. But they got along. Yeah, that's true. VG is too powerful. But uh, I don't know without VG and the uh, Yuan Shao, Dream Yuan Shao. Can they build up this this large advantage in late game? Or so maybe they can they can pick Yan Liang, a very good uh, assassin hero. Yeah, can have really great skill to initiate and uh, get carrier in the team. Yeah. So, uh, Dream Yuan Shao maybe and. Uh, um, I mean, Luo Li may be a good pick for Nepal. Yeah, they need the damage. Luo Li is uh, a hero with high damage. And uh, Dream Xiao Chao as well. Yeah. And uh, also the Kindness Point. Um, they can build uh, Xu Chu maybe. Or Dream Liu Shan. I rarely see both teams pick. I think this hero is unbanned, but uh, nobody picks uh, this hero. Yes, and, and okay. there will be a highlight of the last game. Mm -hmm. We will back soon.
welcome back. As we can see in the highlights replay, the uh, Portros, Xu Tu, Diao Chan, and Hua Tuo as they are drifting. And uh, I think uh, maybe they want to use Diao Chan Shi, Diao Chan Shi out as a counter initial eight skill. Uh, and uh, Xu Tu and uh, Hua Tuo to save their crucial hero in the team fights. But uh, I think uh, they are. Team, team drafting is just uh, too passive and uh, can no enough damage in the team fights. And uh, Yuji can use his ult to easily invade every attack and uh, damage in the team fights. That's why Yuji is the strongest hero, carry hero now in this game. And I think, I think uh, in the second uh, game of the best of three, uh, Nepal should choose some hero can make enough damage, just like Xiao Qiao in this game. And uh, they need to pick some. I, I think they need to pick some common hero like Gu Yong in the first, first pick, and, first pick and the second pick to make uh, their drafting more counter to the Hong Kong China's drafting. And uh, to Hong Kong China. I think they really have outstanding skills of playing and the spells casting and the time choosing, but they need to make more strategic insights and control the map zone. What do you think of the two teams? Will Nebo get a chance to play back in the second game? I think uh, Nebo, they are trusting phase is not as good as we expected it seems like uh, mostly they pick uh, like Nepal have like nearly zero damage in their uh, drafting phase and their lineup is only Xiao Qiao have a burst damage and uh, both Diao Chan, Hua Tuo, Xu Chu and Sun Lu Ban do not have any damage so uh, when <coughs> when Diao Chan make a good out and control every hero of the enemy heroes, um, they cannot do damage actually. Especially Xu Chu is a melee hero. They cannot get into the enemy's out, uh, get into Diao Chan's out and do damage. Mm -hmm. The only hero that can do damage is Xiao Qiao. And the Xiao Qiao only have like uh, parody damage like she has ult, uh, she has the stun, she has the burst damage and then she use all his he she use all her skills and uh, then there's no damage um, yes. then there's no physical damage on Nepal's side because, last because uh, Diao Chan is too poor in the game <coughs> Diao Chan actually cannot do damage he need many items to make damage yeah, that's true but uh, they are too, but uh, they are getting getting done by the Hong Kong China in the early phase yeah. of the game. Diao Chan cannot form in his jungle, in their jungle. Yeah, then though we can see there's a statistic board here, and uh, Hong Kong makes 49 kills and uh, 75 assists in the first game, and it takes only like 22 minutes, which is very fast. Yeah. And uh, you can see, as I said, there's barely damage on Nepal side. Yes, mm. only f 54k. Yeah. Dam no, that's uh, the 32k yeah, damage. Yeah, that's here. the economy actually. So we can see like uh, the MVP here is Tinky, who play as the uh, Panfong here. Mm. <coughs> and uh, yeah, he's performing very good in this game. Very good initiate. <coughs> yeah, and. Uh, we c we know that uh, uh, Dream Yuan Shao is doing damage. However, like there's someone need to do the initiation uh, and uh, control the card. Mm, yeah, and I think during the second game, Nipo need to change your um, change your. I think they need to be more aggressive in lanes. Mm. Yeah, choose some hero that can make damage. Yeah. Their first game pick was too passive. <coughs> and, uh, but I like uh, Nepal's uh, mid player Dreamy. Mm -hmm. Though he is a little bit nervous mm -hmm. in the landing phase. Yeah. 
but uh, he played back a lot of times in the team fights. Yeah. I think uh, Nepal maybe they just uh, need to take back their confidence and uh, build a better lineup in the drafting phase. Mm. Yeah, the drafting is really important in professional games, actually. Because mm -hmm. like Thailand, they yeah. have a very professional coach to help them make drafting yeah. and the building strategy in the game. Mm -hmm. And their team is good enough to execute their strategy. And uh, Hong Kong, China, I think they can just also pick the heroes they like. <laughs> because their uh, their spellcasting skill is really outstanding. Yeah, I think uh, on the on the Nepal side, they need to um, focus more on some heroes that are maybe especially mid heroes that are easy to use, uh, like uh, Dream Lolly maybe. Mm -hmm. But Dream Lolly is still a very high skill hero, mm -hmm. like uh, maybe. Dream Xiao Chao is good for um, Nepal to pick. Maybe they should take their as their first pick, maybe. Like Gojia, very really high magic damage hero as a supporter or a mid. Yeah. And easy to use. <coughs> yeah, and easy to counter the aggressive style players. Like uh, Hong Kong, China, their turn like are eager to dive into the enemy base, dive into enemy high ground, and dive back to their towers. Mm -hmm. So uh, when they chase too deep, uh, uh, Guo Jia is a really good hero to counter them. Mm -hmm. You can see very happy yeah. Hong Kong China's player. Yeah, I think they will be the very good in Group A, although they are China in the same group. Yeah. Take a rest. Hong Kong China's player. Mm -hmm. <coughs> what will what will he thinking? Uh, I think mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> maybe, um, maybe my calling was too brilliant in the last game. And uh, I think uh, Nepal's player they need to Focus more on their drafting phase since I don't know why they take up so much backup time mm -hmm. in the drafting phase. They do not come up with a good uh, lineup. Okay, so here's the second draft phase, and uh, we can see Nepal is on the Wu side while Hong Kong is Hong Kong China is on the Wei side. Nepal just ban the Yuji <laughs> very quickly. And no uh, more Yuji here. Yeah, Wei ban the uh, Huang Gai and the uh, Sun Huan. I think the same ban as the previous game. Mm, I think uh, Nepal just banned the hero Hong Kong China pick in the last game. Okay. Will the next uh, hero Nepal ban uh, <laughs> be painful or Dream Yuan Shao? Yeah. Yes, so yes, <laughs> Dream Yuan Shao. So why you pick and I will ban? <laughs> and they ban Dream Guan Yu. So the first pick for Nepal. But that will make Yan Liang <coughs> out of the bag. Okay, so they pick Pu Yuan. Mm. Mm. Pu Yuan is a hero with enough damage. Mm -hmm. But it's mm. a very skill-based hero. A nice try for Nepal. Mm -hmm. mm. Will they show more aggressive in this game? Yeah, let's see what uh, Hong Kong picked Sun Luban, okay. which is the last pick by Nepal. So Hong Kong, China, Sun and Luban and the Dream Rolly. Mm. Sun Luban usually a kindness hero in the draft and the Dream Rolly will be the mid hero of Hong Kong, China. Yeah. Now, and turn uh, for Nepal to pick two other heroes. They are yeah, Zhou Yu and uh, Xu Huang, which are rarely seen in the face. Yes. Mm -hmm. And uh, Zhou Yu is a very hard hero. Yeah. Will that be Nepal's drafting out? Yeah, maybe they practice a little bit. Okay. 
Yeah, so the pick Guo Jia, which is a very good counter hero for Hong Kong China. Uh, as like uh, Pu Yuan or Zhou Yu are very uh, skinny, are very weak uh, skinny hero in lands yep. and in the early phase, mm -hmm. Guo Jia can do a lot of damage. Probus <coughs> I think Nepal pick their carrier, mm -hmm. top solo and the mid solo. Mm -hmm. And their first three picks really a good save. Yeah, and they banned uh, Liu Biao. Is it picking lastly? But no, it's not picked. Liu Biao and Hua Tuo was banned by Hong Kong China. And uh, that's the turn for Nepal to do a last ban. Yeah, Hua yeah, Tuo is like showing a lot in the in this tournament. Yes. <coughs> Let's see what's the last pick for a uh, last ban for uh, Nepal. <coughs> Paul is thinking a lot. I think they should just ban the carry heroes. Um, maybe ban. They already banned the Yuji. Yeah. How about uh, Huang Yuying? But Hong Kong China's yeah. draft was too fragile, I think. They need a tanky hero in front of the I team. Think so as Nepal, Pu Yuan and Zhou Yu are both. Oh, Pan Feng. <laughs> <coughs> okay, Nepal chose to ban Pan Feng, which is Kang Kang China played in the last game. Yeah, so let's see what they will pick. I think they will pick the. Okay, so Huang they pick Yue Huang Yuying as their carrier. And uh, Pu Yuan. Yeah. Which is really seeing not a very common pick. Mm -hmm. And last pick for Nepal. Mm. What and will they choose? Yeah. Uh, they still yes. need the support or candidate support because they have already choose all their all three of their carry in the fourth three, three <coughs> pick and uh, Gu Yong is not uh, in the in Gu Yong is already in the ban list so I think uh, you cannot expect what they pick you just wait <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe Sun Quan is, yeah, uh, Sun, Sun is a good choice for team fights but Zuo Yue can I mean they can play Zuo Yue as the position 5 and uh, so they pick Wei, Wei Yan. Yan. Okay, it's really thing. And the uh, pick a little bro. So the drafting of Hong Kong China is really fragile. Yeah. But uh, meanwhile can make <coughs> a lot of damage. <coughs> a really aggressive pick for Hong Kong China. And the Nipple. Mm -hmm. They just want to change their strategy. Yeah. And I think uh, Little Bo will go mid. Maybe. Let, let's just oh, wait and Dream, see. Dream Rolly uh, will. Dream Rolly is mid and the Little Bo. But uh, who will be the top mid of the Hong Kong China? Because uh, there is no tanky hero in their drifty. I think they will put Little Bo on the top, maybe. Since it has uh, it has the blink skill and they can make it out. Welcome to the games. Mm -hmm. Nepal versus Hong Kong China game two. You can see Nepal on the west side and Hong Kong China mm -hmm. on the way side. Mm -hmm. Well both teams are gathering on the top of the map. Mm -hmm. Will there be a level one team fight? <coughs> Oh, 
the poets invading the jungle. And uh, can he see Martin? No, oh. B. Make a war to see Martin here. Dreamy. Okay, and uh, just uh, it's our Dreamy get it done. And uh, Trinky get Dreamy. Can he kill Dreamy? Yes. Wei Enough Yen damage. Does Wei Yuan block? <laughs> block, block to yeah, I think. Nipo, they get the high ground, but uh, Dreamy was uh, too aggressive in the river. Yes, so uh, Hong Kong, China I gets see. both first first kill and uh, second kill. That's in the not uh, good news for Nipo. They have already get the high ground <laughs> and the wards and the vision, but still those to the level one team fight. It's already a 1k lead for Hong Kong, China. <laughs> And uh, way back to the bottom land, and yeah. the dreamy in the middle land was us. Let's see. Yo what yo, yep. What a little bull will go. Yo yo, yep. All and the dreamy. Yep. Yeah. Costing skills to each other. Mm -hmm. In addition, HP. Yo yo, yep. A nice W. Oh, dreamy really low. Yep. Roy is still treating him. He is already level two. Another skill was cost. Roy up really low, hiding in the trees. Yeah, but um, she's got some heroes. She's got and Martin on the top lane <coughs> was thinking. Would he get the by thinking? And, uh, Can he escape? Yeah, and I stuck by Woody, but, but uh, he's hooked and. Uh, that will be a 3 to 0 and a royal uh, a solo kill in the middle there. Dreamy was a uh, little bit of confusion in this game. He lost he lost the first part and got a solo streaked by Royal Up uh, in the landing phase. Dream back to the midland. Yep. And the Royal Up uh, again come down to the river and cast skills. Only level three Dreamy. And you uh, got not enough damage, Royal uh, Yep. Oh, okay. Another skill. Dreamy is w with e. and, uh, Again, down. get killed uh, by s get solo killed by Royal Yep. Meanwhile, on the top land, thinking get a Woody again. Woody, can he live? A nice broke. But Tinky don't want the Woody go. Yeah. The tile to tower attack Tinky. Mm -hmm. Woody is safe for now. <laughs> So Xu Huang is play as the kindness point. Take mm. care of Woody again. Oh my God! Woody has died at this time. It's just you like cannot escape forever. Royal Yep get the essence, and he want to invade, invade the jungle. jungle. But oh. the group see the Royal Yep by the words. They have the vision. Royal Yip come back. Snowbee, can he yeah. escape? Sure. Royal Yip was slowed by the Snowbee's skill. Yeah. Okay, they can retreat. But the jungle was and taken by Royal Yip. the top lane. Uh, UD just got caught again. And uh, he's not down actually. UD only level 3. Very suffering. Yeah. And the uh, thinking is very powerful right now. Already 14 gold uh, gap between mm -hmm. Nepal and Hong Kong, China. Mm -hmm. Woody finally get some creeps from line. And the Royal Ip again, very low Dreamy and the Royal Ip. Royal yeah, they are just fighting too much in the mid lane. Royal Ip. I see the scopes, W and A. And oh my god. Well, there will be enough damage. Dreamy. Again, really low. Yep. Yeah. Come oh, here. Okay. Another solo kill for a Royal Whip. Yeah, she has every skill she can. Yeah, we'll get a Jets no, Can you no. just get a retreat? No. And uh, I was think he used his stun to like, take the last hit. And uh, Royal Ip and uh, Chinky ruled <laughs> their own land. Now uh, Jet Kate. Uh, I Com think uh, Air Wave is like save points for his out. Mm -hmm. yeah. Royal Yep. 
goes back and <laughs> uh, gets a pull in. Really nice play for Rorik yeah. in this game. He built up the confidence and uh, they are farming enemies. China. They are farming enemies, uh, boss. And they are invading <laughs> everywhere in the enemy side. Meanwhile, just keep just staying in the uh, bottom lane. Again, Rorik. Solo killed by Rogo, yeah, but Dreamy is totally wrecked. Yeah, I think uh, Dreamy does not pick a very good kill. This Zhou Yu. Zhou Yu does not have any skill to escape. Very like hard to play. Yeah. And Zhou Yu need to farm in the early game, so if your landing phase is wrecked, mm -hmm. you may be get killed everywhere in this game. And uh, so as Woody. And the long is here. Uh, he just used one, uh, just used one skill to get him. Long already, level 9. Yeah, and uh, she's very beefy. 3k lead. And the enemy carry. Come try now, get the top tower. Mm -hmm. What's the trend? Uh -huh. <coughs> A bit tinky. Martin and the long yeah. leaving the Asian equip creeps jungle. There's a kid. Can he live? There's a kid. A uh, nice break out. And the royal pack. <laughs> oh my god. I think uh, Dreamy is wrecked. Like, he does not know what he is doing right now. Oh, Long and the Martin still living in the jungle of the Nepal. Nepal needed to do something. Yeah, and the uh, Tinky is getting the bottom mine as well. Woody is totally dead. Yeah, I think right in this game, Hong Kong China knows that they need to uh, go into like doing push their enemy uh, towers early. Yes. And the royal whip seems to just enjoy the slaying mm -hmm. in the game. Yeah. He's doing a lot of active moves in the game. And the thinking again, get a woody and just the uh, under the tile to tower. Royal whip gets and a strict down woody. Yeah, it's very good move for them. That's kit. Oh, Nepal has already pushed the tire to top bottom left. <laughs> Let's pray for Elway. I think Elway is the only one that uh, can do some. Oh my god. Who's that? I can Again. barely see that. Again, Snowy was down by Royal <laughs> Lip and yeah, comes really along with his out. Uh, I think they should push the mid tower maybe? Or finish the boss. <coughs> yep. yeah. Hong Kong, China. Uh, Will they choose to rush their own boss? Yeah. Just Kate, meanwhile, Farming in the Nepal's the jungle. jungle. And they got both wishes. And uh, he tipped it out. Tinky. Make a wards here. He goes with base, gets that I will enough damage. Tinky is down. Yep. But long get uh, double damage assets. Mm -hmm. And uh, long wanna retreat a little bit. Long is the other way I will. But it was out. He dropped the out and both here are down. So as. Uh, I yeah, will of course, uh, get out, get yeah. his uh, ult, ult to respawn, but uh, Suri gets uh, killed uh, by long and yeah. the royal yep, and he's on the land. The Woody, Woody stuns. It's a well. Woody, a nice spell. Royal yep. I think there's no way for them to uh, come back, although Hong Kong China has not uh, doing the push yet. Oh, they have actually. They are pushing the bottom tower and, and the top tower. But maybe they need to slay their boss. Yeah. Hong Kong China just enjoy slaying and yeah. killing. 
I think they are play less dis discipline than the other stronger teams, maybe. Like yeah. Thailand and China? Yeah, but uh, it's only like 9 minutes, so they still need some island players. Finally, Royally pushing the Mad Tower. Mm -hmm. And let's see what they got. So, over here we got the item that they need. Royal Ip is almost a godlike. Yeah, and uh, there are four heroes in mid and Pinky blink in and Royal <laughs> yeah. Ip and Pinky just make the uh, everything they need. So we can the spells but Tinky brave enough to get it into the tower to tower and, and the is down again. So we have and to the Tinky is down so yeah you know that. In Royal League he still got everything they need. Long has too much damage here and the Royal again flush out to the tower to tower and uh, get a kill. The Royal Whip already 11 to 0 beyond the god line. Yeah, we can see that uh, Dreamy does not make any progression in the this phase actually. Dreamy was totally dominated by the Royal Whip in yeah, this game. Yeah, we can see. So he has not a very nice choice for him. He died nine times and uh, he got his uh, his TP boot, so he can go everywhere he wants and uh, use his ult to refresh the uh, item to go to other lands. However, he do you mean keeping farmer yeah, in the bottom of the line? He's too behind actually. Five oh, can can he get him? No. Oh, almost there. Royal Yep, meanwhile, in the Midland, try to get a snow DB. Air Wave come here, but Royal Yep flush out to retreat. Yep. Jet's kit just behind him. He cannot get Royal Yep. <laughs> it's too mobility. And then again, Jet's kit uh, into the enemy fights. Royal Yep. Try to find some trace. He found. Can he find Zhou Yu yet? Oh, Zhou Yu is out, TP out, and the Royal Whip in away, far nice away, again. far away from his team. Now everyone in Hong Kong China is here gathering, but the dream come again and casting spells mm. to clear the landing. And uh, Martin and the Royal Whip still want to find some, some kills. kills. On this end. Timing to call in. They got two tower and uh, w w what? Where is Woody die? Uh, Woody is, I think, uh, in, the, uh, in the base actually. They don't know where to go. Uh, even, even I think, uh, Dreamy don't know where to go. Once he tip it out, the enemy will just instantly show up and uh, get him Royal Yip hanging around the, the tie to tower mm -hmm. nobody can stop him yeah you can see Royal Yip uh, already built the hex stuff which yeah. can cut enemy hero easily maybe a solo kill even finally Hong Kong trying to get their boss yeah and there's a second boss on the enemy side that has respawned. Long already level 18. And yeah, Nepal. Nepal is fighting their first boss. They must rush uh, it because Hong Kong China is coming. Yeah, there comes a Hong Kong China but a but nice uh, jump by the Woody. Oh Woody yeah. finally. Yeah, the nice game so two important heroes. Uh, Jazz can come here, can yeah. I will get him? Martin oh. try to save Jazz kid, Jazz kid. Oh, oh my God. Martin used his out to like uh, get everyone. The I boss item is on the ground. Martin yeah. see it. He can summarize his teammates to pick it up. Mm, and maybe long just wait for Royal Leap. Long from the Gredo. Gredo, what are you doing here? There are too much Hong Kong China's hero here. Yeah. Uh, Royal Leap just blink to me. Royal Leap pick, uh, pick up the both item of the Nepal mm -hmm. and try to push the red tower. Oh, 
The mid tower is defended by the dreaming uh, East Guild. Dreaming's hero Zhou Yu is very good at the clear the land. And Nude is just blocking the enemy hero by stopping them from pushing the tower. We left try to find some initial age. And then actually, we will almost die. Actually, there's one strategy. Like if you TP to the tower, the tower will be invisible, and uh, you can you cannot damage the tower. Mm -hmm. There's one way to like stop the enemy from pushing. Mm -hmm. However, I think uh, Nepal did do not notice that. Guido. Yeah. Oh, no. is down and the damage is too high for Rovio Rip. Yeah, the I think he only used one skill to get him. He still has his hex stuff. Yeah, and the the other two heroes are pushing the bottom lane. The other heroes are just waiting on the <laughs> high ground, uh, like uh, praising that uh, they will not. Uh, Kude is almost a 40k game. Yo 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 again, flush in and flush out. Dreamy mm -hmm. is uh, spamming the skill. And the Tinky blink on the high ground, got caught up by airwave and uh, he's retreating and back again. Just hit. He got the uh, revive and the lung is. Oh, the lung's damage is just too high. Got a high ground tower and uh, who's there? <laughs> I really live just dive too deep. And Can uh, long retreat. They know, they know it's time to retreat a little bit. Oh. Hong Kong, China. You did not make it to destroy the barricade. Yeah. The rope just play too aggressive and uh, too deep in the enemy's team. Yeah. And uh, Someone is pushing the top. Oh, I think that's uh, Dreamy is pushing the top uh, using spamming his skills. And uh, he's back again. Yeah, and the uh, Roy Leap dives in again, but uh, barely get the support. So DV. Mm -hmm. Very low. Do you think he's, uh, he's the key factor of Hong Kong China? Roy Leap. Like what will he play so very get a Woody and roll easily take a Woody down with and high damage and get other two heroes up on the pole before retreating but uh, Long getting in with his out. Yeah. I think Long did a really good job in this game. Oh very, very nice and cutting. Three heroes down. Dreaming try to defend their high ground. I barely see just kids in this game. I don't know where he goes. <laughs> just kids waiting for a chance to True. get a dreamy. Yeah, but they, they don't have vision on high ground. I they think. need to get dreamy to attack the high ground because yeah. Joey is such a defensive hero. Yeah, and like the jumping and uh, and they dreamy was yeah, long was out. Yep. And so it's just hit. And the airwave is caught. Yeah, we down. Only Jim yeah. left in the deep of his base. Yeah, I mean, Huang Yuying can push tower still. very fast. Jimmy still refresh his skill and try to defend their tower. However, like, it's useless. Like, they have Jimmy's two lands. damage to not enough to kill the hero of Hong Kong, China. Mm -hmm. He has tried his, his best, mm -hmm. but the golden gate between Nepal and Hong Kong China was too big. And uh, we can see Jimmy. Royal Yip up again to the high ground and uh, found three people. Guido, can you get a Royal Yip? Oh yes, Guido, but the Guido it. is done. However, he signs well. Almost uh, 50 kills for Hong Kong China. And the line is still pushing the enemy uh, barracks. Dreamy try to defend his base. Yeah, they. I think they gonna take the boss, but the boss have not uh, respond. But it's respond the wayside. <laughs> they haven't been back to their uh, their side for like mm -hmm. I think five or six minutes. Yes. 
and waiting for the boss to respawn. Yeah, there's 21 kill for Jinky into the high ground again. Yeah, okay, the damage is like way too high. Now it is out, yeah. calling in and get a Greedo again. Oh, again, only Jimmy was alive. And they're pushing. I think they just need to push the base. Jimmy try to refresh his skill. Uh -huh. Can he get to think it? No. No. The damage was too low. And the uh, airwave, they're back and almost uh, so uh, 40, 54 kills for Hong Kong trend. Yeah, I think the if they wanna play safely, they should go back to get the. Again, uh, Martin. Can he get to this initiation? No. no. And but the hex some. The Hex got the Snowbee here and again Elwiv Elwiv is done as well and they just need to right click the enemy base I think and yes, I think that's is a down. GG call Tower is down, Jimmy is still trying to defend the base refresh yeah. his skill, refresh again, refresh again and blink and the spamming the yeah, skills Will uh, he bring away? No. Yeah, but it dam the belly didn't damage. And uh, they are but retreating. I think they need to get a boss right now. But Hong Kong China only, uh, only have to kill four more heroes in this game to win oh, the game. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, I just noticed that. They want to they wanna get uh, 60 kills to win the game. Uh, Go to give for almost 60. I think it's really brutal <laughs> to see like the first wing, like, oh, the jumping and uh, the. Will there be jump enough out. damage? Oh my god! Dreamy, but here comes Tinky and Martin. They got Dreamy. Dreamy yeah. is down. Okay. That will be the 57 kills for Hong Kong Three trainer. more kills, three more kills. <laughs> and uh, I think Nipo just. Whatever, <laughs> we will fight. Dreamy is done. They okay. need a Dreamy to defend their base. Okay, whatever. Okay. <laughs> Out for the long, long. Yeah, get one, one more kill. One more kill. Two. One more kill. Okay, it's done. Sixty kills for Hong Kong, China, and uh, win this match. Congratulations. For the best of three uh, winners. That's not very common in the match to get sixty kill. Really brutal. Yeah. I mean, uh, it's the uh, first. Uh, I mean, it's a really long time that we have seen like uh, oh. 60 kills uh, win for one team. And actually. only in 20 or 25 minutes. Yeah, and I think it's all because Nipo pick very fragile lineup. Pu Yuan, Zhou Yu, and. Uh, I think Zhuo uh, Yue are all very fragile heroes. Uh, so. And the Hong Kong China also pick a very fragile heroes, but uh, all have high damage. Yeah, and uh, Nepal's lineup are not so very powerful. We can uh, agree that. I like the playstyle of Royal Lip. Really <laughs> aggressive and uh, get 5 of. 4 or 5 solo kill in Lenny yeah, face. Yeah, that's true. And I think like uh, Hong Kong Gaming, uh, Hong Kong China, I mean, their playstyle is... Uh, I, I did not even notice that they want to get the kills to win the game. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a really rarely thing, like uh, in the uh, professional thing. However, it's like, uh, I think uh, in this tournament and in later on it will be like uh, several 60 kill wins, mm -hmm. maybe later on mm, maybe in the thailand game <laughs> I, I don't know like uh, we have finished three best of three games and um, all these three games have very large uh, mm. like uh, uh, I mean points in mm. the in the game. Mm -hmm. And who do you think will be the MVP of this game? I think uh, Lang maybe. Yeah, he played very safe mm. and uh, mm -hmm. he got beyond godlike. Yes, and uh, 
long it、uh, very excellent cutting skills. Yep. And waiting for his teammates to do an initiation. Waiting for the dreaming to block his out.、Uh, I think、uh, Jaskit. Uh, mm, he did perform very good in the first game, and in second game,、uh, the teammate does not need him actually. <laughs> like、um, uh, maybe Royal. Yeah. Get、uh, five solo kill, and、uh, almost、uh, ruined、uh, the Nepal's team in the mid game. Yep. And、uh, I think Zhou Yu is、uh, not a very good pick for the professional match、mm -hmm. because Zhou Yu did not have any skill to escape before he can he buy the dagger dagger、uh, the blink dagger、yep. and he need to farm a lot.、Mm -hmm. He is too fragile and、uh, he need to re ref keep refresh his skills、mm -hmm. to make damage.、Yep. Uh, I think、um, Nepal they do not have to be frustrated since uh, uh, the the game skill leap is like lit. Okay, we are going to see the highlights. See.
back and uh, we can see Hong Kong China just dominant the third best of three games versus Nepal and uh, we can see like in both games Hong Kong China has two very good strategies in the drafting phase and also in the early game stage however like uh, Nepal uh, Nepal they have done very good in the first game uh, in the early stage especially their mid, uh, mid player Dreamy uh, she played uh, Xiao Qiao and uh, is very good in the early stage he even she he even managed to kill the enemy mid hero for some times uh, however, they have their lack of experience in the mid stage and the late stage, so that they cannot be very consistent throughout the game, so that uh, they lose the best of three games. And I think, like uh, for the second game, the the MVP. Sh okay, we can see now the statistic board and uh, uh, actually Hong Kong China makes 60 kills yes. to win uh, maybe there's a mistake in the uh, board uh, however mm. we can see that uh, the assists only here, 58 yeah so like mm. mostly are solo kills yes uh, individual performing for Hong Kong China yeah it's very strong compared to Na Nepal yes and uh, also the damage and economy here is uh, very high for Hong Kong China mm, and we can see its uh, dominance for them and uh, mm, lately we will see who is the MVP in this match what do you think we will win this MVP? ok now we can see it's uh, very no. long so his Huang Yuying is performed very well in this game. Yes. Although he only like takes per takes part in 38 of the head, and we can see like uh, Rayleigh, who he plays as the Dream Lolly, takes most of the kills. Mm -hmm. Like uh, I think 28 kills, maybe like about half of the head goes to him. Mm -hmm. But uh, he's very consistent. I mean, long and reliable. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I so think that uh, is a very important uh, thing to for carry player to be reliable. Yeah, reliable in like both ways actually. Mo mostly in the end game. Yeah. And uh, I mean, mm, I think Nepal still have one more match to go on, uh, in the last match today. Versus and, uh, yeah, versus Kazakhstan. Mm -hmm. And I think they will do well in the second match since they have some um, drafting experience and both in length experience. They know how this game performs and how they should perform in the game. Yeah. <laughs> they will find a way to like uh, build confidence. Okay, we, we will, will be, be back, back soon. at the Thailand with the Philippines. Mm, see you, see you soon. soon.
关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。
累了、困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了、困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。
累了、困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。
累了、困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。啊、uh, ，Welcome back to the Real Tuition Games Match Revenue. I'm Caster Luo Chen. I'm Caster Meng Yaofeng. And、uh, this competition is jointly organized by the Olympic Council of Asia and the Asian Electronic Federation, operated by Digital Sports Asia. And first of all, we like to thank our prestige sponsor to FAW. Audi Q4 e-tron for their strong support for the event, and also special thanks to IQ, the official mobile game equipment for the RDAG, the professional choice to empower victory, embrace the thrill of control. Let us also thank to our official supporters Omen, New Omen, your journey to the road to the Asian Games. Let us also thank to our official supporter Autofu, Autofu, official gaming chair partner of the Road to the Asian Games. Be your own hero. Thank you to official supporter Easter Rock for their support. We would also like to thank our official broadcasting platforms: Bilibili, We Are Live, Douyu Live, Kuaishou Games, China Mobile, Migu Channels, Tencent Video, Weibo, Xiao Hongshu, YouTube, and Twitch for their support. Okay. So we're gonna see the back to match. Yep.、Uh, right. We're gonna come up with a match that is Thailand versus Philippines. So we have seen Thailand doing a very strong performance in the、uh, second best of three、uh, versus Vietnam, and you can see like Thailand dominance both in the lanes. And now we can see the starting lineup、yep. here. Thailand carry player Artifact. Offline never die. Solo call gank top and、uh, supporter this die. And we can see Philippines line up here.、Uh, Carry is、uh, Perforada, and offline is To To, and the solo is De Guzman, and the gank is Jason, and the support is Feldes. So,、um, and、uh, we can see both. Both teams have very,、uh, both countries have very、um, uh, strong uh, performance in esports era. Yep. Yeah. Especially in mobile games. Yeah. And、uh, I think、uh, Philippines, they,、uh, although they have not,、uh, we have not seen their performance. I can already expect their、uh, strategies that is like attacking, attacking, and attacking. Yes, and the Thailand、uh, this mo in this morning's games is so much powerful. Yeah, I think they are very disciplined. In the、uh, last best of three game. Yes, they play aggressive、mm -hmm. and、uh, have very passion. Yes, so we can expect there's gonna be another、uh, very interesting game like right coming up. And. Uh, 
Yeah. So there's already three best of three coming up today, and uh, uh, so what you think about except the second one, so the first one and third one, how you think about the like each team's performance right now? I think China uh, performance is uh, most outstanding and powerful in the first three games. Uh, Hong Kong China meanwhile has very talented players in the game, but they need to be more display and uh, they need to have more strategic insights mm -hmm. uh, to control the map, control the boats and control the resource point uh, in the map. Uh, and uh, Nepal, I think they maybe have some uh, unique a hero choice like uh, Zhou Yu for their mid player, mm -hmm. but uh, uh, they still need uh, more tra training to uh, to better. control the to, uh, to control the hero and the game. Yeah, so they need better skills, I think. And uh, I think uh, Vietnam, and they mm, although they are not as good as Thailand. They still show some mm, potential in the yeah. games, so uh, we expect they will be uh, perform better maybe tomorrow. Mm -hmm. I think there's another game tomorrow, uh, Vietnam versus Philippines, like tomorrow in the afternoon, yeah. and uh, we can expect that. But uh, before talking that, uh, you know, we can see like. The upcoming matchup Thailand versus Philippines. So will be a C region derby. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think uh, Philippines maybe have also have a very talented mid player mm -hmm. because uh, C, uh, in the C region mm -hmm. all mobile games uh, they will have a very talented mid mid yeah. player. And uh, they are very heavy, like. Uh, uh, they can do the skills very heavily. They are very heavy skill based, uh, like talented based uh, players here. So they can play the mid heroes. Mm -hmm. yeah. and, uh, and we can expect that. Uh, uh, so we have seen Thailand, they are very disciplined team. Mm -hmm. So what you expect about Philippines? I think maybe Philippines will be more aggressive than Thailand, uh, mm -hmm. like uh, their carry player take a significant role in the team and uh, carry the game to victory. Okay. So do you think they will pick some mm, very aggressive heroes like uh, Dream Loli? Uh, yes, and uh, we have seen the Thailand is drifting in the morning. They they are very disciplined, and they always spend like uh, Yan Liao and uh, Yu Qi in the first three bands. Yep. Uh, and uh, I think uh, they will have a uh, detailed uh, drifting plan. I think, uh, mm, I think uh, Thailand are very afraid of the burst damage heroes. Okay. We can see the players are showing up right now. We can see Philippines. Philippines are here, and the Thailand player are here as well. This is uh, this should be the Thailand's carry player, mm -hmm. and the Philippines player. They are yeah. very, uh, I mean, they are very confident. Seems like yes, and communicating with his teammates. Yeah. And uh, yeah. Before we can see like uh, Thailand, they their drafting phase are very quick, so they come up the idea like uh, which hero to pick at first, mm -hmm. and know which hero like counter them the most, so they do the banning. Mm -hmm. I think they will have many plans before the match. Yeah. And just choose use plan A or plan B yeah. to counter the their opponent's pick. Mm -hmm. And uh, we don't know if Philippines they gonna come up with some better ideas of like which hero to pick or uh, which hero to ban. Mm -hmm. uh, Maybe just uh, uses their best hero first. Yeah. 
Yeah, so they have to uh, come up with maybe carry heroes or main heroes first. You can see there are referees here. And uh, let's go back to uh, let's go back to sea region to talk a little bit. So mm -hmm. um, we know that uh, Philippines are like uh, very they're coming up very talented players mm -hmm. from Philippines. And uh, actually, I think in Thailand uh, there are not so many skilled uh, players there, like in esports era. Thailand has some um, great uh, players in mobile games, I think, uh, yeah. especially in Dota 2. Yeah. And uh, yeah, maybe the lack of some very outgoing, outstanding yeah. players in FPS program. Yeah, but we can see like in this tournament, oh, they're coming up with the drafting phase. So Thailand on all side and the Philippines on the west. Side. Very quick ban for Thailand, Liu uh, Biao. Yeah. And uh, they banned the Huang Gai for Philippines and the uh, Hua Tuo. So they Philippines definitely see the Thailand match use Hua Tuo. And uh, has turn for Thailand to ban two heroes, Yu Ji and the Dream Liu Shan. Very yeah. quickly ban Thailand. They always ban Yu Ji in the first ban banning phase. They ban their Dream Liu Shan, which they pick in the uh, second mm. game. Yes. The versus the Vinan. Very, very outstanding playing of Dream Liu Shan. Mm -hmm. Let's see what they pick first for Thailand. But the pick for Thailand still sinking. They usually pick very fast. Mm -hmm. I don't think they will pick very quick this time. Or maybe just pick a mid for cow. Yeah. Dream Guan Yu. Dream Guan Yu is a very good hero on the uh, as a tanky one. Mm, yes, a very tanky hero. Turn for. Philippines to pick two heroes. Xu mm. Huang and Xu Chu. Yeah. And, and uh, we have seen Xu Huang and Xu Chu in the early games, but I think those heroes are like staying mm. the top lane. Yes, and the very passive heroes. Philippines. Oh, and uh, Thailand pick Gu Yong, just a normal pick for support. And uh, Huang Yuying. And Huang Yuying again. I think they already built up the team fight phase. They can already matching the things in mm. high side. Yes. Maybe they already have the team fight side. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think uh, Philippines should pick. Uh, Okay, they pick Pu Yuan. Mm. Very strong carrier hero. Mm -hmm. And uh, let's see the second phase for the banning on both side. Both team doesn't uh, pick their mid hero. Maybe Thailand will choose to ban the mid hero. Yep. And so. What do you think? Uh, let me see. So I think uh, right now the way may have the kindness point, but uh, on Wu side, uh, on the Thailand side, they need one more uh, kindness point, like someone who can build the kindness. I think uh, Thailand uh, got a pick first uh, in the next picking phase, so okay. they can just uh, ban to mid hero. Yeah. Like a uh, dream Yuan Shao or dream Loli and uh, pick Loli in the first uh, next pick. Yeah, dream Loli is a very heavy team fight face hero. Oh, the, and the, the Ban Sun Quan. Sun Quan is a uh, very good team fight support. Yeah. Mm. Uh, and the uh, on Philippine side, they lack of some damage. I think. Tai Wen Ji. 
which is a uh, very unusual bag. Like uh, it's rarely picked, uh, but kind of uh, like a uh, white one. Yeah, white one is already banned. I mean, Cai Wenji is kind of like a white one. Yeah, and the Dong Zhuo, which is one, I think uh, they think they will build the uh, kindness around this hero, so they ban first. Mm-hmm. Last ban for Thailand. What mm-hmm. will they choose? Guo Jia. So they ban two support hero in their last two bans. And let's see what uh, uh, Philippines will pick. I think they should get their. They need more damage in the early game because Shu Chu and Shu Huang are all positive, positive heroes. And then Pu Yuan need to farm in the jungle. Maybe get some mid heroes. Really need the damage, but Guo uh, Jia is already banned by Thailand. Maybe just pick uh, Dream Yuan Shao. Maybe Cao Zhi. Yeah. Uh, there's plenty of hero left, so they can do whatever they want to pick. I still need a support hero and a mid hero, mm-hmm. uh, and uh, they their support can make damage. It's a really long thing for Philippines. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They are coming up with ideas. Mm-hmm. Okay, so they pick Dream Rensha, as I said. Yes, Dream Rensha, Re- really powerful mid hero, mm-hmm. and very skill heavy. Yes. And for Thailand to pick, the last to pick one should be the Kindness Point, and the other should be the Mid Hero. I think Dream Lolly is a uh, nice choice. Yeah, Lolly or Dream Lolly. Like tro- Lolly is more f- focused on the team fight, while Dream Lolly is more focused on the mm, damage Solo. side. Yes. Do you think for Thailand? Yeah, mm, I think both teams have like uh, considered thoroughly in the early phase. As you can see, like you do better in the draft, you do better in lands, and you do better in the games. Okay, so, so the Huan, Huan I said, and the Dream Lolly. Uh, Dream Lolly and uh, Sun Huan, but uh, will Dream Guan be the kindness point or Sun Huan be the kindness point? Let's wait and see. And the uh, well, last pick last for pick for Philippines. Yeah, they are coming up idea like uh, I think uh, maybe Xu Huang will go to. Uh, their safe land to okay, Dream Ganning, which is a uh, rarely seen hero. Mm-hmm. So, both teams have finished their draft. Which one do you like? I prefer <laughs> Philippines pick since there are some heroes that I haven't seen before. Uh, I mean, rarely seen in the professional fight, fa- like Dream Ganning. Yep, yeah. and uh. I think uh, Thailand does not focus on the uh, team fight phase that much. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm. But players are waiting for the game to start. Yeah. Okay, here we go. The game start. Yeah, it's about to start. Get the Thailand as uh, Wu side yeah. and the Philippines. I'll just put a word in the uh, in the river side. Yeah. Never die. Mm-hmm. Make a very deep word in the jungle of Philippines. Both entry and the word are put. And I think the Philippines noticed that. But oh, uh, oh my god. The word is very instantly. But uh, their comps, like, uh, they know there's a sentry and mm. maybe war there. Yes. 
Never die. Very aggressive moving in the river. Mm -hmm. Flat is tool and uh, <laughs> oh, artify and uh, this die already in the Asian jungle of the Philippines. Good. Uh, win. I think Dream Rancher is player support. Oh, the 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 is good man, I think. Yep. Uh, might essence never they take it. And I think uh, Puyan is going as mid here. Yes, sometimes Puyan can go into mid because he has a very high magic damage. Yeah, you just spam the. Uh, you just spend the, their dam uh, the damage skill. Mm. We will see. Cow versus Goodman in the mid. Uh -huh. Huyuan, Huyuan has no escape skills. Yeah. So if anyone come to gank him, he will be a dangerous situation. Yeah. Oh, a nice dodge hit for but denied by Cow. Yeah, and uh, right now, I think uh, the. I think uh, is Shu Shu Huang playing in the jungle as the carry hero. Shu Huang as carry, very yeah. interesting choices. Yeah. And uh, Shu Chu is playing bottom as the uh, tanky one. And uh, his control never die. Already okay. in the jungle. And the Shu Chu is already down. The first battle has come out. Uh, cool 11 first play in versus the uh, shrill. Ta on the bottom then and uh, put back again. Very nice crit. Uh huh. Call makes so, so mad. Let me jump. We are, yeah. we are going to die. Nice play for Call. And we can see that Puyan is uh, still a little uh, bit another, fragile in lane. Another crit front hall. And uh, get Shu Chu here. Okay. Yeah. Uh, three to zero in the landing phase for yeah. Thailand. Really powerful team. Mm -hmm. uh, but uh, there's a lot of potential on the Philippine side team. So we can still wait. And uh, oh, he barely down. Okay, Again, Dream Rensho is down. <laughs> Again, never they got Dream Rensho in the jungle. And the call from the speed essence. And uh, maybe he can do another solo kill. Well, for his portion. And the tie. Call back to the mid game. Speed actions. Use speed actions. You want to get that kill? One more hit. One more Two hit. more kills. And he's done. And Call had already got a three solo kill in the first uh, three minutes. Cow is put back again, and the Tay is okay. The second one you cannot chase. Tay and this die. And put back again. Get a glitch. How can he be? <laughs> oh, Thailand player. Uh, uh, it's here eight comes zero, <laughs> like in three minutes. Already built like a. Here comes the cow in the top lane. One hit, two hit, and he's down. Yeah. Oh my god, that Never. is dropping every lane. <laughs> I have a dead call. Uh huh. Uh, uh, that's a little bit of savage. Yeah. Now that has already pulled the creeps to the opponent's mana. Yeah. And uh, we yeah. can see. Uh, Ta. Ta already level 6. <laughs> we can see that uh, the Shu Huang have not found enough gold in the jungle. That's. Uh, this kind of hero, they can not farm very fast. Another in crouch for Nita. And uh, uh, to, to just down him. To, to try to defense. And, and another then, crouch. Oh. Yeah, but uh, nice two play. heroes here. Tall like a monster in the bottom lane. Mm -hmm. And uh, never la never die, so I can play around in the land. And the uh, shoot is down again. It's ten already to 10 zero. to 0. Only 5 minutes in the game. Oh my god. Oh, still pushing the land. 
and a cow. Guzman, Guzman, can Guzman escape? Oh. No. Oh Again, cow solo kill Guzman. Eleven to zero. So you cannot. Put and this the, the artifact already taken their balls. Yeah, what a discipline! A, it's a nether file for uh, Dream Lolly, which is very good item for him. And uh, never die just playing around on the top. Seems no man can get into the land for Philippines. Yeah. Whenever they they appear in land they will die. Mm. And the thing getting just uh, staying jumping. Again never die for the Jason. Can Jason escape? Mm. He does not have out so he mm. cannot respond. Jason still tree tree really low, really low, really low. Again really. never die get this killed. Okay, it's a uh, 12-0 lead for them. Oh, that is such savage and brutal. Again, call and then never die, get another kill. Oh my god. <laughs> Can Philippines kill anybody and in this game? They start again. And no, uh, they I think they need they some... Does all does need to get back, but yeah. you really need to kill someone. Artify, use his out, kill Pu Yuan. Yeah. And <laughs> okay. Uh, the observer is very busy in like switching around the area. Yeah, obvious out of control now. Yeah. And the call already, how many kills got? Mm. Five kills? Two. Okay. Ta, chase two. Two is done. They are doing a race. Oh, oh my god, only 6 minutes yeah. already. 18 kills for Thailand. And they will have the for Philippines. <laughs> it's I mean, unbelievable <laughs> in this match. This Diana Ta uh -huh. never they already invaded very deep in the Philippines jungle. And we can see uh, Jason has got level 6. Already go, go back in the tower to tower. And uh, there's no. Trying to oh. crush! Nice crush! Tower! Oh my. Really nice move. Already 20. Nearly 20 kill for him. And the uh, pullback <laughs> again. Another the crush! And the uh, is done. Artify. Again, uh, Carl got the Puyuan in the jungle <laughs> and <laughs> never die. And can he uh, get him? Oh, just let it go. Back. Yeah. Dream Ganyin. Oh, what a nice play for Thailand and the Philippines. They really need to get their first to stay in the game. Yeah, they just want to grab one hair there and uh, call again. GG, I think. Again, they got Kao got Puya in the jungle. I think the Philippines needed to organize, uh, organize uh, team fights, not yes. a war. Not uh, everyone spread on the map and get a solo kill the back call, never die. Yeah, and uh, he's already on the mid and uh, he doesn't want to play around him. <laughs> oh, Artify already on the high oh, ground. Uh, out he was Artify. Two died again. Artify. One out and two hit and uh, two two star, I think. They are pushing the high ground tower while the top tire one tower is still alive. Yeah, again artify. Yeah, Xu Hong showed up and get back to Fountain again. Can hardly tell who kills who in this game. It's too quick. Yes. I would like to. Nowadays well, using the ult, but no damage here. And uh, another crouch for Tar. And the Guzman come, can he make enough damage? They really need it. Oh uh, no, here comes a call. Yeah. The Thailand the tower. Thailand is still getting in under the high ground that they want to push. And the Sun Huan is on the mid. And the every hero is some hero is going to mid Never to try that. to grab him. And the other one just puts pushing the base. And the cow Back again. Call and talk, get another kill. Mm -hmm. Artify back to. Okay. Oh, the ult. That's the first brother for Philippines. Very nice. Very nice. But, but uh, Jason. Yeah. Can they pull one back and uh, 
Artify, just grab one and never die goes up again. Uh, finally, for never never die to show up. Artify, just a hit, 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 hit in the buildings. Mm -hmm. and, uh, <laughs> I think someone is attacking the enemy's first tower. <laughs> but the tie two tower in the middle is yeah. Not. The second tower mm, is still, still here. here. They need to put tie two tower, then the high ground tower. Yeah. Artify. Very power. Already four fifteen k gold. And the cow is here. And got uh, uh, another kill of Confirmed. And, and uh, Artify getting into with his out. And uh, he got a respawn on Xu Huang. And uh, he's down again. And two lives, two kills, Artify. That's out for Pu Yuan, but not enough damage. And then and another uh, out for Dream Yuan Shao. Dream Yuan is taken down by Go to team fight for Philippines. They get two men back. Yeah, and uh, they should retreat, mm. I think, right now. No. To gathering some resources. Mm -hmm. Maybe push the top tower. And get the boss. Yeah. Mm, I think they barely focus on boss on Thailand. They're playing a different strategy. They're playing around the tower. And kill everyone who come try to defend the tower. That's because they mm. are very strong. <laughs> never that. Never that at all. Who gave you the encourage? Okay, so there's go a out here. To go down the high ground. Never that. So tanky. Uh, the other three heroes are pushing the top lane. And uh, the, they are like busy. Oh, what if I almost. Down. Destroy every building in the base. Yeah. Artify. Still, still hit, still hit, make damage, artify. Can Philippines get artify? No. No, 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 he's down. Uh, it's with a Tian get lag for uh, artify. artify. Still hit, destroy every building in the Philippines base. Uh, we can see like uh, artify no. make 10 uh, kill and. The dream lolly, uh, with he got a uh, 20k gold uh, while the Philippines carrier only 6 6k gold. What a horrible monster artifact! And they're pushing the uh, their mid barracks, and uh, I think Philippines are giving up to define the. So it's gonna be, I think, the shortest game of this tournament, maybe? Another nice clutch. Yeah, I think the, the one the shortest is gonna be China versus Hong Kong, 17 minutes. Yeah. And uh, this one gonna be shorter, maybe. Not to try to play bring to initiate, but not enough damage. Artify with his out. Yeah, and so far, just jump in, never die. And. Uh, <laughs> yeah, they just uh, pulled back again. No, they're already in the fountain. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, Ta and the artifact come to cover, never die. Yeah. Only two towers in front of the base. Cow is pushing the tower. Philippines try to make another initiating, but their damage is too low. They cannot uh, kill anyone of Thailand. Yeah. Never die, another cut in. Good man, can he run? No, good man is down again. And yeah, another yeah. catch for Ta. Yeah, never die, died finally. Finally, but Artify is hit the base and of the, the Philippines. Is very low. Yeah, but mm. Artify uh, uh, he gives no sense about other things. He just wanna uh, attack the base. Very low Artify, can, can yeah. Philippines get it? Yes, yeah, they do finally. it! Artify is down. Philippines a nice defense in front of their base, but there's uh, no other building in their high ground. Can they contest the uh, mega creeps? Already f 54 kills for Thailand. Will there be another 60 kills today? Never die. Got in and uh, Artify. Artify just and want to destroy the base. So not whatever, I want to get the base, finish the game. Only 14 minutes for Thailand yeah. to win this game. 
I think it's one of the fastest game in the tournament. What's a uh, play Thailand? Yeah. I think Philippines are just a little bit upset about their drafting. Uh, maybe they think I in I some think other ways how this hero works, but uh, I mean, Dreams yeah. of Kingdoms, they are kind, kindly different. Like you have to uh, understand, have better understanding of how this hero performs. I think that's not about the understanding, just the skills. Yeah. A talent player's skill is too outstanding. Yep. Cow, uh, never die, and Tar. Tar almost get every hero in land. Mm -hmm. Philippines player seems a little bit disappointed. Yeah, they feel a little bit upset about their uh, first match. Although they are not like they have drill heads, but uh, you know, they want to come up with some ideas. Mm, maybe, maybe how to stay more consistent in lines. Maybe, tr maybe to Zhou Yu in the second game? No, come on. Like, uh, they should pick uh, maybe Guyong or so. Yeah. Yeah, Dream Wally, which are very powerful hero in the lamb. Like uh, Shu Chu and uh, Shu Hua, I don't think it's a very good choice for their first two pick. Maybe they can pick Chiao Chiao, which play very similar to some other heroes. That's, yes, it's strange that it uh, seems only Thailand and China will pick Gu Yong in the first two pick. The other, they just ban at their first dance, maybe. Because Kuyong is a very powerful supporter in this vision. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, Thailand, their draft is very consistent. Yeah. You, you choose Kuyong as your supporter. Either you choose Guojia, but it uh, seems Philippines did not focus on their support choice in their drifting. Mm -hmm. True. We will waiting for the highlights of this game yep. and, uh, who, and uh, who, who, who do you think will be the MVP of this game? I think uh, you're gonna be Kao maybe since mm. he is like dominant uh, like in the mid lane and yeah. also he is very uh, active in both top and bottom lanes yes Kao almost uh, Almost the ruler the mid lane, and uh, I think uh, Ta has a very good uh, skill casting. He almost uh, gets to everyone on the uh, in the bottom lane. Yeah, I think uh, he played Dream Guan Yu, which is very um, like powerful hero, like compared to other players uh, who play Dream Guan Yu. Yes, which mm -hmm. does not hook very That's well. seems a different hero in his hand. Yeah, I agree. So. And uh, I think uh, uh, Never Die, he play very well in the landing phase. Mm -hmm. Although like uh, <laughs> this game end very quickly, yes. he's still very active in lands. Never Die almost uh, always 102 or 103 in the top layer. Yeah. Alright. Okay, we will see the highlights of this game. See you soon.
back and uh, we just see the first game between Philippines and Thailand in Battle 3 and we can see that a crash for Thailand to Philippines like in the first 6 minutes the zero head on the Philippine side while Thailand they already get 20 or 23 takedowns I think mm -hmm. and uh, yeah so they I think at the end they nearly make uh, about uh, 50 kills on Thailand mm -hmm. I yeah. think they can get 60 kills, but Artifact just want to destroy the base and end the game. Yeah, there are both ways to destroy the game. And uh, I think the, in the second game, the Philippines, they just gonna come up with some ideas about how to not struggling in lands, mm -hmm. in landing phase. Really pick a Zhou Yu to defend their high ground. I think they just need to find out some ways to not beat, beat up that hard, maybe. But that's very hard. Yeah, I agree so. Because they almost lose everyone to one land. Yep. <laughs> and uh, I think uh, for Thailand, <laughs> the second... Uh, but they are showing up their best, so, but I don't know if they're gonna... <laughs> you know, uh, make some games or like pick some wild heroes so that uh, uh, maybe Philippines has a chance to win one or two lanes. Yes, I want to see Artify play other heroes. Yeah. Uh, right well now he only play... Huang Yuan Yeah, and then right now we can see the statistic board here. 53 kills for Thailand and uh, 5 kills for Philippines mm -hmm. and uh, 74 kills for Thai uh, assistance for Thailand. You can see Thailand almost uh, uh, kill people with their uh, kill enemy with their teammates, not yeah. like the uh, Hong Kong China. Hong Kong China almost uh, do ever kill by solo mm -hmm. and they will have less assistance than Thailand. And I like Thailand's play skill. And we can see the MVP yes, is Thai, Thai PCR here. And uh, he Dream Guan Yu. Dream Guan Yu. Uh, he is very consistent uh, on getting every hero on the land. Mm -hmm. And uh, both in like uh, in the, the, the team fight phase. Yes. Ta, ta help his teammates make a huge advantage at the bottom lane in the early facing of the game. Yeah, and uh, you can see like uh, it's coming up the second game. Yeah, we can see the player of the Philippines. Yeah, they are already uh, waiting the second game to start. Seems a little bit upset. Uh, but uh, to not be upset, uh, I think Thailand is like one of the best uh, team mm. in this tournament. Mm, yes, good uh, individual skill and uh, good team works. Yeah, and their uh, team fight is very satisfying for me. Yes. Thailand's player, mm -hmm. very happy. They have won all three games today. Yeah. And uh, let me see, so there's only s three teams, so this is gonna be their last best of three mm -hmm. in this tournament. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and they're gonna maybe they're gonna make a, a full win here. And uh, yeah, we're just waiting for the drafting phase. And uh, yes, yeah, so in, I think today's game all like ends very fast, like in ten or twenty minutes. Uh, however, like in Dream Three Kingdoms, if the two team are very close to each other, uh, the game gonna be a little bit long. Yes. maybe to thirty or forty minutes. Mm -hmm. Longer, it gonna be fifty minutes. But I think the 
like in the tournaments of Dream Three Kingdoms, the players are play a little bit uh, not that consistent. Like uh, there are only maybe two or three heroes ganking one lane and getting ahead and uh, go to farm the resources and then go back and then get another queue. They do not focus uh, on like uh, getting the towers or maybe getting down barracks. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So maybe in this kind of important tournament, uh, they will be a little bit more consistent. I think in this tournament, mm -hmm. Thailand and China is the same tire team. So as we can see, the drafting phase is Dot and the Philippines as a wood side and Thailand as a wood side. Yep. Again, Philippines bans one guy. Yep. Will will so Thailand uh, let uh, Yu Ji out so they can pick it? They ban Yu Ji and uh, uh, Liu Biao. How can they ban Yu Ji? Yeah, for Thailand. Well, Philippines choose to ban Huang Yuanying. Yeah, let's wait and oh. see. The yeah, Huang Yuanying performed very good in the last game. Yeah. And the Dream Dream Guan Yu, Dream Guan Yu, and Huang Yuanying, I think. Yeah, but uh, you know, like uh, Thailand uh, player have very large uh, hero pools. They can play maybe five or six heroes so you cannot spend every hero that they pick yes your post is a big advantage in the drafting phase yes, so they oh, you Yong, which like uh, thailand they always pick first yeah very popular support hero <coughs> and uh, what will they choose for their third band yeah. they already ban gu yung maybe guo jia yeah, so uh, the dream Loli. Loli, which performed very well in the first game, and the oh Thailand band Dream Guan Yu themselves. I think this is an OP hero. Mm -hmm. I think uh, Philippines they should follow what Thailand picked. Maybe uh, pick uh, Huang Yuan first. Huang Yuan, but the uh, Dream Loli and the Dream Guan Yu is already banned. They they can come up with the uh, team Liu Shan and the uh, Huang Yuan combo. Yeah, yeah, because if they they don't pick Huang Yuan in Thailand, they can get up uh, Dream Liu Shan and Huang Yuan combo for they have two picks. Yeah, and that's way for it's a long thing for uh, Philippines. That's way what they pick first. Or maybe pick Dream Liu Shan because it's a very nice kindness hero and it has a very good skill of initiation. Okay, so they Sun pick Sun Quan, uh, which is a very powerful support, support hero. Again, Dream Liu, Liu Shan, Shan and uh, Dream Yuan Shao. Okay, that's very powerful for Thailand in the landing phase. I think it's a. Uh, you can say all two win for Kao to pick uh, Dream Yuan Shao. Mm -hmm. uh. Kao, Dream Yuan Shao, really nice skill. Mm. Turn for Philippines to pick yeah. Sun okay. Huan. So they think Sun Huan is uh, very OP in the uh, landing phase. Yes, hard to kill. Yeah, and uh, easy to combo with other heroes. Mm -hmm. Especially with Huang Yuan, will they pick Huang Yuan in this pick? Yeah, and uh, Sun Quan, it's already uh, okay. They pick Xu Huang again. Mm, Xu Huang they again. They are believing that they can like, build up the team fight with these three heroes. Mm -hmm. And let's see what Thailand picked. They can pick Huang Yuan. Yeah, Huang Yuan and Jim Liu are very nice combo. And they have played it in the early game today. Oh, maybe they are sick of playing. Oh, Yan Liang. Oh, Yan Liang is out, out of the band pool to yeah. first, uh, first time today. Yeah. Yan Liang is a very strong uh, initiating hero. Yeah. 
And let's see the second ban phase for them. Second ban phase, uh, Philippines will ban one hero first. Mm -hmm. And uh, let's see, so they're still, let me see. Okay, so they are banning their carries. And the two bins for Thailand. Uh -huh. What will they choose? As, uh, Philippines still need a mid hero and a carry player. Mm -hmm. I think they can ban Dream Lolly or Poli. Oh, so. Dream Lolly is already banned. banned. So they should ban Lolly maybe. Or Cream Xiao Chao, maybe Xiao Chao as well. Yeah. So they ban Dream Xiao Chao. But I don't know if Philippine will pick. So they ban Luo Li. Yeah, I think it's uh, like uh, they think their lack of the burst damage on the Philippine side. Lolly and Lolly are both out of this game. Mm -hmm. And the last ban for them. So, uh, I mm -hmm. think they're coming up with several ideas. Maybe they should ban Pu Yuan for <laughs> for for Thailand for Philippines. Right. I think it, I think Pu Yuan is a good choice. Yeah, uh, I really. Seeing some other like heroes coming up in this tournament, yes, as carries, mm, but uh, we can see there are still some very, mm, very special carries already on the ground, like Marin Lu and so on. Maybe Sun Ling Long, yep, Dream Sun Ling Long, maybe, or Dream Liu Bei. No terms, not many seconds for Philippines yeah, only to make seconds. their choice. I'm thinking a lot. Mm -hmm. Okay, only 10 seconds. They wanna come up with some heroes. <laughs> only 5 seconds. Uh, what are they waiting for? Maybe prayer, just prayer. Okay. Uh, the clock uh, stopped. Is there any technical errors? Is it a uh, free band? Like no hero band? I'm not quite sure. Is that a pause in the game? Mm, maybe there are some technical issues. Philippines can make their last band. So at this stage, which which which, which side do you think? Okay, there's a technical pulse here. Surely, I prefer Thailand is drifting. Yep, Thailand is doing some better drafting in the early stage, but they're still like they haven't come up with your carries yet. So you think uh, they're gonna pick a? So. What carry you think they're gonna pick? I think uh, Pu Yan is good and uh, Dream Sun Ling Long. Dream Sun Ling Long? Yes, and uh, Dream Sun Ling is also okay. Yeah. Uh, the artifacts are very reliable carry player. You can give him any he hero and just let him farming in the jungle. I think Dream Cao Cao is like depends on the uh, like uh, very mid stage. Like uh, Dream Cao Cao is not very good in the early stage, I think. Mm -hmm. But uh, uh, Thailand has call and uh, and never die. Yeah. They can they can hold the early stage for the Thailand team. Mm -hmm. uh, especially when Kao cho um, chose uh, Dream Yuan Shao and uh, Thailand also has Dream Liu Shan in their team. Yeah, so, yeah, let's just wait for the technical pause here. 
and yeah, may come with some issues here with the uh, drafting phase. Yeah. Still waiting for the reference. Seems <laughs> Philippines player is communicating with the reference. So we can see like uh, it takes a lot of time for them to do the banning phase. They maybe just think uh, too much. Yeah. Maybe just ban the heroes that uh, they don't wanna see. Don't uh, come up with the heroes that they need to counter or something like that. Very experienced player, very happy. Yeah, it's rarely seen this thing. And we can... We can say the play is... Is that a Philippines coach? While Thailand players still come in their chairs. It's all to fall. The official game chair partner of the road to the Asian Games. Yeah, we're just still waiting for the technical boss here. Yeah. Okay. Now mm -hmm. we are back. So last pair is the Puyang yeah. here. And the uh, Thailand, they need to come up with the. Uh, Hero that they need to, I think. Oh, I think they can just choose a sport. Yeah. I think there's no need that's hiding their, <laughs> hiding for their enemy's hero, uh, hiding for their carry hero. Carry sport. Yeah. What will they choose? Maybe they can pick Hua Tuo as well, like uh, mm -hmm. the other guys and the other teams. Hua Tuo, Thailand played Hua Tuo in the early games and performed very well. Is Guo Jia bad? Nope. No. So I think yeah, yeah Guo Jia is a very Gua good pick. Uh, um, and the Philippines, they need to come up with heroes that uh, Carry and the mid. Yeah. Stream Xiao Chao still on the. No, it's already banned. So we maybe Liu Bei and Xiao Chao. And we can see that uh, Nipples Xiao Chao is playing okay in LAN. And it's very easy to understand their skills. So the mid lane will be Xiao Chao with the stream Yuan Shao. Yeah. Uh, have we seen this before? Mm, I think we have seen. Mm. I think uh, we have seen stream Yuan Shao with us Xiao Chao in the Thailand game. Yeah, and uh, we ran as the last pick, which is seen. The early game. The last pick for Thailand. They need a carry hero here for Artify. Yeah. And okay, uh, Dream Sunling Long is out. Mm -hmm. mm, it's first thing this tournament. I like Thailand's drifting. Yeah, and very uh, powerful heroes. Yeah, we we can expect that. Uh, they will do very powerful lineup in the landing phase and uh, both in the team fight. Mm -hmm. Players of Thailand waiting for game to start. Yep. Do you think uh, Philippines have chance to play back in this game? Uh, I think they just need to be their best in the land. Mm. If they do well in the landing phase, they can make some progress in the uh, 
the mid scene. However, it's um, there's rarely a chance for them to win, and yep. we can see the game starts. Here we go. The game start and the Philippines in the wu side, Thailand in the way side, and never die again. Natasha shot in the high ground, yeah, but there are there four, are four heroes. heroes here. And never ne dies down. Never they too aggressive. Will he oh. die here? No, he can retreat. Yeah, he retreated out, which is very. Mm. But he's too low. He must uh, go back to the base. Yep. Never die. Just like his name. Mm -hmm. Both teams are waiting for the Asians. Mm -hmm. And they want the central here. Dista mm -hmm. mm. and the tower and the artifact involved the Asian uh, uh, jungle. Block their mm, Asians. Yes. Harassing the farmer and of the uh, carrier. Let's see what the uh, essence they got. They got a night essence. Might essence. Yeah. Will and artifact take it or this devil take it? They will wait for the 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 jungle to respond and then pick the room. Cause my make awards and back to the land. Mm -hmm. Man seems a little afraid of Carl in land. Yeah, and he uses the skill to and uh, the high ground uh, evasion. Bottom land. Oh, this deck get on into the land and it get <laughs> it to a uh, huge damage to his ranch, solo. Ranch hero versus uh, mainly heroes. It's hard for him to play. Okay. Good man, use his skill. Did sure. you not say he did not say he did creep and cow? However he, he, he got it. denied a lot in the landing phase. And his HP is very low. The Sun Huan and the is like playing around in the bottom. Cow. You country the creeps then and uh, get denied on the top land. Yeah. Dream losing get in. Yeah. Can okay, get out. two. This guy and the car. Yeah. Nice. 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 Nice team fight. Yeah, first blood. Yeah, first blood. And again, target to the Veldos. Is very like aggressive in land. Yes, to come back <laughs> and the cow pushes the land into the tower. Yep. They didn't want to cruise the to get any grips from the land. There is a recovery essence, mm -hmm. can't see it. And the pay is down by the two, but the two is only level two. Cow gets back to the land and the never die versus good man. Got many creeps here, but take him back with his skill. Can he get this kill? Yes, yes. another soul kill for Cow. Yeah, very powerful play for him in land. Okay, and Tay come to two and they get killed. This death on the four dust. Can Tay is still chasing. Yeah. Yeah, make it out. It's down the oh, a nice team fight for this day and the day. Yep. They have two strong hills and they get yep. two kills. Kao is making some progress in the lane. Kao and they already and uh, oh my god, blinking the to into the tower is his ulti. Mm -hmm. yeah, the day is just free farming lane. They already level five. Nearly level six. And the uh, the I think uh, on Wu side the the carry are very beefy right now. Artifact. This time them. This time Bolton and Feeling Beast get uh, <laughs> even the, the call still one uh, creeps. 
<laughs> Jason. Jason. Jason is very unhealthy. He needs to escape. Jason, Tulo, what? Why he is back? Uh, and uh, on the uh, top lane. Yeah, top Tay. lane. Both very here. tanky. Yeah. Both no, here enough damage contest. here. And the car is just free farming the bottom heroes. Uh, enemy jungle. Oh, he's he's out to farming in the jungle. Yep. We can see Yan Liang is very good against the enemy hero, especially Xu Huang, since Xu Huang needs the uh, uh, mana to revive. Wow. Four heroes yeah. on the top lane to push the type 1 tower. But at this day, and the Tay defends the tower very easily. And Chisa is farming enemy jungle. The other day was a prone threat. Oh, Tay. Caught, caught Jason, Jason here this day. Jason is skill. only level 5. And uh, he's uh, down as well. Uh, w and E. Got Jason here. Tay back to the lane. Clean you can out see, like, uh, although it's only 5 minutes. There's eight kills for Thailand. Well, oh, zero, zero head for Philippines. That's uh, much better than the last game. Yeah, that's true. I mean, they perform better in the landing phase. And you can see, Jason. Although Jason died two times, he make better networks uh, this time than the last game. Mm -hmm. This die clear the middle lane. Mm -hmm. I mean, Kao is very oh, powerful play. right now. He TP to bottom, I think. Miss. Again, again, Kao oh make a God. solo kill in Shao the middle. Shao is very unconsciously. The Thailand is gathering around the boss point. Yep. Oh, they want to Fire. attack uh, the top lane. The tower is down as well, and uh, so they is the Sun Chen. Good man, die again. Oh, good man, only 3k and 600 gold. Yeah. And uh, uh, we can see like uh, uh, Thailand is like undefeated under the enemy tower. Kao is too strong in the landing phase, almost uh, destroyed the Guzman. Yeah. You can see the first turret is down. IQ 11, first turret is going to raise the issue. And the, if, I, I doubt if Xiao Chao can make any progress. His level is too low. If yeah. Xiao Chao's level is too low, he will not have enough damage. And, uh, they do a very good style on both sides. Yeah, that very good play for Xiao Chao. But uh, Tay, still tanky in the middle of the quarter ground, and of course, blinking in with his ult, he killed everyone yeah, in the battlefield. Is down as well. Artifact solo, but uh, survived. Mm. Scary, but you. Art Artify, 9k gold. Wow, the person only have 4.5k gold. Call clean and then will they push the mid tower? Yep. This day in the call. Call find the Xiao Xiao here. Good man, can he run? Yep. No, call blink in and get everyone again. Good man is done. And uh, so does Flood, Flood does. Mm, the they found a tool here. Two is down again. Them, yeah, they call them again. Will Thailand get to the boss point? It's 1 versus 20 is the uh, score. And uh, I think... Uh, Artifact already building enough item to push the tower. Mm -hmm. and wow, so uh, again, tall with his 
the initial blink beam and destroy the enemy. Tao with Kao. Dream Bash or with Dream Liu Shan. Very powerful team point combo. Never die. Try to retreat, but there are too many people here. Yeah. They get, never die. But uh, Thailand is trying to slay the Wu's boss. Yep, it's very quickly. Can get it. Fury. Artify one blinking. Yeah, Artify blink onto the fold on the face. And the Sun uses his out. Summers to his save out. Himself. However, it, it makes no sense. And the Tao is done as well. Dream Yasha is already beyond the car like. Again, no, no one down for Thailand. Artify. Just Artify to already 12k gold and the cow blinking with his out again. Yep. And uh, Artify need just to kill the, the tower, I think. But I think uh, during Swinning Long hit the tower not as fast as the other uh, physical carries. Mm -hmm. Unless she uses his out. Uh, she uses her out. But I think uh, Cow is T is already to destroy the whole team of Philippines. Yep, I agree so. They are doing very well in land. We have we haven't we haven't seen never die for like, like uh, five minutes. But uh, he's doing a lot of progression in the bottom. Yeah, now the talent will push the bottom land and uh, push the tower tower two tower. Yeah, I see. We can see that uh, they only hit the uh, tier two tower in the bottom that was to left. Mm -hmm. and now it's down. They are only high ground, and, and they blink instantly. Cow again make a huge damage with his ult and the two blink. Yeah, he got Everyone. the ult. Will he make it? Oh, he got one kill at, at least. Don't so just out. Yeah, kill the never die. But uh, the high ground tower is already down. And blinking again. Again, but uh, Chao Chao's damage was very high to take down the T. Yeah, Dream Liu Shan is down. But uh, the other one just said uh, whatever, we just push the lane. Call in front of all enemies. And he's down there again. Call is still alive. And Can he retreat? Down. Yes, Call is survived. Artifice still making damage and then uh, never they come back. Yep. Now Thailand uh, trying to push the midline. Mm -hmm. Four pills under the gr high ground. And wow, the cow is getting back really quickly and uh, he's taking one with as well. Dream another initiation, very nice. And uh, yeah. this die call with his out blinking again. Blinking again. Get everyone down. Yeah, it's a team wide uh -huh. for Thailand. Yes. Five, five for zero. Yep. We are taking down the. Barrack and again, Artify destroying all the builds on the high ground. Yep. There's nothing Philippines can do. Did they? Philippines try to initiate. Okay, very good team fight initiation. Oh. However, uh, they no barely thing. make cow. No, they cannot have enough damage to kill Artify. And uh, Artify that? is still on ground. Cow is still on ground as well. This item is too splendid, Artify, already 20 kick golden. Yeah, and and uh, it's only 13 minutes in the game. I think they just wanna stay on the land, pushing our oh, land. Artify, <laughs> TP back to the tower, to tower and push to the land. Really reliable carrying player. And the car is back to base, and uh, there's some time that we can breathe. And never, never die, die is caught again. 
but uh, he's too tanky. Yep. Comes yeah, Jin Liu Shan. Jin Liu Shan jumps in and oh, nice does all the heroes. Nice initiation. Two versus five. Here comes this die and Artify. Artify try to make get some damage Never here. Dies, not die. Artify kill everyone. His yeah. damage is too high and here comes Kao. Yeah. Oh, Kao found his ulti cannot defend anyone because everyone's taken up by his teammates. That uh, will be the last uh, high ground tower of the Philippines. And the uh, Artify already gets uh, beyond the like as well. Yeah, you can see like 11 are uh, tankier. Two try him. to get to the initial Asian. Yes, they get to the never die. Mm -hmm. But uh, what about uh, the others? Yeah, Artify still make damage, hit and wrong. And the cow waiting for a chance to cut in. Here comes cow, but he was stunned by the yet now. But uh, yeah. uh, Dream Lusha again oh blinking in. Cow, RT. Do we get enough damage? Dream yes. Sun Long is taken down by. I don't know, maybe power? Artify is taken down. But the uh, cow is still alive and, and never they come back again. Blue Shine is back again. Again. The the they are just taking down everyone in the enemy base. There's all already 58 kills. 58. Two more kills and it will make it. 59. Uh, Last kills. And they're attacking the enemy base. And uh, okay. It will be two. 30 kills for Thailand, uh, win this game and uh, the match best of three. Congratulations! To Thailand, undefeated in the group stage. Yeah, I think they have already win every game in group B. Yeah, that's very, mm. Mm, I mean, very splendid uh, day for them in this tournament. Yeah, it seems very happy. Yeah, I think this concludes their journey, is it? Uh, and yeah. the Thailand, yeah, yeah. And and the Atlanta. Philippines, they still got one more match to go tomorrow versus Vietnam. They might have to think a little bit about uh, their drafting. Like their drafting is mm -hmm. like makes no sense, uh, like early. Thailand, Thailand has player still very calm. This shows to the uh, ward, uh, the RDAG shows that. Smile to the audience. Mm -hmm. uh, Thailand is very powerful in Dream 3 Kingdoms right now. Uh, they are like have a dominance uh, stage in the Southeast Asia right now. Mm -hmm. In the C region and I think in the Asian region. Maybe uh, only China can stop Thailand. Yeah, and well that's not just be too much big words, maybe, yeah. They uh, have very good uh, personal skill and a very good teamwork. Yep, yeah, this build up the Thailand uh, team. And the uh, only thing uh, Thailand need to do is stress uh, is uh, control of the balls. Yeah, but uh, I think that's their strategy, like giving enough pressure on the land on the tower so that the enemy cannot go down the mm. go to the other side of the map. Uh, map they can only stay on their own jungle yeah. they can only stay on the high ground they cannot press just uh, yeah. keeping make team fights everywhere in the map mm -hmm. whenever the enemy's hero yeah. appear on the land but uh, this is like a high reward high mm, payback if you make one mistake, uh, you will lose a lot of gold, and uh, then the enemy can push back a little bit, I think. Mm, yes, but uh, they have a very calm carry player, Artify. Yeah, that's true. Mm. You can see, when when Cobb died on the high ground, Artify just TP back to their tier, two, tier 1 tower, yep. and push the line. Yep, so but Artify almost make no mistakes in the games. So you think uh, who gonna be the MVP for this match? Mm. I think uh, Tay or Artify. Yeah, maybe I think Tay should be MVP. Mm. Like uh, he, he 
the same as the last game. Yes, like very it do very uh, precisely marvelous. control of the enemy heroes. Yes, and a very marvelous initiation in the team fights. And I also think Thailand is very creative in team fights. Yes. The the combos, the drafting, they, they always come up with different ideas than the uh, normal things of how you initiate the fight, how you like uh, juke the enemies. Yes, and uh, everyone in the Thailand team wanted to perform us in the team fight. I yeah. can see no pressure on the uh, on the players. And uh, even their uh, even their support, the enemy team cannot contest them. Like especially in early stage, we can see. Uh, Guo Jia and uh, Dream Liu Shan, they are very powerful dual lane the uh, uh, top and the other, the Philippine hero cannot contest them. Mm -hmm. Died a lot of times, I think uh, Wei Yan and uh, Sun Quan, mm -hmm. they died too many times in top lane. Mm -hmm. And the uh, Kao make another dominance in the mid lane. Yep, that's like uh, the normal stuff for him. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, a really star player in Thailand. Yeah, and how you think about uh, Dream Sun Ning Long? Uh, like it's first in the tournament? Mm, I think just like other players that yeah. Artifact played. Very reliable, just uh, hit, hit, and uh, find some choice to call in. Okay, yeah. well. Alright, we oh. will see the highlights soon. See you soon. can see the best of three of uh, uh, Philippines versus Thailand and Thailand got a straight 2-0 again uh, so during the last uh, last game and we can see the statistic here and uh, Thailand uh, gets uh, 60 kills to win and it's nearly I think a uh, hundred assists yes 
Which they always have many assistants in the game. Yeah, yeah it's phenomenal actually. Since, since they have uh, uh, de uh, they have a desire to team fights everywhere. Yep, and uh, they got the 50k gold lead. And uh, although this game ends a little bit late, but uh, it's still like a dominance mm -hmm. in both landing phase and uh, team fight phase. Yep. And uh, I, I feel very heavy for them since they show themselves in the like international stage. So the and MVP will be the support player. This uh, guy was gorgeous. Yeah, he's like take part in the many fights mm -hmm. in the yep. uh, team fight phase and also in the early uh, the landing phase. He destroys the enemy. Yes. He helped uh, Tay make huge advantage in the landing phase. Yep. And uh, unlike other support, uh, uh, this day is very It's also very aggressive in the gameplay. Yeah, I just feel a little bad for the Thailand's other player. Uh, yeah, they also play a very outstanding game. Yeah, I think never die. Uh, mm. There's only never die who haven't got the MVP yet, right? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Maybe, maybe next time. Yeah, maybe in the <laughs> Asia game, the 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 Asian game, they will get some more and uh, like uh, choose Sun Huan for him. Yeah, really. Oh, well, we can see Never Die skill is very outstanding. Yeah. In in the game. Uh, but uh, so do the other players in Thailand. Uh, and he like uh, to take high risk action in the game. Yeah. And sometimes he, he can really get Never Die. Yeah, <laughs> that's you, true. You one versus four or one versus five position. Yeah. And uh, yeah. Uh, I think uh, there's one last match coming up soon, which is Kazakhstan vs Nepal. Kazakhstan vs Nepal. Yeah, we have already seen Nepal's uh, uh, match vs Hong Kong China. Alright. We yeah. will see you soon in Kazakhstan vs Nepal. See you soon.
关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了，困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了，困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q4 一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。
太了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。
太了，困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了，困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了，困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。
快了，困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。啊、uh, ，Welcome back to the Road to Asian Game Match Review. I'm Caster Luo Chen. I'm Caster Meng Yaofang. And this competition is jointly organized by the Olympic Council of Asia and the Asian Electronic Sports Federation, operated by Digital Esports Asia. And first of all, we like to thank our prestige sponsors, FLW. Audi Q4 e-tron for the strong support for the event, and we also like special thanks to iQ, the official mobile gaming equipment of the RDAG, the professional choice to empower victory, embrace the thrill of control. Let us also thank our official supporters Omen, New Omen, New Journey to the Road of Asian Games. Let us also thank our official supporter Autofu, Autofu official gaming chair, partner of the Road to Asian Games, be your own hero. Thank you to our official supporter Istrok for their support. We would also like to thank our official broadcasting platforms, Bilibili, We Are Live, Douyu Live, Kuaishou Games, China Mobile, Meibo Channels, Tencent Video, Weibo, Xiaohongshu, YouTube and Twitch for their support. And uh, we're gonna face up the last best of three game of this day, uh, Kazakhstan versus Nepal. And uh, uh, we can see it's uh, East Central Asia versus South Asia. Yeah, we have already seen Nepal's uh, games uh, versus Hong Kong China already this day. Yep. And uh, we can see like uh, Nepal are like uh, the whole team, they are. They have creativity in the drafting phase. However, they do not like perform well in the landing and the uh, team fight phase. And we can see the starting lineup here. And uh, for Kazakhstan, their carrier Ordonis, offline Kostanyaski, and uh, solo player Too Fancy Wong, gank player Enforcer, supporter with. And we have seen Nepal before. Uh, their carry Guido and uh, their offline Dreamy and their solo Airwave, their gank Udi and the support Snow OB. Okay, so what do you expect from this match? I think it will be a close match for both teams. Well, I'm not quite sure because I haven't seen the Kazakhstan playing this game, but I do like uh, Nepal's. Uh, uh, made player dreaming his uh, choice to play the Zhou Yu, though lost to the Hong Kong China in yep. the early game today. Yeah, mm. I think uh, maybe their team they do not focus on like uh, which position they play. Mm -hmm. Maybe they like which hero they can play and they go to which lane. I think mm, maybe they will have some interesting choice. Yeah, and for. Kazakhstan, it's like uh, the esports era has grown a lot in these days. Like in 
uh, I think in 2017, the Quasar Cyber Sport Federation has like uh, been registered, and then they have their uh, their esports thing has grown a lot mm -hmm. in this like in these six years. Although there's a, a coronavirus uh, uh, situation mm -hmm. in this era, and uh, you know it still like uh, helps build the esports thing mm -hmm. since like uh, more people tend to play some esports game at home. Yeah, that's true. I think uh, esports industry in Kazakhstan has grown uh, rapidly in this years, and they have many really talented players in esports, especially in mobile games like uh, uh, League of Legends and uh, Dota 2. Yeah, and they have very talented players in the uh, I think shooting games era. Uh, yeah, we go back to the uh, game. I think. Yeah. So I think Kazakhstan. Uh, should uh, yeah because we have seen the Nepal game before and uh, we can see that uh, Nepal are not very good at the landing phase mm -hmm. maybe Kazakhstan can play a little bit more aggressively in land mm -hmm. and uh, I think uh, some heroes Nepal pick is too passive in the game so they yeah. will lose their landing phase like they choose Tiao and Shu Chu and Hua Tuo as a drift combo, but uh, mo uh, the three heal is all lack of, uh, lack of damage. The burst damage, you mean? Yes. Uh, like uh, when yeah. when they lose the uh, landing phase, Diao Chan can make a uh, little damage in his ulti. Yeah, and I think the second pick, uh, the second game, they pick uh, Zhou Yu which is a very interesting group and we can see the players are already on the scene this is Kazakhstan and this is uh, Nepal Nepal players. Nepal players very happy they are very confident for the upcoming match I think Kazakhstan's player yeah I think they are a little bit uh, mm, no calm. Yeah, calm. Mm, calm and uh, we are waiting for the dropping phase to start and uh, yes so what do you expect the last best of three like maybe pick a uh, different hero in this best of three yeah uh, I expect this gonna be a long match maybe they will build some very late late game items you mean just to uh, keep uh, jogging in the team fights? Yeah. Uh, and uh, do some learning rating in the yeah. game? Uh, this depends on their understanding of this game, maybe. Uh, and uh, we can see it in both. Oh. Huh? Uh, player, yes. Uh, uh, should that be their support play? Yeah, maybe. So, uh, I think like uh, during last two best of threes, there are always uh, let me see, there are always like sixty kills to win the game mm -hmm. uh, for both Hong Kong and uh, Hong Kong, China and Thailand. Mm -hmm. Yes, so we can see maybe a bloody match here as well. Since both team maybe they are not really good at uh, uh, their strategies, maybe they will do a lot of team fights and mm -hmm. uh, there will be a lot of uh, taken downs coming up. Mm -hmm. And I think uh, Nepal's mid player Jimmy is quite an uh, aggressive player, mm -hmm. uh, and he I think he can make his team mm -hmm. make a broadly style play style. Yeah, I think so. I think all the players are in the lobby, just wait for the game to start. And, uh, yeah, and uh, also there's one interesting uh, thing here. Oh, here yeah, here's come um, up the dropping base. So Kazakhstan at the wood side and the Nepal in the way side. Yeah. Uh, on the Wu side, Kazakhstan band Sun Lu ban first. Turn for Nepal ban two heroes. 
可是现在我这边的生路班，还是去那波看班雇佣，哦，过去。军官少 ，and the 军官鱼 ，I think they maybe see some match before,、mm-hmm. and in this moment they are very powerful heroes、yes. in the early phase. And、uh, very quick ban for Kazostia. Yeah, I think they ban the Zuo Yue and Xu Chu, which uh. Nepal picked before, and the Kazakhs then picked Diao Chen. Nepal、yeah. played Diao Chen in the early game th- yeah. today. Yeah, they just、uh, take one hero from their hero pool.、Mm. But Diao Chen is the、uh, hero that cop damage in the early phase of gaming. Yeah,、so、maybe don't put him as the、uh, carry hero. Just put him in the uh safe land, not、mm-hmm. not safe land, the bottom land. The The offline phase, so as a solo hero. Yep. Here comes Huang Yueying. They put put the Huang Yueying. Oh, maybe Huang Yueying and Dream Liu Shan. We have already seen this hero combo in Thailand skin.、Mm-hmm. And let's wait for the second pick for Nepal. Now I think、uh, Sun Huan and Huang Yueying. Ah,、uh, Sun Huan and Huang Ying are also very good、mm-hmm. uh, yes. team fight combos. Not only the Dream Liu Shan,、uh, Jia Shu, which is、mm-hmm. really interesting pick for Nepal. Yep, and、uh, wait for Kazakhstan for their s- s- second and third pick. What will Kazakhstan choose?、Mm-hmm. The both team. Doesn't like to pick sports first because we know that China and Thailand like、mm-hmm. to pick their sports in the first to pick. Here comes Pang Tong and Sun Huan. Oh, very quick pick for Nepal will be Ma Yunlu. Yeah, Ma Yunlu is. Have we seen this in、yes. the China versus Hong Kong China? Yes, Ma Yunlu. China play Mario Yunlu as their carrier,、mm. and、uh, they pick Pang Tong、uh, for Kazakhstan.、Mm-hmm. Very quick ban for Nepal. Dream Lolly. They are banning the mid hill or mid. The Liu Biao. Maybe another mid hero here.、Yeah. They have already been dream very short and dream lowly.、Mm-hmm. Be lowly. I think Pang Tong is a very good support hero. It、mm-hmm. can control the enemy hero, and while it can put down his ult, can push the tower,、uh, which is a very like、yeah. uh, uh, the tower oriented hero. Yes, and、uh, he has a high skill of stone.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, and、uh, can that will be a very long thing for Nepal.、Mm. The last ban. Will there be another mid hero? Yeah. The ban the maybe Lolly or Dream Xiaoqiao. Yeah. Maybe ban Xiaoqiao since it's、uh, very popular in the. <laughs> Uh, this kind of things, but、uh, maybe Nepal want to pick Xiao Chao. They may all. Yeah, so they ban Pan Feng. So they think they will add another. Another、um, yeah, hero. Tanky hero. They ban Guo Jia as the last one. But、uh, I think Gu Yong is still here. Oh, they pick Sun Jian. Very quick pick for Kazakhstan, Wei Yan and Cao Zhi.、Mm-hmm. We、so、have seen Wei Yan many times in this game. Cao Zhi will be their support.、Mm-hmm. And let's wait for last the last pick, pick for Nepal. Xiao Chao again, dreaming like Xiao Chao. Yeah, Xiao Chao is,、mm, I mean, easy to play in the landing. Yeah, Xiao Xiao can make high damage in the early and the mid age of the game. Yeah. And let's wait for the game to start. 
Who's trapped to prepare for? I think, uh, let me see. Kazakhstan's pick is, I mean, I, I'm fond of Kazakhstan's pick. However, I think uh, mm, Nepal have a better landing phase picked. You like uh, Nepal because they have a stronger landing hero? Yep. I don't think they have stronger landing. Let's wait and see. Yeah. Okay, here comes the game. Kazakhstan mm -hmm. versus Nippo. Kazakhstan in the Wu side and Nippo in the Wu side. Yep. Let's see Kazakhstan. Five here. Yep. Move to the bottom map. And waiting the for the assets. Well, Oasis put a warden on the high ground of the ancient point of the Nippo. Yeah. The Dreaming still put the lantern on the mid mm -hmm. the ward and they have not picked the ward on the other side. Uh, I think Nippo wanna build the ward uh, on their high ground. Yeah, they did that and they put sentry on the in the river. Ten uh, seconds to for the game f to start. Where will the foster essence refresh? Yeah. Dreamy is waiting in the top of essence point. Mm -hmm. Not very common for a mid hero. Yeah. So the essence refresh on the bottom of the map. And uh, let's wait the uh, landing phase. And uh, we can see Xiao Chao is blocking the creeps. And mm. two fancy wall. Mm, I think it's the Pantong who is on the mid. Fancy. And, see. and uh, hit it. once he have enough experience and levels to level six, he can instantly go and push the towers. Yes. And uh, he also have very high impact damage to clear the line and the do damage for the enemy. Yeah. Mm. Adonis down the Woody mm, the bottom Woody there. is about to down first. Yeah. And uh, Aqua 11 first blood embrace the show. Not both made hill just use their skill to push the land. Yeah, uh, clean the lands. I think they do not harass a lot in the landing phase. Nice deny for Dreamy. Yeah, nice down and for uh, him. down the two fancy one. Yeah, I think uh, Tom Tom cannot do a lot in the landing phase. Oh, Kazatoon and uh, Greedo farming in his own jungle. Yep. This game is quite peaceful in the landing phase, unlike I the Thailand game. I think uh, Nepal is mm, playing a little bit greedy. Mm -hmm. Like they pick a lot of uh, heroes that need a lot of gold, mm -hmm. like Ma Lu and uh, Huang Ying. They mm -hmm. both need to farm a lot of gold. But they need to rely on Dreamy. Okay, so Dreamy is uh, nice down for Dreamy. But what? Fancy is w what? What is he doing? Too Fancy one just uh, uh, go straight into the tower. Maybe he just uh, want to get back to base and uh, get a recovery. And the Dreamy got the uh, uh, recovery uh, essence. And Ardenis. Another kill for Ardenis. Mm, really nice play for him. Oxygen. Mm -hmm. oh, the top lane. It's a ranged hero versus melee hero. They're gonna be an uh, advantage in the lane. He missed his down. Okay, can, can he, he grab him? But uh, the it's out of the lane. Uh, yes. Out of the tower, so tower cannot hit him. Out of the range of the tower. Do and make he's up still up? chasing. Two fancy uh, get a stun. He's stunned and, uh, oh. Another solo kill by Dreamy. Nice juke for Dreamy. Yeah, the Nepal team really ha have to rely on the early phase of the gaming on Dreamy. Yep. And he's doing good. Yes. 
and I think uh, uh, in the bottom lane, uh, Diao Chan is doing really good. I mean, I don't need. Yeah, Woody has already died twice. Yeah. But uh, Woody is already level 5. Back to the Lani to Fancy Wong. Only level 4, while well, Dreamy is level 6. He has. He can cast his ulti. Back to land, Dreamy. To push the land. Get the last hit. Ordonis again. With ulti his ult ulti. with Wiz. And Ooh, they, they died again. Yeah, they got Woody again. That's then into two kills ahead, but the net was is even. I think Cao Zhi is like uh, doing good in the jungle, mm -hmm. and the uh, Sun Huai is roaming, I think. And the two fans one wanna like gank with uh, Summer. However, Adonis get uh, <laughs> Summer and his uh, teammates. Again. And uh, oh, he put down the out to. I think it's a waste of out. Yes. They should just use the out to push the tower, maybe. <laughs> but he, if he, he can get that kill, that will give him some gold. Yep. I think if Enforcer plays the Sun Huan, he's just roaming around. Mm, but uh, he harassed the enemy, that uh, they're scared of him to show up in the ground. Yeah, come to Guido, want yeah, to stop him. Can but he stun him? No. Oh, can he? No. Too far away. But, uh, but here's the uh, Enforcer. Just, uh, too Maybe hard. he will catch another one but the uh, enforcer is too uh, his mobility is too high like uh, mm -hmm. nearly yeah. no one can catch him here do you want to catch no and he, didn't uh, get. he got the in v and the woody only level six <coughs> and the tower with come adonis again okay flash hunt uh, yep and uh, can he get woody get, get it and uh, oh. Yep. However, Adonis get it back, it and uh, one there's for one. another Snobby mm -hmm. on the bottom lane. Yep. But I think he cannot take Adonis. And Adonis is back. Uh, yeah, he got the Snobby. Yeah, it's nice. We get a uh, mighty essence. Yep. Yeah. Face one. There's two Hot heroes him. on the and high ground. Yeah, yeah. but uh, his teammates are. <laughs> Caught in the That's a not a very smart move for Dreamy. He has no version of the high ground. So Kazakhstan then already turned to three. Yeah but, but uh, their network skip was very low. Yeah, like almost even. Both teams do not like to farming the jungle, so they are just farming the Oh the Woody back to the end and in three heroes. Will they get down? Snowby. Can Grado escape from this situation? No, Grado is down. And uh, Grado has down as well. And uh, Kostin's key solo kill on the top lane. Noxong is uh, harassed as well. And Trini is pushing the mid. <laughs> And uh, he's down again. And uh, I think mid tower will be down soon. Two fans one cannot uh, defend the uh, mid tower. Premier mm -hmm. have a uh, really nice back. Okay. landing. Can he, can he get him? No. Nice down. <laughs> and uh, Ox Oxon is farming the bottom lane, and Adonis is here. And uh, he wanna keep chasing. Yeah, he uses his out. A nice to out. Yeah, will he be down? Oh, Ox down. down. And then 11. And Jimmy get a two fancy one again. Mm, it's yeah. a really nice landing phase in the early game, but uh, his team was already 15 to 4. Okay, so I 11 first turret, the best for sure. Adonis still chasing Greedo. Very aggressive playing Adonis. 
Yeah, I think Greedo just need to farm in the jungle. She does not have to come out. It's like too harsh for him, and uh, yeah, there's no need that they're hiding in jungle, waiting for someone to like take the land, but mm -hmm. uh, no one comes. Mm -hmm. <coughs> the night was escape was still very small, very yeah. close game. I think Adonis is very uh, tank. Uh, very far the voices, but too fast he was here too. Yeah, but uh, he got what? the invis. They had got the invisible SS. He Adonis. can see out Dennis. But uh, is that enough damage? Stunk? There comes the teammate stun. Okay. Nice stun. Nice can he dig it up? And a snobby no, is out. No, not miss. But so oh, enough. That's yeah, it. Will that's be enough. enough. Uh, I think snobby maybe cancel the out. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God, Woody uses his out, but he still died. In the top lane, Greedo had to push the bottom lane, but here comes Adonis with from the base. Greedo cannot escape. So as Greedo uh, and, and Snobby. Snobby. It's it versus five. Still very close game. Yeah. You can see the yeah. tennis game. Keep, keep farming on the top lane and they sometimes kill some heroes. While the other okay. team, they, they just farm enough gold. So the, yes, Adon is already 10k gold. Yeah, the net worth is like uh, not so, so big. It's a call essence here. Uh -huh. He didn't move his clone. Do we want to find uh, their uh, essence on in the river? But the essence are already taken by the contestant. So we go farming in his own jungle. Yep. Mm, yeah, I think Guido uh, is farming a little bit behind. Another pass here. Mm -hmm. uh, let's wait a little bit. While we are waiting, we can see like both team, they are very heavy team fight based. Yes, and uh, this game is still very even now. Yeah. Unlike the other games today we watch. Mm -hmm. And both team, they are very focusing on the landing phase, and uh, like but there are a lot of mm -hmm. ganks going on. But uh, we haven't seen uh, any team fights yet. Yeah, like uh, you, you have to see that. Uh, in Dream Three Kingdoms, mm -hmm. like uh, mostly the carry farming the jungle, that's the only way they get beefy at the early stage. You cannot farm in the lands. The mm -hmm. uh, the minions are very uh, cheap compared to the uh, neutral creeps. Yes, and the also the uh, support they have to pull the camps so that the uh, carry can farm more gold. Mm -hmm. That's why we can see the network difference is like even right now, since like no one is farming the jungle, like for both teams. But uh, Adonis, uh, though not farming the jungle, getting many kills in yeah, like he's nearly uh, I think uh, eleven k gold. Yeah, and also he got uh, nine kills and, uh, before he died. Before he died. Yes, and I think we will be back here. Yes, the game is back. Maybe we'll see a team fighting in five minutes. And Hotel's streaming is very beefy right now. Mm -hmm. He got uh, Nike Gold here. Oh, they died too many times. Yeah, I agree so. Impressive. Again, Jimmy gets a solo kill. Hong Kong. Oh, too fancy one. That's not a very good start of the road to the Asian games. Yep. But uh, his team still has uh, like a 2k gold uh, lead in, in this game. Yeah. I think uh, uh, I think uh, Xiao Chao, who is the dreamy, mm -hmm. she built the item that can resist one. Uh, magic that is like oriented to the hero. Mm -hmm. This is a very good build 
the things with Emily Hero, they uh, especially two phase ones Pang Tong, like two skills are like target two heroes. Yeah. <laughs> so like he can play a bit more aggressively in the uh, team fight. Oh, I see Pang Tong is taken down again by Xiao Qiao. Again. Mm -hmm. But uh, both teams are still playing gank and uh, landing. No team fights yet. Yeah, and uh, mm. no one wanna push the land first. It's no Kazakhstan has skill chan and the top as a combo. I think their team fight skill is much powerful than the Nepal. They have combo. Uh, come again with his nice skill costing and uh, get down the cost key. Uh, which is, uh, Too fancy wall again. again. And Adonis, mm. but Adonis, yeah, he's no. making enough damage. Take some two. Adonis was tall true, but uh, he has no remaining damage here. The Wei Yang is back here. That will be a comeback for Nepal. Yep. And uh, they are leading the gold difference right now. Because uh, Adonis the ulti has the same ult at the same time with the Huang Yun's ulti. Yeah, maybe they should try to farm their boss pit first. <laughs> yes, I mean, I like very mm -hmm. good items. Yes. Powerful item for the team fights mm -hmm. since the Kazakhstan is gathering around the boss point. Yeah. So does the Nepal, but the Nepal only have two well, heroes here. Mm -hmm. The Guido is very empty and the snow bee. Right now. And the uh, Oxys on Marinu is uh, like still behind the team. Again, Adonis is yeah. salty. Solo kill for me, Guido. Adonis <laughs> very great player. Yeah. I think with his out, uh, he can easily solo kill every hero on the enemy side. But uh, he cannot fight five heroes at once. The golden game is still now. Mm -hmm. Very close game. Yeah. And uh, let's see who will take the team wife of the enemy. Jimmy with the invisible essence want mm -hmm. to chase someone, find someone in the jungle. But we can see there's a sentry there. Yes. And uh, mm -hmm. I think. If they have both team there. Both team has sentry there. Uh -huh. <coughs> and the uh, Woody pushing the down one to attack the Taiwan tower bottom there. Yep. And uh Kasasian oh that's a nice out and they get two men down. Nepal. And, uh, they wanna push the uh, Kazakhstan want to fight back, Adonis want to find someone in the team. He got a snobby and a Woody. Woody. Adonis uh, has the nice out to take the Woody first. Out to take the Can he get a snobby? And uh, the star is that will be down the yeah. Adonis, but he can still chase him. He's taunted, but uh, he can still chase him. And uh, taunted again. Uh, maybe it's time for them to retreat. Adonis already killed 13 mm -hmm. heroes in this game. But right now he's only building some uh, farming items. He has not built the, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, the damage item yes. or the uh, tanking items yet. But uh, here he is already doing his early, uh, early phase of the game. He's already level 18. Yes. Dial Chan is a very popular game in the end game. Yep. Unless she has items. And they're farming the boss pit? No. Are they? Adonis I think they should contest the boss right now. Found the clone essence. Yep. They're taking it. Maybe use one want to, to juke yeah. the enemy hero. Yeah, <laughs> Juke Dreamy. Like but, uh, two sentry here. Mm -hmm. Now then it's back to the midland. Yep. And, uh, Adonis is farming the land very quickly. Seems he has a splatted item. Yeah. <coughs> the cleave item. 
And uh, well, there'll be the team fight here. Two fancy one get blinking. Down the for the Woody blinking. Miss everyone. The, oh, no one. And everyone is jumping back. And uh, two fancy one. But that's Reeves. No, we can see Enforcer who had played so far and uh, does not make any uh, uh, commitment mm -hmm. in this game. And uh, yeah. he's seen that he's blocked in the jungle. <laughs> he fell from the cloud. And uh, try to find a chance, would they? Can they take the Adonis? But Kazos, they're already gazing under the top of five and heroes. Marin Lu soloed uh, their boss. <coughs> Still trying to find some chance. Mm -hmm. Start a team fight here. Yep. Woody on that. Don't you see, oh, don't you see him? Huh. That's true. Why is he getting Woody? Yep. Stunned. Adonis, will he use his ulti? Fancy one. Adonis uh, was stunned by uh, the Snobby and the Woody. Come back. Like, take the arrow. Adonis oh. found the Dreamy. Dreamy and the Enforcer is Adonis. very low. He need to retreat, and uh, Jimmy has a hesitate. Is this? Uh, Jimmy gets a stun. The best stun. Adonis still have no. Out. Adonis has out. Jimmy totally yeah. died. Take Can down. Woody run? No. no. Should take both of um, the heroes. That's and but uh, Guido, Guido is already pushing the mid. Uh, that's what we call raiding. Yeah, raiding, raiding. And uh, wait, I yeah, is going to like uh, leave him here. Always uh, use his ulti, yeah. but uh, there's too many heroes here. We can see although Kazakhstan wins the team fight, Nepal still got a 5k goal lead here. Yes, or 4K. Nepal get uh, their both <coughs> and uh, push the tower to tower in the middle lane. And Adonis is uh, very sneaky. Like in enemy's jungle. Adonis got back to the Dreamy. I want to kill him, but Dreamy's damage was just too high. And a nice stun for Dreamy. Woody. And Adonis. Uh, he mm -hmm. has already killed 16 heroes in this game. Yep. But he just uh, feed to Dreamy. Yep. So. Uh, so, what do you think uh, Nepal should do? Should they. Play a little bit more aggressively, like uh, pushing less, or they should uh, gather together to like uh, invade enemy jungle. I think uh, it's hard for Nepal to take out advantage in a team fight since Adonis have his out. Uh, here comes a uh, dreamy and again. Solo killed uh, Wei Yan. But uh, if Dreaming can find out on this, just uh, like uh, he kills Wei, yeah? Yeah. the team fight will be very easy for Nepal. I think it's very important for Xiao Chao to. Uh, he already has the hex, yes. and uh, he has the blink, so he can do the uh, kill very easily since. Uh, yes, he can make uh, a yeah. really nice initiation and uh, get out on this. If out on this, yeah. cannot uh, uh, cast his ult. Uh, the team fight uh, will be easy for the pro. I think uh, Adonis should build the magic block yeah. item. Yes. To block the hex. Or maybe a uh, magic emote. Yeah. He sh she already has one, but uh, yeah, it's hard for her to use if you blink and hex yes. the enemy. Yes. That's uh, need a very quick reaction. Mm -hmm. Adonis, all teams rely on him. Yep. His uh, damage and uh, his 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 uh, ulti yeah, to control to control cowards. Yeah, and we can see uh, both teams they just uh, farm freely in lands and uh, do not push lands. Maybe the, the Nepal just waiting for their boss to respond. Yep, I think so. I think there are gonna be a chance. We and we can see uh, Xiao Chao and the uh, Huang Yuan on the Nepal side already make like 20k gold. And uh, while on the Kazakhstan side, there's only one 20k gold hero here, mm -hmm. which is uh, Diao Chan, which is Adonis. Jimmy and uh, Guido. 
Mm, and the Woody already. Oh. So and Jimmy gets a. Cha Cha solo the. No way, yeah, okay. Another kill. Jimmy has a very high damage now and a hex but stuff. So I want to chase them, but Jimmy and it's down to face with Song Huan. And the Guido is here, so is Woody. And jumping. Oh, nice jump out here for Guido. And they get everyone in the. But the uh, uh, counter and attack for Adonis is out. And the Jimmy. Adonis is very uh, powerful here. He will use the hex. Uh, but but uh, he's too beefy. No odd to kill Adonis. And Adonis. Uh, Adonis can still twist back. Jimmy, totally dead here. Snowy, you come too later. Yeah, but uh, you are he's all not uh, Cao Zhi. And Adonis is very low. Yes. But uh, they got it back. You can see Adonis, if the, uh, if the Nepal uh, initiating team fight, Adonis can use his uh, ulti easily counter the initiation yeah. of Nepal. So I think uh, Nepal should uh, uh, le let uh, his hero like uh, uh, rating the landing and uh, try to kill the mm -hmm. uh, landing clear heroes. I think they should do a 5 versus 5 team fight, otherwise uh, Nepal do not have a chance to win. They just hit uh, in one by one, which is not so a good choice. Down. Woody, another time. Very but Woody is really tanky, and Guido is on his way. And Woody, Woody and is Guido out. And out. And Adonis is not here. Guido is Adonis was hit out again, but he gets stunned. Yeah. By Jimmy, nice play for Jimmy. Yeah, this is a very creative move for Nepal. First wait. Uh, Adonis to show up, use her out, and then jump in, and uh, Creamy got everything she's got to kill her. And they can easily push the towers. They got a lot of heroes that can push towers. Yeah, maybe they should go to stay there both. Yep. And uh, Marino is pushing the top lane as well. Sun Huan, trying to find the mm -hmm. They be really tanky, they don't want to trouble with Woody. Yeah. And uh, Sun Jian is stunned as well. And uh, Marinu got the top tower as well. Nepal just uh, gathering <laughs> around their boats. Yep. And the Ox Chan is caught again by Adonis. But you can see Adonis can easily do the solo kill. Yes, but uh, his ult is expensive uh, skill. It's really uh, hard for Kazakhstan to win this game. There's only one way to win for them. But will it be there? Yeah, it will be hard. I think uh, 60 kill is like the... Uh, I think it's uh, reliable, it's uh, maybe reachable so just for them. Uh, for Adonis to use his ult to get the 60 kills. Yeah, one by one. Oh, they have. Uh, Nepal has to stay there both. Yeah, I think Kazakhstan just to need to create some space. Like the other hero go to caught the Kazakhstan hero, and one, uh, one Nepal hero, they are like the lonely, they are solo, so Kazakhstan they can. stay there both. And uh, Nepal, they are mm, they are waiting, maybe. Nepal gathering in the Netherlands. Yep. Woody really tanky. In front of all his teammates, Guido want to clear this land. Yep. And I think, uh, and meanwhile, in the top lane, Jimmy again. Caught solo kill. We yeah. <laughs> And uh, they can easily go harass the main. Oh, nice. Oh, and Adonis skill. is still in the back. Well, Adonis, well can he get it? No, she, oh, she, she caused three heroes. And uh, Only two heroes, but, but Adonis Oxygen make a lot of damage. And Dreamy is here. And Grido is here. Everyone's yeah, down. Mm -hmm. I really had damage that uh, Dreamy caused. Uh, and the okay. Ox too is not in Adonis uh, ulti, so he can. Uh, make a stun for Adonis to Yeah, they can just push the land easily. Jimmy waiting under the ground. Yeah. And so stuff. as the... Uh, he can do a 3. 
and the two jump scene and the two fast one. Well, another and solo came for Jimmy. Oh, it's really like a nice one player. Hit. And the Guido is both to come out from the base and uh, Adonis do, do Adonis does that Adonis has his out. Not yet. Adonis jumping but get killed by Jimmy. Really she does not high have damage. Out. She does not have out. He should he, he should wait for his out. Yeah. And the enforced can't escape from yeah. all the, the nipple way heroes to do is just push the enemy uh, base really barracks. I think uh, it's a really nice pace for Dreamy. Mm -hmm. He find uh, so many chances in there and uh, make a good initiative and again. And Dreamy jumping again, really nice move for him. You can see Adonis can only use his ult to throw kill, but Jimmy is much more flexible. And, uh, Guido is Adonis uses the order from the Jimmy, but uh, Huang Yuying is still out of the ult and uses his ult. Huang Yuying gets uh, double killed, and, and uh, uh, Adonis, can he make it? No, Adonis is down. Yeah, she's like uh, Two fancy one, want to kill two Guido. Yes, he can do it. And the ox is on. She's got a lot of damage actually. It's uh, back from the base and uh, just pushing push the base. Yeah, the base. It's nearly down for. Okay, Wiz is up and Kazos. Wiz is dead. Wei Yan is dead also. The base is the in a really dangerous yeah. situation. Yeah, Oxy is on. I think you just need to attack the base. Dreamy, come again. Dreamy. A really nice play for Dreamy in yeah. this game. And they are wiped. Congratulations to, to Nepal for their victory. Yeah, we can see the game is quite uh, even. tense. Yes, very tense. They can get uh, only like uh, a hundred or two hundred gold gap yep. in the first twenty minutes. And also, we can see that uh, uh, although like uh, Diao Chan mm -hmm. make Adonis a lot of. Yeah, Adonis make a lot of good uh, solo kill in the early stage. Uh, Nippo managed to fight back with very strong team fight. Yes, Adonis must uh, use his ult to make his solo yeah. kill. But if he uses his ult, their teammates will be very hard. Yeah, especially for Xiao Chao. Uh, I mean, uh, Dreamy. Dreamy. She's got. Uh, uh, the hex stuff and she's got a blink mm -hmm. and they just blinking yeah. and the hex Adonis and the every skill just spam on <laughs> her and yes. the, I think Adonis is down very quickly a very aggressive and bloody play for Jimmy yeah uh, and uh, is Xiao Chao dominating the early stage I think yes uh, two fancy one I think two fancy one is uh, three level behind the dreamy and yeah. uh, get uh, three or four solo kill by dreamy yep and uh, also we can see two fancy one uh, the the usage of hero is not so good mm -hmm. since the, they oriented to push the tower as this hero but uh, they always use a skill mm -hmm. to do some uh, hero kills. And uh, to be honest, Pangtong is uh, not a very common melee hero because uh, if when Pangtong stun a hero, he will be stunned too. Yeah. In the middle he of the battlefield. Move. He cannot move and yes. doing any uh, things while he uses his skill to control the other hero. That will make Ponto very fragile in the center of the battlefield. Yeah. And uh, as for mid uh, heroes, your team always wants you to make more damage here, but not only just stun. Yeah, that's true. Just uh, like Dreamy. Mm -hmm. uh, he he can get uh, get uh, other heroes with his hex stuff and uh, blink a dagger easily. Yeah, that's true. And uh, we can see Nepal at last, uh, Marin Lu does a lot of damage as well. Like especially mm -hmm. at the very end game when they are pushing the enemy base. Yes. <coughs> so that's uh, mm. like what I say, their potential for the late game. Mm -hmm. And uh, if uh, Adonis ult didn't uh, control Joshua, mm -hmm. uh, he can easily uh, he can easily counter initiation of Adonis ult. Yeah. All right, we're gonna see the highlights soon.
Sim, o seu. Back to the best of three between Kazakhstan versus Nepal, and uh, we can see a very uh, interesting game in game one, and uh, very tense. Mm -hmm, very tense, and in early phase, uh, Kazakhstan dominates Nepal in the bottom lane, and while well in the mid lane, and the uh, dream is like uh, uh, dominate uh, the enemy hero. Uh, and while well, in the late game, uh, they just use their um, their better understanding of game to destroy the enemy team. And we can see there's the statistic board here. Very close. Mm, very close game. And uh, 43 kill for Nepal and uh, 37 kill for Kazakhstan. Mostly by, I think, by Adonis. Adonis. You can see the uh, uh, Kazakhstan assistance is only 35, mm -hmm. even less than their kills. So the Adonis doing most the solo kill with his ulti in yeah. the game. And we can see the economy lead is not that much, actually. Mm -hmm. 
I think and the M MVP surely goes to Dreamy. Yep. Is yeah, what Greedo? Yeah, yeah. yeah Greedo is yes. also very outstanding in this game. Yep. Uh, I agree. So since Greedo, uh, is like uh, uh, there's one great move for her, like in the uh, mid lane where she just like uh, red in the mid. And so that the enemy team have have to go back. Yes, and uh, he his ult do a lot of damage uh, in the river. Yep. And some team fights. Yep. And uh, he help his team to destroy every building on the high ground of Kazakhstan. I agree. So, so uh, for the second team, uh, second game, what do you expect? Maybe Kazakhstan should ban Dreamy's Xiaoqiao. Yeah, and uh, they, I think uh, Kazakhstan have to make pick some more carry heroes. Mm -hmm. Since like lastly, uh, Nipple pick uh, Ma Yunlu and uh, mm, and uh, Huang Ying, which are both uh, carry heroes. Yes. And uh, Kazakhstan, they only have uh, Diao Chan. As their only carry. Yes, they choose Ponton as their mid heroes, and uh, Ponton is not uh, uh, quite common heroes in the mid lane. Mm -hmm. uh, Ponton play very poorly in the uh, mid stage. Yes, he was get solo killed by Jimmy three or four times. Yeah, I agree so. Maybe he. Uh, maybe Kazakhstan should choose some hero in the mid that can make a lot of damage to help uh, their carrier Adonis. Yeah. And uh, also, I think uh, for Nepo in the <coughs> second game, the dropping phase should more oriented to uh, counter their uh, carry heroes on Kazakhstan side. Yes. Maybe ban three or four carry heroes. Mm -hmm. There's no need to ban some support heroes. Yes, we can see from the first game that Adonis is a really outstanding player. The um, maybe the be best player in the Kazakhstan. And uh, he played very well in the first game, mm -hmm. but uh, he cannot one versus five. And uh, his teammates give very little help actually. Okay, we can see Kazakhstan make a strategy to help Adonis in the early phase of the game. We can always see uh, three or four heroes scattering at the bottom net around the Adonis. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just need to kill Adonis so that you win the team fight. <coughs> For Kazakhstan, they need to keep Adonis farming and then killing to win the game. Yeah, maybe just let him farm in the jungle, like he's farming faster than the land. But uh, I think uh, only farming cannot help uh, Kazakhstan win this game. They also need uh, Adonis to kill some, uh, some, uh, some opponent's hero. Yeah, that's true. We are still waiting for the second game of the best of three, Nepal vs Kazakhstan. So this one. <coughs> so, what you think? Like during the first game, no one built the golden hand. <coughs> Maybe because uh, Kazakhstan choose Ponton as their main uh, mm. hero. I don't think uh, Ponton need a golden hand. No, I think uh, maybe Diao Chan need a golden hand. Uh, yes, Diao Chan can make uh, buy a golden hand. But uh, I think she thinks she's too beefy. And uh, not need any item mm. to help her fast farm faster, I think. Mm -hmm. They need to choose more physical heroes. Mm. But I think Nepal's hero does not build a golden hand as well. Mm. I think Huang Yin don't need a golden hand as well. Mm, but I think mostly, like, uh, mm, most of the time, the carry hero and the top hero, they always build a golden hand. Ma Yu can build a golden hand, I think. Yeah, that's true. Mm. And I think uh, 
they will not have the chance to play Xiao Chao. Maybe Kazakhstan will take us first, or mm -hmm. Kazakhstan will ban the Xiao Chao. Yes, it's Xiao Chao. Well-intended and outstanding. Yeah. And uh, I think the hex stuff is a very important item mm -hmm. uh, in the m like a mid phase. Mm -hmm. so blink deck with hex hex stuff. Yeah, instantly getting killed, and uh, we can see the players are ready for the second match to start. <coughs> Just waiting for the drifting phase. Yep. I think uh, Kazakhstan players are very calm, but a little bit uh, mm, feel a little bit uh, unconsciousness about uh, their <coughs> um, their upcoming match. Yeah. Kazakhstan player seems chewing something. Come. Also, mm, we can see Nepal players, they are very happy about their last game. Mm, yes. Mm -hmm. Although they got destroyed in the first best of three. <coughs> I think mm. there's still a chance for them to come back in, the, in this game and also in the second day. But mm. I think they were facing China. Yeah, I think that will be the last match of the road to the Asian Games in China versus Nepal. Yep. A very hard game for Nepal to play. I hope they will uh, resist a little bit more, <laughs> like to 15 minutes maybe. Or maybe Jimmy will get a shot out. They are still waiting for the drifting phase to start. Very happy new post player. Mm -hmm. And I think the game is about to start. Put on the headshot. What do you think uh, Kazakhstan's players should improve in the second game? Okay, here comes the drafting phase. And then Nepal on the wall side, Kazakhstan on the way side. Yep. First turn for Nepal to ban a hero. Uh, I think thoroughly. Should they ban Xiao Chai at first? Uh, they mm. ban Dream. Dream, Dream Shaw first. Mm. And they ban the. Sun Lu Ban and uh, Diao Chan. They think Diao Chan is a very uh, good pick for. Uh, Kazakhstan Ban Diao Chan. Yeah. Oh. They do not want to li let it out. Dream Loli. Yeah. So Nepal Ban two mid hero I in the first banning phase. They should ban the carry heroes actually. <laughs> they ban the Pan Fang. And uh, so we are spent again. They think it's a very so good so hero. Nepal can still pick Xiao Chao here. Yeah, just pick Xiao Chao, I think. And Jimmy is really good at uh, playing Xiao Chao. Yeah. And uh, he dominated the lane in the last game. Nepal still thinking. Mm -hmm. They will have 160 seconds left. That uh, will be a long thinking. Oh. I think I just uh, Gu Yong or Guo Jia. Yep. I think they should pick Gu Yong. I don't know if any of the players can play this hero, but it's a very good uh, support. Like you can always pick it at first. And uh, Sun Jian is a nice choice because they played Sun Jian in the last game. So as uh, Sun Quan, which is a very popular pick in this tournament. Mm -hmm. Just pick Dream Liu Shan. 
Yeah, that's a really long thing. I think they wanna build build up around the dreamy for the team fight maybe. Only 100 seconds left for Nepal. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think, uh, how about uh, Guo Jia as first pick? Guo Yong or Guo Jia or mm -hmm. Sun Quan? Yeah, it's a really long thing for Nepal right now. There's really a lot of good picks here. So what are we gonna pick? Only one minute left. Okay, oh, so another there's a technical boss here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think uh, the poke uh, the pick some support here yep. in their first pick. Mm -hmm. And uh, waiting for Kazakhstan to do their choice. Mm -hmm. And then he can pick some counter hero in the uh, last pick. We so. And uh, Kazakhstan, they need to pick what uh, their carry uh, carry can play at first. So like uh, maybe mm, maybe Huang Yuying, maybe some other heroes. Yes. Huang Yuying is really a common choice in this tournament. And also Pu Yuan is very popular mm -hmm. in, in this tournament. And they like to reach out, right? I don't know if they are good at playing Yuji. Yes, Yuji is a highly skilled request hero. Mm -hmm. And uh, we are back. back. Pu Yuan and, and uh, Ma Yunlu. Ma Yunlu and uh, Kazakhstan pick uh, Guan Feng and Xu Chu. Zuo Ci. Really good pick for Nepal. They pick a lot of and uh, Kazakhstan they get Xiao Chao. Kazakhstan Xiao Chao too fancy one. Will he play back in this game? Because in the last game he played Pong Tong get uh, solo killed uh, by Dreamy. Yep. And uh, what do you think uh, Dreamy will play this time? Maybe mm, yeah. maybe Pu Yuan? I think Pu Yuan will be their carrier. Mm -hmm. So let's see what they banned at the second phase. So we can see a really rare pick for Dream uh, for Nepal. That is Zuo Ci. Yeah. Zuo Ci is not a common support choice. Yeah. Like Guo Jia or Gu Yong. Mm -hmm. Another long thinking for Nepal here. Mm. And. Uh, Yeah, they banned. Uh, and let's see what uh, Kazakhstan banned. Xinxian Yin. Nepal banned Xinxian uh, Yin, and uh, let's see what uh, they banned the Liu Biao. Interesting to find the things in because mm -hmm. I did not remember any team choose a bad things in in these tournaments. Maybe they have training with the Kazakhstan. Yeah. Oh, Kazakhstan still playing VG. Mm -hmm. So they think Pu Yuan will be the middle hero of Nepal. Yeah. And, uh, we can see. The last band for Nepal. Yeah, that's why what they will pick. <coughs> the band Gu Yong. And I think uh, Guan Feng is uh, have very high burst damage once she has her out, and 
uh, I don't know if Adonis can play this hero very well, but uh, once she got all the items she need, um, she's very powerful in the uh, in mm -hmm. the team fight. Mm -hmm. So Kazakhstan pick away, yeah, and uh, Nepal pick Sun Jian again. The yeah, last pick will that be a carry or a mid hill? Wait, uh, what's gonna be the last pick? And, uh, I think it will be the support mm -hmm. hero here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, while Pu Yuan and the Ma Yun, well, they're both playing as the carry hero. So Sun Jian will be the candidate point? Yeah, but uh, yeah, I think he just go to the uh, off lane. Mm. Yeah. So they pick Sun Shang Xiao. Very yeah. rare pick for them. Another interesting pick for Nepal. Mm -hmm. And the last pick for Kazakhstan. Mm -hmm. What will they choose? Uh, let's wait and see. And uh, they pick Guo Jia as their last pick, uh, which has uh, very high burst damage. Mm -hmm. Very popular support. And I think uh, Dreamy is playing Sun Shang Xiang. Yes, Dreamy chose Sun Shang Xiang. Mm -hmm. And uh, Oxy Zhong is Ma Yun Wu. Sun Shang Xiang is like uh, if you are away from your enemy hero and you can do more damage once you are far away from the enemy. I think Nibos pick will lack of magic damage in the early phase of the game. Yep. But uh, the drafting is really strong in the end game since Ma Yunlu and uh, Sun Xiaoxiang and uh, Pu Yuan are uh, both next carry hero. Yeah, let's see. Okay, Greedo play Pu Yuan and the uh, Oxygen is still playing the He has started the game. Yeah. He's obsessed with he, this hero. The power is a uh, side and the uh, Kazakh turns away. Mm -hmm. But a uh, high ground uh, wood here. And I think Chu Fins Wang will perform better this time. And it, oh. I think Xiao Chao is a um, typical mid hero. And uh, once you have items, you can do a lot of damage like last game. Mm -hmm. So <coughs> be devote. Yeah. For the first uh, ward here. To fancy one, mm -hmm. make a very aggressive ward on the high ground of Wu side. Yeah. And do you think which which team have a, a higher chance to win in this game? Um, maybe Nepal because mm -hmm. they have much more strong hero in the end game. Yep, that's true. We will see Dream. What will Dream me? And uh, Don is, is mm, farming on land. And the uh, Swiss is saving the essence to farm the jungle. What will Dream play like using Sun Shang Xiang? Mm -hmm. Me. Yeah. Nice. So I use the first skill to harass to fancy one. But. Uh, She's far away from her, so she cannot do any damage. Okay. And Sun Shaxiang is lack of magic damage in the early phase. Nice last hit for Dreamy. Mm -hmm. His little position moving. Yeah. Almost they waited every skill of 2 fancy one. Uh -huh. I think uh, Shu Chu is uh, farming in oh, the jungle. Oh, again. And the Swiss is here. The trouble with Woody. Can Woody run away? No, Adonis first bird. Yeah, Echo 11, first blood, interest the issue. And uh, we can see mid, they do not 
do a lot that's of combat in the mid. Yeah, Kazas can help Adonis a lot uh -huh. in the laning phase, just like the last game. Uh huh, and uh, they're doing a lot of damage with the. Uh, Jimmy, now that uh, two fancy ones lack yeah. of magic. The Jimmy's first skill is uh, all of that uh, you are away from the enemy hero, you do more damage. Mm -hmm. And uh, they are harassing. Very aggressive moving for Jimmy. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. And the Grimo is uh, farming the jungle. Yeah, and the wild ox is on. But he loses the uh, these two minus. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think two fancy mm -hmm. one is dominated in the mid lane. Jimmy. Do you seek for chance? Yep. Too fancy one cannot get into the lair and uh, kill Minus. Mm -hmm. yeah. Too fancy one get his. Oh, yeah, here comes again. I thought this. Down is taking down. Yeah, when this is really uh, focus on Adonis net mm. in the early game. I think the enemy cannot contest. Woody cannot contest her in the landing phase. Deny, deny. Let's play for Dream. Again, Dreamy totally come through the middle lane. Another nice deny. Mm -hmm. Zoom. And the options are is to farm very beefy in land, I think. Already level 6 streaming. Mm -hmm. For chance. Yeah. So a nice move. Okay, it's a very high burst damage. I've done this again for the Woody yeah. here. And I think Woody cannot go back. Everyone come for Fudi. Yep. Adonis, really the core of Colors mm, team. Nasty giant, it's just like uh, getting XP in the jungle. Stay in the trees. Hiding the trees, don't. Don't go out. Here comes Mobi. Yep. Can Already make level some six. progress. However, Axila is just too low. Yes. And cost ten Yasuki already level six. Yeah, it's similar to last game. Like uh, Kazakhstan is making huge progress in the laning phase. And we'll see. Come to the mid lane to have two fancy one. Uh, the three, three versus and one. And the force also come. A nice down for two fancy one. Kill the dreamy. That will be a revenge for the last game. It's only one kill. Don't say that too early. <laughs> And Adonis is Adonis like a uh, Get a Woody already level 8 Adonis. Yeah. Maybe we will see the, the first, like, uh, third game in, the, in today's best of three games. And we can see Kazakhstan mm, already built the uh, 3k gold lead in the early stage. But as we say, the potential for Nepal's lineup is better than Kazakhstan. So, push it in line. Mm -hmm. You can see, two fancy Wong is uh, not far behind, while Dreamy is only like 500 gold, like lead. What her? What is in the Guido? Mm -hmm. All 55 gold. Yeah. And Oxy can't uh, make it out, but Guido is here. Guido, and can he Guido make not to get back a little bit? Oh, oh Guido is down. That yeah. was a huge loss for Nepal. Yeah. Because Adonis is still forming in the top of the lane. Mm -hmm. 
And uh, I think Adon, Adon is already built the the Lich item. Mm -hmm. So he can farm fight in the jungle. Oh my god, it's very large burst damage for two fancy one to take down. To me. Three K gold lead for Kazastian. The dream is going back to the land again, I think. Uh, he does not have to go back to land, maybe he should go to a little bit, but uh, so 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 it's hard to yank. Yeah, we do not have so any stars. Woody. Woody is down again. Adon is chasing Woody. Yeah, looking and he's down again. So can he get? Mm -hmm. Let's get oh, another that's one for one. One for one trade. I think. Uh, and Nepal uh, drifting is really lack of magic damage in the early phase of the game. Yep. And uh, mm. Dreamy got the speed essence. And uh, well, this be uh, a two kill fancy for one. two fancy one. Okay, that's good. And the enforcer is coming out. So the Kazas then get uh, eight kills lead. The goal, the net worth is uh, very close, and the no tower is taken down by Kazas then. So the Nepal's carrier can have a very very large map to free from. Yeah, we can see Guido is uh, very farmy in the jungle. And yeah, Guido is even one k lead. Uh, Adonis. Yeah, and uh, let's wait what uh, they will do later in the game. And Xiao uh, Chao have not built the uh, the the blink deck. Uh, the blink yeah, the Guido here. blink out for Kostaniski. Yep. And uh, Dreamy is already one one level bef like above the uh, two fancy one. Yes, oh, he's rarely. keep farming. Yep. And Nepal just need to farm and wait for the end of the game when the carrier getting enough items. And the Guido take down tower very easily. And the first turret attack with eleven breaks the issue. But uh, Woody died too many times uh, in the early phase. Yeah. Uh, He's taken down by the Adonis. Uh, that's not the case. He died a lot uh, in the last game as well. Mm -hmm. So he's still in the game. Since uh, Kazakh can focus on Adonis land. Yeah. And uh, again, Woody died in front of the boss point. I think uh, Adonis is just uh, solo from the top lane. And uh, he will get the item that uh, he needs to. But Guido is farming faster than her, that is Puyan. Yeah. If you don't harass Puyan, he can farm really quickly. Yeah, that's true. And Oxygen is doing a lot of damage. And the Swiss is back. But uh, he makes the skill. And, and two fans will come. And our chance damage is yeah. really high. Yeah, three heal comes. There's no way my win the king escape. Yeah. But the net was yes, even now. Yeah, Guido wanna push the top lane as well. Guido come too fast in this game. Yeah, and when they still got uh, only one item, I think. So some item to okay. Nice ulti for Puyan, and, and he get it uh, in force. We uh, get it in force, but uh, get killed. Yeah, only but here. I don't think Woody can run away from the situation. Adonis get Woody again. Yeah. Uh, setting, setting versus four. But Dreamy, another solo kill in the middle, mid in mid lane. I think it's really hard for Kazakhstan. Kazakhstan kill many heroes, but uh, they did not push any tower. Uh, can Dreamy make it out? I think he does not have any stun, uh, stun skills. Yeah. 
they need to push tower congested. Uh, but their carry have not found enough items right now. Adonis again get woody. Mm -hmm. get back into trees. And uh, would he need to retreat so maybe to their own jungle farm uh, a little ten, bit? Yes, because 10 is key behind the Adonis, but it was seen, uh, but it was see, seen by the woods. Mm -hmm. And uh, we can see, although Kazakhstan make 11 head behind, like a buff lead, uh, Nepal still got a good lead. Which is very Nepal rare. Nepal getting in front of the boss hill. Mm -hmm. They are getting, but the Kazakhstan want a team fight yep. around the boss point. The boss pit. But uh, with Nepal will get to the high ground. And the Puhe is just pushing the bottom tower, and will Kazakhstan retreat? And, and there's that another pause. We can see it's already 12 minutes and uh, uh, although Nepal uh, does not have good team fight, they still manage to push down several towers yeah. so they can build some lead in the gold. Because they need to push tower, yeah. otherwise their kill, uh, killing is meaningless because uh, the, the heroes of the Nepal will still have zone to farm it. I think that uh, I think Guan Feng need to build the uh, spear that uh, can be magic in new. Yeah, he blinks in mm -hmm. and uh, get everyone he wanna kill. Mm -hmm. But uh, Nepal, they are play very smartly right now. They let Pu Yuan solo push and get all the gold that he need. Well, we are still waiting for the game restart. Yeah. And uh, do you think uh, Wei Yan perform uh, very good this game? Oh yeah. yeah, it got That's seven kills. Yeah. I think uh, that. Uh, also because of he is just behind the Adonis. Yeah, and, and uh, also two fancy one is like uh, doing better in this game with Xiao Chao right mm -hmm. now. But uh, they really need to push some tower or yeah. get to uh, get to control of the boss. Yeah. The, okay. So uh, team uh, is come again, Dong Guo Jia. And we can see Marin Lu already take down mm. the enemy and the. She to take down the. Mm, it's Adonis a little bit get messy. Woody again. Yeah, but Adonis can he make it out? Okay, he can. And Kazakhstan is farming the enemy's boss pit, and the Greedo is already on the high ground, and the Wiz is back. Mm, same as last game, I think. Jimmy still farming in the midland. Mm -hmm. And the uh, true fancy one and dreamy use the illusion to juke him. Someone point the boss hill of the Kazakhstan side. Yeah, I think uh, they should farm the. Uh, I think uh, Kazakhstan should farm their own boss as well to build some advantage so yeah. that they can pull. Mm -hmm. And they need to organize some push. <laughs> Uh, true. And let's see what uh, Greedo will perform in Greedo this team fight. Already level 70. Yeah, he's not afraid of uh, Adonis. What is this TP down? Yeah. Who do you wanna build a very big team fight right here? But uh, the heroes are not here. Snow Bay. Mm hmm. Let's get him behind. Yep. Woody, they have seen Weiss and uh, Adonis here. Yeah. And uh, they wanna 
feel the woods. Yeah, just push the tower. Just push the tower. And the Adonis is like <laughs> getting everyone here, and the uh, Woody outed, but it makes no sense. Nice play for Kazaz 10. Yeah, now they have a chance to push the tower. Mm, but meanwhile, Dreaming just uh, pushing the tire to tower in the middle lane. Yep. Okay, but... Uh, Comes two fancy one. Dreaming is close not fast. Oh, and the uh, Oxy is on. Damage is not out. enough. Yeah, Dreamy. And, and Oxy is on. But that Adonis is here. Trying to But uh, can fight? he get two? Adonis? No. Adonis? Critic. Okay. Oh, enough critic attack here. Mm -hmm. Down is already level 18. Yeah, he make nine kills in this game, and uh, it's uh, like nearly for him to finish building some big items. And uh, we can see right now for Nepal, they need to come up with some idea, uh, not about how to build a team fight about how to evade the team fight right now yes they need to use the land to evade the team fight mm -hmm. and uh, find some choice yep. to make solo kill yeah. okay. and the way slay their own boss now they have two boss item on mm -hmm. adonis mm -hmm. and uh, i think adonis is the very uh, beefy right now. However, you can see Credo is 1k uh, above him. Still got a 1k gold lead. And uh, Ma Wing Lu is farming a little bit faster right now. Yeah, streaming already 15 gold, 15k gold. Yeah. And the network difference is even on both sides. And uh, they jump in, uh, easily killed by Adonis. I think uh, he can just push the bottom tower very easy. Okay, a uh, free tower for uh, Kazakhstan. And the wild Grido is pushing the top tower. Uh, Wei Yan comes back and the Kazakhstan is pushing the second tower right now. And can they make it? Oh, someone tipping and uh, got uh, vanished immediately. Not a nice choice for Snowby. And uh, now they are pushing the high ground. Kazakhstan trying to push the high ground. Yeah, Nepal. Uh. I think Nepal. They are playing smart in this match. They are trading towers. But uh, how can they defend their own tower? Dreaming. Dreaming jumps in. And uh, that's not a really good choice, actually. Yes, Dreaming. Sun Shangxiang really powerful on their okay. own high ground. And uh, so is Ma Wing Lu. And uh, they make two kills and pull. Oh, and nice and signature Udi. of Woody. And uh, another, another pass? pass? <laughs> uh, th that is a crucial yeah. team fight of this game, and yeah. uh, Nepal already done it since they have Ma Yun and Sun Shangxiang on their own high ground and make damage to the Kazakhstan's heroes. So you think this team fight is gonna be Nepal swing? Yeah, yeah. they have already, uh, I think, uh, slayed down um, Adonis. And uh, I think Chu Fancy One is still on ground. Uh, mm -hmm. And they need to get him as well. Yep. Mm -hmm. Since Adonis use Guan Feng and uh, mm -hmm. Guan Feng is a really powerful heal to kill on the hills, but it's very hard to push high ground tower. Yep. Uh, since uh, in the Nepal side, yep. Ma Yunlu and uh, Sun Shangxiang can easily stand behind the high ground tower and uh, make damage to Guan Feng. Yeah, I agree so. So, if they want to push the high ground tower of the Nepal, they really need to, to slay uh, the, the demon 
yeah. uh, the fire demon boss was mm -hmm. to get the agents. And I think uh, they have to get Sun Jian first. Uh, and come uh, back. And uh, Adonis is it's not uh, done. Yeah, he. Uh, what? He Adonis get everyone under the high ground of Nepal. Oh my god. Uh, and it's a uh, free tower for her. Uh, for him, I think. And Noxy Jane. Can, can he chase her? Can he chase her? Trying to chase uh, Adonis, Adonis come uh, back with a critical attack, but can't uh, get But uh, Guido gets her. Yes, Guido was responsible from the fountain. Yep. And, and now uh, Guido gets both items on the key ring arms. We can see Adonis gets uh, like 3k gold in this team fight. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now he's like, we can see the boss has respawned. And the uh, dreamy really needs some come up some items that is like uh, I mean useful. But uh, out of the high ground, uh, the hero of Nepal is uh, really fragile in front of Guanfu. Uh, Kazakhstan, they notice that the enemy heroes are farming the Adonis company. Uh, they are coming, and uh, the they get boss? the boss is very low. And uh, then let's play for Adonis. Way slay the boss, and uh, Adonis gets the uh, boss item. Mm, I think it will be a GG call for uh, Nepal. In Nepal this should uh, let Puyuan help them to stay this boss. Puyuan is farming in their own jungle, yep. and they lack of a little damage to stay that boss. Yep. Uh, do you think uh, Guido still have a chance to contest Adonis? Yeah, because Adonis here is uh, hard to get him to the high ground and push the buildings. Mm -hmm. uh, he still needs the ages. Yep. Dreamy pushing land. But uh, I think uh, Dreamy can do really little like impact in this game. So and found the way here. Have a lot of damage, but uh, mm. he's in instantly vanished by Adonis. And the Guido is here. And Too the fancy one. Yeah. Can they do some important moves here? Uh, we can see the network difference. Like Kazakhstan is already built uh, uh, about 7k lead right now. Let's most uh, Adonis. Mm -hmm. and they want to dream for the Adonis, but uh, he is too fragile in front of Grand Four. And the dream is still like mm -hmm. even no teammates can help him. And the way and get the last kill. And the Guido is still farming. What, what? is he doing? And uh, he's Guido down. Guido just uh, farming too much in this game. And uh, I think they can easily push the mid tower, they jump in and they instantly kill Ma Lu. That uh, will be a nice chance for Kazakhstan to push mid and, and uh, high, high ground. ground. Another nice initiate for to Fancy Wong. And the dreaming make it and Guido Almost make a good out but uh, they cannot uh, make a lot of damage Woody is jumping back and the enforcer is chasing oh Adonis with his edge yeah critic yeah, get uh, they just Guido. use a dagger to get a Guido yes Adonis so outstanding in this game yep and uh, Guido just farmed too much and uh, missed his best. But so we can see Dreamy is making a comeback here. But Adonis is uh, in Adonis the. Adonis, can he get him? Yes, Dreamy is down. Another oh critical. God. Oh my god, the Adonis. is too high for her. Guido. Don't, don't look at him. Don't look at him, Guido. Yep. Waiting for your teammates. To come back. Yeah. And I think that will be the end for this game.
And Antonius there's a hex, a hex and he uh, get him? but uh, he's got the Aegis, oh, I think. Only one hit. He got the Aegis? Yeah. He's well, like back with full health and... Jimmy, uh, still two. Yes. What? Jimmy and uh, Zoom make a large damage oh. to Adonis. Yes. Ma Yunlu and uh, Sun Shangxiang. Yeah. If Adonis cannot... Uh, uh, get in, in the deep of the Nepal's team. Yeah. Uh, if he cannot find the Ma Yunlu and the Sun Shangxiang, their damage can still kill Adonis. I think uh, they still have a chance to contest things. But out of the high ground, uh, it is much easier for Adonis to find the two ADC of the Nepal. Yep. Can we make it out? Okay. Mm -hmm. We and uh, Oxygen is doing a lot yeah. of damage, but uh, that's he's down. not a good place to begin a team fight. Yep, can can anyone uh, make a comeback? Woody Woody jumps in. Woody is controlled. Adonis is very low. Adonis waiting waiting for yeah waiting chance. for a chance to get but in. But only see us port here. Yep. He, he must find Ma Yun or Sun Shang Xiang. Yep. And then he's still uh, waiting, he get a griddle. Yeah, they are just retreating. Uh, she wanna test if she's lucky enough to instantly kill her, him. Mm. Uh, we can see... The boss is with Ben. Mm -hmm. Adonis is in like uh, 24 kills, which is very high for her. Kazastin uh, needs to stay the boss and get another Aegis for Adonis. Yeah, but uh, that's gonna be three more bosses, I think. Yeah. So. And the man is already pushing to the base yep. of the Nepal. And uh, do you think uh, Nepal have a chance to come back? They need to defend their high grounds. Yeah, out and the wood is out of the base. Out of the high grounds, Adonis has too much space. And the oxygen is catched, and the two fancy one use all the skills. And two KLC for oxygen. Oxygen. And uh, Kazakhstan already make 50 kills. They can end the game by killing six yeah. enemy heroes. That's easy for Adonis. <laughs> And uh, I think uh, Nepal should notice this as well. They cannot die easily outside, Prim otherwise they will lose. They must stand in their own high ground. Yep. Their vision was too dark. Mm. Katsas then organize another push. Rudy and the Grado get stunned. Yeah. Adonis is still waiting for chance. Yeah, I think uh, Kazakhstan, they are waiting uh, for someone to come down the high ground. Uh, I think uh, there should be Woody. But uh, where is Woody? <laughs> Woody is in the bottom lane to seek a chance to get to the back of the enemy heroes. Or oh, is she farming some crucial items? The top lane, mm -hmm. mine is going. And uh, they still got the uh, bottom barracks, and that should be the last barrack. And the enforcer jumps in, and Grido, Grido is very low, and uh, he just got zone. And the Oxyzone is okay. Woody nice jumps super back super. and uh, Dreamy. Can Dreamy do enough damage? Okay, he's hexed. Adon is, is down. Okay, so do Enforcer. But uh, I two think there's only one hero on the high ground. Yeah, 251 is still alive. He can make a lot and of damage. And uh, someone put it back, I think. Woody. And the other hero need to retreat. They need to waiting for the Adonis to respond from the fountain. Yep. Mm. 
already 54 kills for Kazakhstan. They only need uh, six more kills. Yeah, Kazakhstan, they, they, they need to notice that if you got 60 kills, you win the game. Let me pause team. Yeah. Already under the ground. Mm -hmm. Will that be a chance for Kazakhstan? Adonis in the river? And then Nepal, they're fighting for their last chance to see if there are any lonely hero on the battleground. But uh, I think Adonis is like undefeated. Mm -hmm. Pushing the bottom lane. Mm -hmm. Do you think Puyang will build the uh, divine? Even if he build with a divine, Repair. Uh, I don't think he has enough stun to kill Adonis out of the uh, high ground. Yeah, I, I think so. Do they need, uh, Nepal need to find Adonis firstly. Mm -hmm. Another great initiation for and Kazakhstan. The they is up really low. And uh, so this Dreamy and still Dreamy making oh my a God. lot of damage. Dreamy do a lot of damage. And uh, is Adonis down? Yeah, he's down. Uh, so so I think Nepal under, uh, Kazakhstan underestimate yeah. the Dreamy's uh, damage. It's really high for her. They, the Nepal have so many AD carries, so on their own high ground, it's hard for Kazakhstan to make a good initiation. Yeah, and... Uh, but uh, they still get two heals killed, so that makes them four heals away from their victory. Yeah, I think uh, Adonis just need to focus on the enemy, enemy support to get a win. I think it's nearly like a victory for Kazakhstan, right? We are barely win this game. Yeah, I think uh, Dreamy is very is this? risky move here. On and the Dreamy. Grido, okay, so the Hex and Grido mm. is down. And the Adonis is here and the Grid. Okay, there 58 are too kills. much space for Adonis out of the high ground. Two more kills for Just need Kazakhstan. two more heals. Yeah, to win the game. Two fancy uh, one. Oxygen's it's very Force. risky move for her. Nice info. And, uh, and they two fancy one. One more kill. They are waiting. They're they are pushing. waiting. To fancy will push the base tower. I think Adonis just need to uh, dagger one hero, and uh, that will be the end of the game. A killing arm on the ground. Nobody want to pick it. Yeah, that's a level one boss item, and Dreamy pick it. Adonis waiting for Enforcer. That's initiative. Okay. Can he get it? Oh my what god, a nice Yotif from Woody. Okay, but still uh, get one kill for Adonis to win the game. Oh, that was a really tense game. 13 minutes and uh, get uh, uh, 30 kills mm -hmm. to win. Yep, uh, and I think uh, they make really good decisions, like in the early phase Nip. for yeah. Kasas 10. And then the Nepal, they are drifting, is too greedy. Yeah. A lack of magic damage in the early phase. They have Pu Yuan, Ma Yun Lu, and uh, Sun Shang Xiang. Uh, we can see that in the late game, they do some. Uh, um, they can defend their high tower. Yeah, however, it's too late. So, like, they already have a lot of. Um, 50 kills. Yeah, of kills behind so that uh, they cannot make it. Uh, still very tense game. Yep. And uh, that uh, will be the first game come to the... Uh, like uh, best of three. Last game of best of three. Like game three. Yeah. It's like the first one that's getting the game three. Like in today's best of three series. And uh, we are expecting one 
very、um, uh, very beautiful team fight in the last game.、Uh, since both teams they are a little bit afraid of like、uh, doing the initiation,、mm-hmm. especially for Kazakhstan. Like they know they are winning, but、uh, they don't know like when is the、uh, right time to do the attack, invade the enemy. They need to push tower earlier in the game. Yeah. To restrain the farming zone of the Nepal.、Mm-hmm. You can see Puyuan、oh, get farm so much、uh, in this game. Yep. But、uh, I think、uh, sometimes he Guido just、uh, get farming too much.、Mm-hmm. Uh, he needed to get in with his teammates in the、uh, mid mid phase and the end phase of the game.、Yeah. Mm. All right, we are coming up with the highlights here and、uh, see you soon. Come back, and、uh, we gonna see a game three between Kazakhstan versus Nepal. And、uh, we can see in the last game,、uh, uh, Kazakhstan's Adonis is doing very great in both the、uh, mm-hmm. landing phase and、uh, uh, and in the late game.、Mm-hmm. And、uh, he make a lot of kills in in the team fight. And、uh, he farm really fast.、Mm-hmm. Although the Nipples, uh, Nipples, uh, Guido, uh, he farm a lot, and he even got like mostly time. He、mm-hmm. got the gold, like above the、uh, Adonis. However,、uh, I mean Pu Yuan cannot contest uh, uh, Guan Feng very well in the team fight. Yes. Once Guan Feng is like blinking into Pu Yuan. Uh, like uh, he can barely make any movements, and、uh, die instantly. 
Yes, I think uh, uh, Puyan should help uh, his teammate to slay uh, the demon boss. Uh, once he gets the agents, maybe he can have the counter attack to Guan Feng yep. in the game. Yep. And uh, Adonis is really a marvelous player in the best of the three games. Yep. Uh, the Kazakhstan use a very precision strategic to for protected one, yep. and uh, Adonis is truly their real coro in the team. Yeah, and uh, I think like uh, uh, for the first, the third game for Kazakhstan, their drafting phase, they should focus on building around the. Uh, Atonis, since uh, he's very talented player, mm -hmm. yeah. So just pick the hero that can make enough damage and make enough space for him to farm. Mm -hmm. However, for Nepal, I think that their strategy in the first game is wrong. Like they pick too many carry heroes right mm -hmm. now, and uh, you can see Ma Lu barely did anything in the uh, start of the game. And uh, although they fight back one or two waves in the end game, uh, okay, we can see the there's a statistic here. And the sixty kills, just ten. Yeah, and they got uh, eighty nine assists. We can see at the end they just uh, gathering around together as five mm. and uh, push the enemy. You can see the damage. It's uh, really close since uh, uh, Nepal has uh, so many ADC in the later game. Yep, and we can also see like uh, Nepal put down the enemy tower uh, for five towers, I think. Yep. Yeah, most uh, mm -hmm. pushed down by Puyuan. Yeah, Greedy. Uh, Greedo. I mean, Greedo is very talented player. He has very bad understanding the and uh, the enemy creep waves mm -hmm. yeah so like when enemy is attacking and we can see the mvp here surely adonis adonis uh, who else can be yeah guan feng and uh, i remember uh, there's one team fight uh she just threw out the dagger and uh, mm. Puyan died instantly yeah. 27 kills and uh, 171 percent go to damage ratio yeah because Horrible. these heroes out can like do critical damage a lot that's mm, mm, still a really horrible ratio yeah and uh, i think for the third game uh, nipple just need to stay calm mm. and uh, mm -hmm pick better, uh, do better in the drafting phase mm -hmm. and uh, for Hasak Kazakhstan they have to uh, just uh, do what they did in the second uh, drafting phase building around the team, around uh, Adonis yes, building around Adonis and for Nepal I think uh, they should uh, uh, choose some normal mid hero for Dreamy yep. you know, because Sun Shangxiang like there is a lacking of uh, magic damage in the early phase and the dreaming only the only thing dreaming can do is keep farming in the Midland and the jungle yep. and uh, they really need the dreaming stand out in the early phase to restrain Adonis uh, mm -hmm. like uh, use Xiao Chao and uh, build uh, hex stuff and uh, blink dagger yep. and <coughs> so we are waiting for the third game and uh, yeah, this uh, so Kazakhstan's uh, pick is very like surprisingly like they firstly pick uh, Diao Chan and the second one they pick Guan Feng as their carry and uh, I think uh, Guan Feng can maybe appear more in the tournaments and maybe in the Asian games since it's very easy to use and uh, uh, like uh, very powerful in the late game. Mm -hmm. And uh, we are still waiting for the third game to come up. They need to choose a uh, really distinguished hero for Adonis, like Dio Chan can make uh, damage and the crowd can't chew. Yeah. Or, or Guan Feng. 
mm-hmm. and really make a uh, critical damage and uh, make a uh, solo kills. Yep. Mm-hmm. So Huang Yuein and uh, Pu Yuan, I think, will not be a good choice for Adonis. Because uh, this hero is much more focused on the team fights, mm-hmm. but uh, not uh, uh, personal skills. Maybe they should try pick Huato, since like no one pick and no one banned. Pick Huato to protect uh, Adonis in the team fights. Yeah, I agree. So. And uh, yeah. Maybe we can like uh, review some of the previous games, and uh, so you think uh, which best of three is your favorite one in the uh, in today's match? Uh, expect the Kazakhstan vs Nepal the last one. So which other you think is the best one? I think uh, uh, that should be the Thailand game. Mm-hmm. Maybe Thailand uh, versus Philippines. Yeah, I think, uh, but uh, that's like a too much skill lead for yeah. Thailand versus Philippines. Uh, that was a pity that uh, Thailand and China is not in the same group. Yeah, we cannot see the matchup between these two teams. <coughs> and, uh, yep. So. So, what do you think about the Naples last pick, Sun Shuangxiang for Dreamy? Mm. You shouldn't give Dreamy an ADC like hero. Mm-hmm. Just give him a comma meta hero yep. uh, to gank in the early phase. Yep. Maybe they could uh, pick Xiao Qiao in their first or uh, second pick yep. on Nepal. Uh, I think uh, Sun Shangxiang cannot play as a mid hero actually, since his skill does not do a lot of like uh, does not make sense to um, do a solo kill in the mid. However, it's very good for uh, Sun Shangxiang to uh, stay in the bottom lane or the top lane as a Kenneth point or or off lane hero. Yeah, mm-hmm. he and other hero can easily do like uh, a kill, like in the lane, laning phase. Mm-hmm. <coughs> and the two fancy one also shows the highest, the higher skill of Xiao Qiao in the last game. Yep. Uh, so I think uh, Xiao Qiao, Xiao Qiao will be the crucial point of the drifting in the game three. So, what other hero do you expect to appear, like uh, in the in the tournament? In the tournament, yeah. Uh, I think maybe Tai Shi Zi. Okay. As a carry hero, very powerful. And uh, I still want to see. Him. Uh, I still want to see him more support hero. Because uh, usually the team will choose Gu Yong and uh, Guo Jia or Sun Quan as their support. Yeah. And also, um, I want to see Dong Zhuo on the, on the tournament. Mm-hmm. Since he's a very powerful hero and uh, he can, he's very skill based. I, I doubt so which one will pick Dong Zhuo as their like, uh, tanky hero, offline mm-hmm. hero. Mm-hmm. Uh, we are still waiting for the third game to start. Let's be a little bit patient here.
so for the first day who is gonna be the one of the best player uh, of the day you think is Thailand's uh, Kao or other other players or mm. China or like uh, other players maybe Kao of Thailand or Xiao Hao of China yeah because we haven't seen many games of China yeah. in the first day and I think uh, Kao did very good performance in the first day yeah but uh, I think they finish all their games so maybe we'll see him in the Asian game mm -hmm. <coughs> So you think Xiao Chao is a good mid hero, like right now in this patch? Mm -hmm. In this best of three game, because Dreamy and uh, Two Fancy Wong are both good uh, Xiao Chao player. Yeah, and uh, although Two Fancy Wong are just like uh, doing some following up damage, but uh, his uh, his skill is good enough to like uh, play this hero. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so we are still waiting for the third game to start. So what you think about Dreams <laughs> What you think about Dreams 3 Kingdom? You think it's a fun game or like uh, what you think is the difference between other mobile games? I think uh, it's a very fast rhythm for happy. Yeah. Uh, you know the heroes <laughs> get a response quickly from the fountain. Yeah. And uh, you can al almost uh, the both team are almost uh, team fights everywhere on the map since the landing phase has end. Okay, so we'll be back soon. See you later. Guanbi Wai the Zayin, Zhao Jun, Nation the Zizo, Audi Q4 Yichuan, Rang Zhen the Gan Show, Song Kai Shi, Tsai Kai Shi.
太了，困了，喝东鹏特饮。关闭外来的杂音，找准内心的节奏。奥迪 Q 四一创，让真的感受从开始才开始。累了困了，喝东鹏特饮。All right, welcome back, and、uh, we're gonna they're gonna be red top coming up the game three of the best of three between Kazakhstan versus Nepal. And、uh, right now we can see players already in the bookend and are ready to start. <coughs> can I see Kazakhstan sports player?、Mm -hmm. <coughs> I think what really shines on Kazakhstan is the their carry hero, ah,、uh, their、mm -hmm. carry player. Yes, really pop player. Mm -hmm. Paul mm -hmm. is com he's communicating with their coach.、Mm -hmm. <coughs> I hope that they will make a better drafting in the game three. Yep, and.、Uh, And、uh, pick a much stronger hero for Dreamy. Yep. And、uh, <coughs> I think for Nepal,、uh, they need to like uh, uh, building around the、uh <coughs> building around the maybe.、Uh, let me see. Maybe building around Dreamy. Since he's very active in the landing phase, and、uh, while he's、uh, while he's beefy, he can do a lot of things、mm -hmm. in the uh, in、mm -hmm. the team fight. Yes,、mm, and、uh, Jimmy should、uh, help Woody in his land in、mm -hmm. the early phase of the game because there will always be three or four heroes、mm -hmm. uh, in the Woody's land trying to kill him.、Mm -hmm. We can see the players already hand on their headshot. Yeah. And waiting for the drifting phase to start. Okay, here's coming the dropping phase, and we can see、uh, on one side it's Kazakhstan, and on the west side it's Nepal. Turn from Nepal to ban their first two heroes.、Mm -hmm. And、uh, I think、well、I think they should ban the carry player. Yeah, they just ban every carry、mm. in the game, and、Adonis. that would be an easy win for them. They need to restrain Adonis in the game. Yeah.、Mm. And、uh, they're thinking sorry,、mm. so they ban the Dream Yuanshao first. Just Diao Chan, just ban Diao Chan. Yeah, maybe Diao Chan or I don't think、uh, they should ban any other heroes actually. 
focus on the carry hero here. Yeah, but you can see like uh, Kazakhstan does not uh, um, pick very usual. Okay, so they banned the l last hero. Uh, yeah, they banned the Guan Feng, but uh, I don't think. Uh, they will pick Guan Feng Since at this phase. They ban Guan Feng. I think uh, they should ban uh, Diao Chan. Diao Chan or uh, Huang Yuying? Uh, Huang Yuying is not that like Guan Feng or Diao Chan can make a one versus five team fights. Yep. Just Diao Chan and uh, Guan Feng. Very slow. And. Uh, Mm, so on the Kazakhstan side, they ban Sun Wuban and Xiao Qiao. Yeah, and they ban Shui Chu. Shui Chu is very active in the last game. So for Kazakhstan, they can still pick Diao Chan for Atonis. Mm -hmm. I think they're okay. Yes, so here they comes pick Diao Chan first. Uh, yeah, Nepal should really ban Diao Chan in their third bit. Mm -hmm. And Nepal pick Liu Biao in their first pick. Oh, since uh, the uh, Xiao Qiao is out of the hero pool, <laughs> I think Nippo maybe could uh, choose um, Luo Li for and Dreamy. The Dreamy pick uh, on Nippo side, they pick uh, Zhang Hong, which is not a uh, usual pick. Ma Yi. Yeah. We have seen Ma Yi yeah. in today's game, mm -hmm. but uh, that uh, is much more like a counter pick uh, to some tanky hero. Yep. Uh, Ma Yi and Wei Yan from Kazakhstan. Mm -hmm. Maybe they can pick uh, Ma Yi to healing Antonius in the team fight. Yeah. And the uh, Smai is very good against the uh, tanky heroes. So Nippo put uh, Huang Yuying. Uh, that's a normal carry hero choice. Mm -hmm. And let's see the second band phase for both team. Really was banned by Nippo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but uh, and the Josh is banned. Nippo still needs uh, Meta Herald himself. Yep. And uh, I think uh, they should pick one hero with very high burst damage uh, for Kazakhstan. <laughs> and they ban Yu Ji for their last pick. They think they will pick one more uh, carry hero. I don't understand why you put Ban Yu Ji. Maybe they think uh, uh, one fancy two can play Yu Ji in the mid. Yeah. I think it does not matter <laughs> since they have already seen Diao Chan. Let's see what's the last pick for Kazakhstan. Guojia, but they ban Joshua and Guojia is supposed to him. Turn for Nepo to pick. Uh, I think they should pick this hero for Dreamy. Mm -hmm. Like uh, Luo Li to restrain Diao Chan yep. in the team fights. Mm -hmm. Let's see what will Nepo chose. So we can see they pick Huang Gai, which is like a very common ban in the uh, common pick. No, like it banned a lot mm -hmm. in the banning phase. A yeah, very tanky hero. Yeah, it does not show up. So, so the Kazakhstan pick Cao Zhi and uh, Zhou Tai. Yeah. Zhou Tai is another common hero in this game. Mm -hmm. Last pick Wu Yong. So they will have uh, Zhang Hong as mid hill yep. for Jimmy. And uh, 
uh, Dreamy is playing Zhang Hong mm. and the let's see two five one plays Ma Yi as a mid hero. Mm -hmm. And uh, like which side you think gonna like uh, build up advantage in the early stage? Well, I think Zhang Hong is uh, not a uh, very good hero to restrain Diao Chan in the team fights. Yep. Uh, Zhang Hong is a good hitter to counter Sima Yi, but yep. uh, he has this uh, very little thing to do with Diao Chan's out. So I think uh, maybe Adonis will rule this game again. Yep. And I think uh, <coughs> Zhou Tai is a very powerful hero in the landing phase. Here come to the last game of this best of games, episode 3 and the last game today. Mm -hmm. Kazakhstan versus Nepal. Kazakhstan on which side and Nepal on which side? side. And, uh, let's go back to uh, our topic before. I think Zhou Tai is a very good pick for Kazakhstan, since uh, Nepal they all they have like uh, one or two hero that are physical damage, mm -hmm. and uh, Zhou Tai can counter the physical. Uh, carry very well. But uh, Zhou Tai cannot counter the Diao Chan when he uses his ult. Yeah, but uh, Zhou Tai is on Kazakhstan side. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes, on Kazakhstan side. So he can, Zhou Tai can blink in and taunt the enemy hero, mm -hmm. and then Diao Chan jumps in and out. Let's see the landing phase. Mm -hmm. I say invisibility essence in the river. And the Woody always get killed in the landing phase by three or four kills of Kazaste. Yeah. Will he play back in this game? And the uh, Adonis is still farming in land. And uh, we can see Dio Chen is hard to farm in jungle maybe. With me. And the uh, two first wall in the mid lane. Yep. Nice deny for dreaming. And then and another the bomb. This one is just using right click. Okay, get it. Dreaming. Mm -hmm. And the uh, oh, Woody is very low. Again, three hills come to and get a Woody. Yep. And Protect uh, Adonis <laughs> very carefully. Yep. The Woody didn't. Uh, Woody doesn't die this time. Yeah. It's a recovery mm -hmm. under the tower. And waiting for the creeps. Yep. Getting to the tower. Mm -hmm. Adonis. And around the tower. Woody, no, Woody jumps in. I wanna grab Adonis uh. back, but Adonis still have the uh, blink skill as well. And then process with uh -huh. already come to the middle line. Yep. Try and to get Jimmy. There are three heroes in the mid. But the West gets attacked by the tower. And you can still get the Jimmy. Get the first block. At the left first block. Grace the issue. That was a very interesting choice for Adonis to try the uh, wish to get a level 3 at the very first start of the game yep. so he can uh, restrain the Woody's land yep. with his teammates mm -hmm. and make uh, enough advantage in the landing phase. Uh, and the Woody is done Adonis, but Adonis is doing a lot of damage. And they have to retreat all stunned again. This time Woody is <laughs> not that he will get killed by by Adonis every time when he appear on land. Yep. Woody. Very confident in this time. And uh, it stuns three times and Adonis used the blink to get back to a safer point. He's hit by the tower, and uh, yeah, he's re really nearly mm. down. Ways uh, try to help up Donis here. Mm -hmm. Adonis, Adonis is too low. Yep. And 
uh, they're just farming peacefully in the land. With this harassing Woody away. Already level 5. Mm -hmm. Contestant cannot uh, get kill, uh, so many kills in the landing phase in this game. Yep. And the uh, Wei Yan is picked 3 times by Kazastan. They really like this hero. And uh, True Fancy Wuhan is like a little bit behind the enemy hero. And uh, we can see Guido is uh, farming very well in the jungle right now. Guido is at level 6. And the Dreaming again, level 6 versus level 5. True Fancy Wuhan. And uh, we can see Adonis is like uh, still 1k behind Guido. Uh, yes, because he's on the land, not in the jungle. Yeah, I don't know why uh, he does not have the habit to like uh, farm jungle creeps. Uh, I think uh, that's their strategy design. That uh, there are, uh -huh. uh, there are three, uh, position 3 and position 4 will help Adonis again, again uh, build yeah. an advantage on the landing phase, but this time Woody used Liu Biao is much more sneaky. And the enforcer's playstyle is very like old school. Mm -hmm. Farming jungle as the uh, uh, tanky hero. Mm -hmm. With us, make a water in their own jungle and see Jimmy getting around. Mm -hmm. And uh, they barely make any uh, achievements in the landing phase. And there are three here on the top. They wanna grab uh, Wei Yan. Can they make kick. it? Can he escape? Oh. Nice broke, but still die. Yeah, and uh, during mm. the mid, then Dream is doing a lot of damage. But two fancy ones hero can really make a lot of heal. Yeah. He can make a lot of heal in a team fight. So they cannot kill him very easily. Oh, again, Adonis get a Woody use his yeah, out. This time, Woody will surely die. Yeah, and the Whisk get the kill. The Enforcer use his out to get the kill. Drew ties out is like uh, when hero is below yeah. the percentage, you can get the enemy kill instantly. Yeah. And on top, you have Huang Gai, which is a very annoying hero. Like in the land. Too tanky. Yeah, hard to kill. But uh, Sima Yi is a nice counter hero to Huang Gai. Yeah, I agree so. So, like. Here this. comes three heals again. Yeah. Too fancy one almost get a dreamy by solo kill. Yeah. So you think who does a better job in the landing phase? Mm, two fancy one make a really good landing phase, but yeah. uh, Adonis didn't kill Woody that much. Yeah, maybe He's we'll get him this time, uh, not this time. Yeah, so Adonis gold is yeah. Enforcer just jumps in and <laughs> get the easy kill here. Mm -hmm. Adonis is just a little behind the Greedo since Greedo is keeping farming in the jungle. Very low, but uh, Dreamy cannot hold. Oh, nice bomb here for Dreamy and. Uh, so on the top, Enforcer just. Uh, get, they get the air wave on the top lane. Yep. Cost tennis key. Kazastin yeah, is making a lot of problems Adonis, here. can and he escape? It out, so Woody, Woody was his E. Yeah. Uh, to get him. Adonis not a very good start in this game. He is already 2k behind the Guido. I think uh, Adonis should uh, build the good hand right and now. And uh, Nepal get uh, uh, with us in the jungle. Mm -hmm. Adonis 
two of you. And on the snowy, but uh, there are too many heroes behind us, no way. And if he's done again, no, he can win. out and use What's his up, ult. What's up, Beauty Odin? Can he kill the Greedo? Yeah, yes, he there's can, uh, enough so damage. But so he's very low, and uh, he blinked it out. And, uh, nice play for Adonis. And the Dreamy gonna get here, but. Uh, Snobby is here as well, and the enforcer controls the end hero, and uh, so does Dreamer, Dreamy. Dreamy is taunted again. As for Dreamy's game, uh, so for Dreamy's hero, mm -hmm. the Zhang Hong is not like uh, Xiao Qiao can make a lot of damage at a very short time. Uh, so the Zhang Hong is uh, when Zhang Hong make damage, the Sima Yi can heal himself and the other heals in the team fight. Yeah, and uh, right now Kazakhstan is doing a lot of progress in the laning phase. However, they have not uh, pushed any towers or uh, taking down any bosses. Yeah, and Jimmy come and uh, get uh, uh, enforcer. Okay, so Enforcer is terminated. And Nepal is focused on the bottom lane. They know that uh, Adonis is the crucial point of this game. Mm -hmm. But uh, Adonis already farmed in the jungle. And uh, Woody jumps in, but uh, they do not expect his death. We get and the uh, Enforcer is taunting me. Uh, Jimmy got stunned Jimmy. and killed. You can see the Adonis already go to the top lane going farmer. And uh, so the spawn guy here. The Wonky go behind Guido. And Adonis is here, use his ult to. But there the will be the <laughs> not no have enough damage here. But there are too many heroes here. They just follow one rule, follow oh. Adonis. And while well, in the mid, the uh, Smai is down. Dreamy. He plays really good in this match. Very aggressive. <laughs> this game still very tense. Mm -hmm. We cannot expect who gonna make the like first big team fight here. Is uh, Adonis choice? Adonis in bottom lane down. Yeah. Uh, Huang Wei, I think Huang Wei use his ult. Yeah, to take him down. And uh, there are three heroes in the bottom there, and they are doing a push here. And Nepal do their best to restrain Adonis in this game. Yeah, and, uh, Adonis is back again. And two fancy one, I think. And the uh, snob is stunned, but Adonis, Adonis uses out. out. But Not uh, so very good out here, but uh, will there be enough damage for the Nepal? No. Dreamy come, but get taunted by Zhou Tai. And A nice out from Sima Yi. And, uh, however, Woody. Woody is lonely here. Woody can he get out from here? And, and the snob is back. And A nice block. Yeah. But uh, he escape. makes his way he out. Escaped. So does Huang Gai here. Yeah, we have come. Can he say Woody? Mm -hmm. A hero. Yeah. Oh, Enforce. Enforce is down and Woody is still alive. And yeah. the Huang Gai is very tanky in the front. Yeah, we are still chasing. Two Fancy One does not have out right now, so they cannot do very. Mm, Good uh, counter to mm -hmm. Huang Gai right mm -hmm. now, and uh, they have to abandon the bottom first. Yes, tower. and uh, Adonis is almost uh, uh, three k behind uh, the grid. Not uh, good news for the Kazakhstan. Adonis want to chase Dreamy. And and Dreamy. She's got out, and oh. uh, does it make? Okay, she got it. And. Uh, Kazakhstan, they are still defending the bottom tower. Uh, and only three heroes are here. And the tower is half HP down. Nobody devours in the jungle. Mm -hmm. 
the Adonis keep farming on oh, the top of the land. We're seeing Gordit, Gordo here in force, uh, but uh, blink to the wrong side. Yeah, I think, uh, okay, so they take the first turret on the mid. Aku 11, first turret. <coughs> Two fancy ones do defense the uh, bottom tower of the heart, Kazakhstan. And, uh, I think Zhang Hong, they built the Dagon, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. which is a very powerful item, like, can do a lot of burst damage. Because he be has leveled up. Yes, he because he has a uh, skill to enhance uh, skill damage, mm -hmm. and uh, Adonis is farming the jungle while the other uh, nipple hero are waiting on the high ground. Adonis already have split item to farm. Adonis and Nagel to get no B. Uh, really good choice here. But uh, she cannot get uh, the other heroes, maybe? Since Adonis gets out, oh, here comes uh, Guido with his out. And the uh, Woody out as well. It on the wizards, but uh, the remaining teammates of Kazakhstan is already retreat. Mm -hmm. Adonis surely can bring her out to the tier 2 tower. Yep, and can they get the... No, they cannot get the quarry here. Adonis with golden hand mm -hmm. has a really quick farmer speed. Yep. And uh, we can see two fancy one. Are false? Get a dream here. Yeah, we can see two fancy one is building some armors here. And there's no B. And we cannot run. Yep. Adonis wants more. And no high ground, yes. We don't, Another but, nice uh, out for Adonis. Three people, three heroes uh, in his out. He wants uh, to get an air wave. Air wave, not any tanky. But uh, Woody, can he make it out? No. Really good, great play for Adonis. Yep. Why don't you bend your chair? Just bend your chair. And uh, I think it's a team wide for the post. Now Kazakhstan get an impulse boss. Yes, not be good to grab the boss. Mm, no, he has not enough damage. Yeah. Here comes Guido, but he only see the boss body. So it's only a 5k lead for Kazakhstan. Oh, really? Courage for Adonis to TP in the middle of the river. Mm -hmm. And. Uh, what do you think uh, Nepal should uh, try at this phase? Uh, I'm not quite sure. Maybe use seal item to counter the Adonis out. I think uh, Airwave and the Guido should uh, split push the lands. Oh, oh Adonis! It's uh, solo killed by Dreamy. Not a very smart move when it lost uh, his boss item, Kirin. Also, arm. on the top lane, Guido and uh, Two face one, they face each other. And there are three heroes in the bottom. The four heroes, actually. They wanna take down the first tower. <laughs> Since Adonis loses Kirin, mm -hmm. And they got. Uh, and Adonis is here again. And they got. A Dreamy. nice sword here. And they got both heroes down. Three heroes and Adonis out. Yep. Oh, everyone will die in this push. Oh, Adonis again. Adonis make it out and get the enemy hero as well. Triple kill for Adonis. A very good move for him. Oh, you should bend your turn. You really should bend your turn. And Enforcer jumps in, but uh, not. Uh, Too fancy one. Yeah. Find a Grado. Yeah. Just but under the entire uh, one tower in the middle line. But so the many people. Jumps back and uh, grab. Too fancy one. Three people TP down. Yeah. Tired one tower in the middle line. Once, uh, once uh. Adonis have no out, they can. Kazakhstan uh, need to wait. They need to wait for uh, Adonis but, uh, out. But Adonis out Adonis is already is back uh, up. But, but uh, airway is too tanky. Yeah, she does not wanna take him down. Woody, maybe you should try Woody. Adonis need to wait for some transfer. And the. What? Why? Why is Nubius here? So deep. Mm -hmm. And Adonis 
uh, they get an air wave. <laughs> and, uh, another oh. free brick and uh, broke. Enforce try to find some chance. Mm -hmm. And they just got the uh, first mid tower as granted. And uh, they're invading the enemy agent. Enforce see the agent creeps scaring yeah. down. He knows he is <laughs> there, Greedo, but Greedo's Greedo just retreat far away. Yeah, they notice that. Enforce. Uh, Enforce is clear the face. the waves here, and uh, they should uh, push the bottom tower. Dreamy just so pushing the top layer and try to push the tower. So you think uh, who is the? Uh, do you think Enforcer perform better in this game? Do you know? Yep. Yeah. Not obvious. I mean, <laughs> I mean, he performed better in this match actually. Yep. Yeah. Like uh, he played Joe Tai and uh, he played very aggressively and uh, doing a lot for their team. Uh, wave. Keep cleaning the waves. Yep. But, uh, yeah. still have no. I am waiting for the their boss to respond and uh, take it down. Mm -hmm. I think Kirin Army is still in the bottom jungle. I think it's up to time. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's down. Cause tennis ski. Mm -hmm. Get to dreamy on the top lane. Oh yeah, even the not use his out. And uh, they're just farming separately in the jungle while Kazastian they're just like farming as a team to Nepal. invade the jungle. And they can see Elway here. Yes, uh, and uh, Blink. He's this. not that tanky enough, actually. Nice out for Jotai. Mm -hmm. And the Guido jumps in with out. But the damage is not that high. Yeah, but so we can see... Adonis has here. no ult. Mm -hmm. They need and to retreat. Two, two heroes are down, and three heroes are down here. Because they need to retreat. And Adonis... And w waiting for Adonis out. Can Adonis make it out? Adonis' uh, W skill is a fresh skill. He's TP, TP back. Hair? Okay, Ooh, but they do not help? expect the TP here. <laughs> uh, really brave move for Adonis. Mm -hmm. And uh, in the mid. Cause tennis kick. Yeah, Get a dreamy again. I think now Nepal is a little confused. They do they do know what they should do. And Adonis is doing very high damage, like one out, one kill, or even two or three kills. And they can see the courier and they see where the enemy heroes are. Nepal need to organize some team fights since Adonis has already used his ult. Yep. But uh, he, the Nipples heroes is still dying and dying. Mm -hmm. They need to organize a gathering around. Yeah, and and there's the still the jungle see airwave. Airwave is very tanky. Yeah. And, and Adonis. Uh, Adonis. Just uh, let's wait. Airwave go. He has his out up right now. Uh, but uh, we can see Credo is like uh, pushing less again in the middle. And uh, they have to retreat. But the uh, three heroes of Colossian is already under the high ground. And uh, Jimmy come back to defense the high ground. And uh, Woody and jumps we in, gets uh, Doris. But uh, Woody just to uh, get too far away from his teammate, Adonis and with his out, mm -hmm. killed the Dreamy can, first. Can they get Woody as well? Adonis no. again, Greedo is down. But uh, you can uh, see True Fancy One is down as well. And uh, Adonis, Adonis uh, again cutting the back lane. And the uh, Snowbeard is down. Only Airwave is alive. Airwave is down. Nice team fight for the Kazakhstan. Counter again. 
a Donis again and take down Liu Biao. Yeah, very fascinating move. Marvelous play. Adonis is already 24, le uh, level 24 yeah, in this game. You can see Enforcer and Adonis, they both make very good. Adonis again mm -hmm. tried to kill Guido and yeah. he's out. Yeah. Only two minutes. Adonis out is ready. Mm -hmm. Well, he chose to come back. Dream is still chasing Adonis. Adonis flash to retreat. Uh, Jimmy fight back. Adonis from back that. with his out. Jimmy is dead. Yeah. What a player, Adonis. Adonis is very low right now, and uh, he's he can down. Can still escape. And uh, the out and not make it. Yes, Liu Biao's out, Miss Adonis a mm -hmm. little bit uh, distance. And uh, we can see there's uh, 17 head ahead for Kazakhstan. Mm -hmm. Maybe Kazakhstan can win with 60 kills again. Yeah, but uh, I think right now they need to focus on uh, pushing the enemy uh, powers. Nepal really need to organize some aggressive moving and maybe Dream, Dreamy can build the hack stuff mm -hmm. to restrain Adonis. Yep. They need to kill Adonis uh, by the combo train. Yep. Too mm -hmm. fancy one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, waiting for the boss. Mm -hmm. Boss, clear the Asian equips. Yep. Guido here, uh, she's still like uh, 4k behind the Adonis. Boss already in three people's mid uh, air wave. He's really tanky, but he doesn't get enough damage. Snowby try to cover air wave. I will still want to go inside. Yeah. No, so we can see Adonis is already like uh, attacking the enemy base. Airwave. Can he survive? Airwave. Snow be prepared to cover airwave, but airwave will die. And Adonis uses out kill, kill Greedo, I think. Yeah. Again, Snowby is done. Adonis already is destroyed. That's a hex! But so uh, they do not have enough oh they killed him. Yes, finally Dream get his uh, hex stuff to restrain Adonis. Yeah, okay. I think they but should build the hex early actually. But the Kazakhstan already get uh, almost uh, 50 kills in this game. Well that hex stuff been too late. Mm -hmm. And they are retreating. Kazakhstan side. They wait their uh they wait uh, Adonis to respawn. And uh, I think they need to get the enemy boss first. The enemy boss called the Aegis, I think. Grado keep farming. Mm, the nipple noticed that. They should check their boss speed. Mm -hmm. And uh, if Grado got the Aegis, it's very good for um, their team as well. But they need to... Oh, oh my god. They got Wessis in the river. Why Wessis is here? Uh, yeah. That's another very smart move for Wessis. Because yeah. they needed to wait for their support. And uh, so there's a chance for Nepal to check their boss pit. Nepal getting around the boss. But uh, they cannot contest it, I think. Approaching the top lane. Mm -hmm. And then the is carrying around the bottom lane. Mm -hmm. There will be a huge team fight going on. And uh, yes, just okay, so the boss. Is still on the top lane. Like uh, he has a lot of damage and uh, hex star. Yeah. If he cannot make it in time, they will lose the team fight. The middle creeps already in front of the tier two tower. Mm -hmm. Dreaming TP back. Yeah, he's 
But the uh, their jungle is already under control by the Kazakhstan. There's gonna be a huge team fight here with jump team yes. and then control with the Woody and uh, Woody makes Kyle it Hex. out in fourth. Adonis can he yes. make enough kill some damage? No, Adonis has survived. Yeah. Guido with his ult. Guido makes it in. But Adonis, and, uh, another, Adonis another good. good but the dreaming enough damage to take down Adonis. What the comeback for Nepal? I think Adonis needs some magic in muting item. Mm -hmm. and the Too Dreamy fancy wall. Uh, getting but Too the fancy walls. Still have the ult. Still healing himself and make damage. Can they kill fancy wall? Yes. And we finally make With it. Blinking. And the Dreamy hex. And. Uh, Oh. Uh, dead into death. Uh, that is a uh, that is the playstyle of Dreamy. But so we can see Kazakhstan already got 52 kills here. Yes, Dreamy's hex stuff and uh, Blink Deck come too later in this game. Mm -hmm. You really need this stuff to play aggressive. Uh, and Adonis, uh, Adonis still well have out. Who will get a uh, dreamy get uh, initiation? But the enforce counter the dreamy's initiation. Dreamy is done. And uh, so airwave, uh, nothing airwave. he can do. And Adonis nothing. come back. The yeah. kill airwave. Just uh, two hits. Almost uh, 50, 54 kills for Kazakhstan. Yeah, and uh, I think it's near the end for the match. And the uh, Kazakhstan need to. Um, get bosses and uh, go into high ground while wow, the Nepal they have to plan very thoroughly uh, if Adonis get the agents mm -hmm. uh, the dreaming cannot uh, make a, a second phase of damage to kill Adonis yep. and uh, I think they need just to push the high ground yeah they need to push and uh, just to, to kill uh, kill the Nepal's heroes mm -hmm. Then they can gain victory. Mm -hmm. oh, mm. This is best of three game. Mm, I think they should use a home first. Two fancy one. And uh, Adonis is on the. Uh, Adonis. She wanna jump into the high ground. Waiting for the chance. Yeah, she wanna see where Guido is. Everyone. And they're all oh. hiding in trees. Where is Dreamy? Where where is Dreamy? Dreamy and uh, Adonis yeah. both waiting for chance. Uh, we are in front of everyone to absorb damage. Mm -hmm. uh, we are too tanky for Kazakhstan. They don't want to kill everyone. Adonis uh, being stuck the, by the Guido. Mm -hmm. And uh, we are so, so tanky in front of the Kazakhstan. Kazakhstan still, still need to wait for chance. Yep, and they are retreating on Kazakhstan side. Uh, I think they need to get the mid tower as well. And the uh, top tower have not been taken down yet. Again, Kazakhstan makes a big problem that uh, how could they uh, push the high ground of the Nipple? I think that's not a problem. They need just to get enough kills. Adonis gets uh, down the bad dream, but he has ages. Yeah. Adonis is uh, a nice salty. But Can he uh, get a grid? Get a hexed? Yeah. Again, but he has another hearty. Two heroes, three heroes in his youth hearty. Yeah, and the Grido, Grido is still on the ground. Grido, he can he make it? Leech. Yeah. He leech a lot. Leech a lot, but, but Adonis, the, is, Adonis still. is down. Adonis is down. Grido. Grido kill everyone in the Kazakhstan. Yeah. But uh, already 57 kills for Kazakhstan. They have to play really carefully. In the upcoming uh, phase, the hex stuff come too later for Dreamy. <laughs> Can great to make it? Yeah, the they are already on the high ground. Yeah, pushing. They can push two lanes. But uh, the Kazakhstan the hero like taunted him and uh, grab him. Another and, uh, kill. Another kill. Only one kill to victory. Yeah. I think that, that I think is too easy for Kazakhstan. Adonis just need to see anyone on the map and you see out. out. Yeah, you see out. Well, what can Nepal do? What can Nepal do? Mm -hmm. 
They need to make a very good uh, initiation. Hmm. Adonis move into the jungle. Yeah, he can see here she's on a wave, wave, but uh, she thinks it's too tanky now. And the enforcer jumps in, and uh, they are playing very carefully right now. They are wave. Liu Biao uses out. Adonis mm -hmm. still stand behind. Waiting for some chance. Mm -hmm. The airway was hard to kill. They but kill Adonis. Oh, they but found no B. But, but Adonis down. still has no magic immunity and they get hexed by Dreamy. Oh my god. They got three free kills. That's not uh, what good. What they expected. But the Enforcer is still on ground. He can do some Adonis, miracles. Yes, Adonis should uh, keep waiting for Enforced. Mm -hmm. uh, since the enforcer keep uh, make damage on the airway, maybe some some heroes of the Nepal will lose their patience yep. and uh, explode themselves to Adonis. The but uh, I think they cannot push. If they push, uh, the yes. only problem is like uh, if they push, they will definitely lose the hero. Yeah, I think the best way is just wait on high ground. Wait for the enemy hero to. And, uh, push. I think uh, Adonis really need a uh, magic multi item. She got it yet, but uh, she does not use it. Oh no. She, I think she sells it. In the we should buy it back. Yeah. Only one kill. And uh, it will make some sense. And. Uh, I think Again, another push for Kazakhstan. Mm -hmm. The huge waves is yes, under your high ground. What can Nepal do? They cannot lose every hero in the team fight. The air uh, wave is out. The air wave is still mm -hmm. in front of the air wave heroes yep. of Kazakhstan to absorb damage. Yep. No the enforcer is waiting in the jungle to see if there any chance to do a solo kill there. Yeah, we'll just stand the here. Game. No one should pass our airway. And uh, they found out solution just to put top lane again. But uh, even though the Kazakhstan can push top lane, they still need to push to high ground to yeah. end this game. Yep. They are waiting for the last chance. Mm -hmm. So can we talk? Where is the last chance? I think uh, uh, they need someone a just need to jump in. They need a vision on the high ground up on the pole. Mm -hmm. And again. And the darkness is stuck in the trees. I think in front of the high ground, uh, we should not pass as I have a bird. They're waiting, they're waiting, they're waiting for the chance, but uh, Nepal did uh, Nepal doesn't give Kazakhstan that chance. Mm -hmm. They needed more vision on the uh, high ground. Mm -hmm. Another boss was your spawn. Mm -hmm. Adonis hanging around the high ground. Yep. They do not want to come down the high ground. So that uh, they do, uh, they don't have a chance to lose one head. Enforcer, mm -hmm. pushing to the mid lane. Yeah, I think they just need to push mid lanes again. Air wave. Uh, enforcer jumps in, get air wave, and the uh, Guido air is wave. in the back, but, but the they cannot wave. see that. That was just too tanky. Mm -hmm. You cannot get him. Adonis oh. again Snobby get uh, Snobby. But, uh, but sealed. Yeah, there's but another Adonis, out. Uh, another out. Can you kill Snobby? Yeah, Snobby, Snobby definitely died. That will be a GG call for uh, Kazakhstan. Uh, they played really good in the early phase. Yeah, congratulations to Kazakhstan mm -hmm. winning this 10th game and uh, the best of three. Yeah. And uh, we can see like they really pick what they need for their landing phase. Diao Chan, Wei Yan, and uh, Zhou Tai uh, are really very good picks. 
Yes, they just uh, uh, together in around the Adonis.、Mm-hmm. They push for the really bend the Adonis hero, Diao Chen and Guan Feng. Yep. They、uh, and we can see Kazakhstan、uh, choose a very confident first pick、uh, Diao Chen、yep. in their drifting phase, and then they win the fight.、And、they believe in Adonis. Yep. And I think. Uh, Nepal should also be winning the Adonis and bend the Diao Chen in their first、uh, three bands.、Mm-hmm. And I think、uh, Nepal have a chance to、uh, make a comeback. However, the,、uh, the yeah. score difference is too high for、mm. them, and、uh, they cannot play very carefully. Yeah, Jimmy should build the hex stuff earlier in the game to restrain Adonis.、Mm-hmm. Uh, when he have hex stuff and、mm-hmm. blink deck. Uh, the kill scape is too large for Nepal to come back. Yeah, that's true. And、uh, I think、uh, Kazakhstan they they still have like、uh, two more game to go tomorrow. I think. Mhm.、Uh, versus、um, Hong Kong, China. All right. So we'll have.、Uh, Highlights hit. Yep. We have a winner here between Kazakhstan and Nepal. That is Kazakhstan, and、uh, they win both match by、uh, getting 60 kills.、Mm. 
yes. in game two and game three. Yes, really broadly much. Mm-hmm. And that uh, will be the last match today. Mm-hmm. And uh, I think uh, uh, Atonis did not perform very well in the last match actually. But he gets many kills. Yeah, that's true. Uh, I think like during the last match, Enforcer mm-hmm. did a better performance. Like in the early stage and in the late stage, especially like uh, when they have uh, team four, and uh, on the top lane, uh, both heroes are chasing, like getting the top tower, and the enforcer jumps in and mm-hmm. get both heroes. Mm-hmm. Yes, enforcer uh, enforcer mm-hmm. make a really great uh, initiation and they make great uh, team fights. Yep. Uh, but I think uh, the MVP will still be Adonis since yeah. he kills so many kills and uh, makes so much damage. What do you think about your face one's performance on Smahi? Is just so so or he's doing okay? He just built his hex stuff too later in game. Okay, we can see the statistic for here. Very close. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and we can see the Although there's a uh, giant leap in the kills, we can see the uh, assist and uh, you can see the economy and damage. It's really close, although yeah. that's very much difference. But uh, Nepal only get uh, 15 silver assistance since their kills most come from dreaming by solo kill. Uh, Jimmy build their hex stuff and the blink dagger to kill the heroes. Mm-hmm. Uh, across the map but he i think he just built his hex stuff too later yeah i think it's the longest uh, match of today and we can see the mvp here is adon is here yes 19 kills mm-hmm. and uh, 18 assistance yeah. 135 gold to damage ratio yep uh, although like uh, he does not get every kill in the later game. Mm-hmm. She still dominates the uh, f- like uh, first uh, 15 minutes, I think. Yes, really like nice team fights. Mm-hmm. Once he pop out, mm-hmm. he's out. Like there's one instant kill. And I think uh, uh, you should really ban Diao Chan and uh, Guan Feng when you versus the Kazakhstan. Yep. As the other carry heroes like Huang Yuan is not a uh, one versus five hero. Yep. Uh, Huang Yuan is much more focused on the team fights, not uh, personal skills. Yes, I think uh, uh, this is gonna be the conclusion for our today's matchups. <laughs> so what do you expect? Uh, so what do you learn from today's matches? So like uh, you think uh, China gonna be like really powerful, like invincible mm-hmm. in the Asian games, or like uh, can Thailand be a really good uh, uh, follow-up uh, contester in the uh, later Asian games? I'm not quite sure about it since they are in a different group. Mm-hmm. Uh, and uh, bo- both China and Thailand show a lot of dominance in their own group. Mm-hmm. Uh, and tomorrow there will be two games of China, I think. Yep. Uh, the first <laughs> will be China versus Kazakhstan and uh, China versus uh, Nepal. Yep. And uh, may- maybe China uh, is the better team than Thailand, I'm not quite sure. Yep. And. Uh, I think Hong Kong China has a uh, very talented and outstanding players in their team, but they need to reinforce their discipline in the yeah. team works. They are not very coordinated. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and uh, for we have seen all of the uh, all of the team show up today, right? Yeah. yeah and I think. Uh, uh, Kazakhstan, Vietnam, and the Philippines, they all have very talented uh, strategies in the drafting phase. And uh, also uh, Kazakhstan, especially Kazakhstan, like the second uh, game, uh, they have the uh, special pick for their carry, which is like uh, make a very powerful use. Mm-hmm. Yep. And uh, now we can see that Guan Feng 
cannot be mm, like uh, removed from the uh, <coughs> Kazakhstan's hero pose. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But we will see will China uh, let uh, Atonis play Grand Fun or Delta in the tomorrow's game. Yep. And also, <coughs> there's some heroes that have not shown up mm -hmm. in the game. However, they are very popular in both the public games and also in the uh, in the tournaments. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like Luo Li, uh, which is a very powerful hero for the magic damage and the crowd control. Mm -hmm. <coughs> and uh, Dream Total as carrier. Mm -hmm. And uh, there's one hero that is Hua Tuo, which is picked very often but rarely wins today. But the Thailand uh, win every uh, game when they play Hua Tuo. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> the, we can see Sun Huan is like uh, very active in today's tournament. Mm -hmm. But I don't think that's a very strong hero. Yep. In this version, so Hua gets uh, uh, some normal team fight skills, mm -hmm. and uh, I think uh, maybe Dream Dream Liu Xiang will be a much m a much powerful choice. Yep. <coughs> and uh, uh, we have to agree that uh, uh, in today's lineup. Uh, uh, Puyan does not uh, make very good mm. uh, appearance in today's matchups. Mm -hmm. Puyan can fa farm really fast, but uh, it's hard for Puyan to uh, just S survive in the battleground. Mm, yes. Mm -hmm. If you cannot survive, you cannot make damage. Yep. Uh, I think it's related to their uh, hero, uh, hero selections. Like uh, you have to pick one or two heroes that can control the crowd for Puyuan while doing damage. Like Diao Chen? Yep. But uh, Diao Chen, uh, yes, Diao Chen can play as an offline solo when Puyuan as a carrier. Maybe that will be a nice hero combo. Yep. Uh, but uh, Puyuan can like only farm in jungle or like go. But uh, he does poorly in the mid lane. We can see in the matchup between Thailand and Philippines. Mm. Uh, I, I don't remember actually. Should it be Thailand versus Vietnam? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, and then one is like a Puyan goes to mid. However, it does not make any sense actually. And there will be four more ga uh, matches tomorrow. Mm -hmm. China versus Kazakhstan, Hong Kong, China versus Kazakhstan, Vietnam versus the Philippines, and uh, China versus Nepal. Yeah. And uh, I think tomorrow, like uh, Vietnam versus Philippines, gonna be a tense match. Mm -hmm. Yeah, both teams have shown some potential in the early phase and uh, but uh, they are just too weak to fight against Thailand. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thailand just uh, ruined uh, Vietnam and the Philippines in the very early phase of the game. Yep. I remember Thailand uh, almost killed thir 30 heroes in the first uh, 10 minutes with the Philippines. Yep.
Okay, now we okay now we can see the standings for Group A, and uh, in today's match, China like uh, get uh, one win and they're lost in in the group, and uh, Kazakhstan for Nepal. Yep, but uh, they are getting uh, two one games. They mm -hmm. they only get one point, and uh, Hong Kong they tied up since. Uh, they got one win and one loss, mm -hmm. and lastly, Nepal got 0-2, so they lost three points here. Nepal got defeated by Hong Kong, China, and Kazakhstan in today's game. Mm -hmm. And we can see the group B here, and uh, Thailand uh, is making a 2-0 victory here, and with four points, and uh, the... the Vietnam and the Philippines, they both have one loss against Thailand, so they both have subtraction two points here. Mm -hmm. <coughs> and now we can see the overall standings here on East Asia. China and the Kazakhstan both have one point and one winning. And, uh, one winning game. Yeah. Uh, I mean, China and uh, Hong Kong China mm -hmm. both have one winning here and uh, on Central Asia Kazakhstan have one winning here and uh, on South Asia side Nepal have their winning here they lost their lost two to game. Hong Kong China and Kazakhstan yeah and on group B we have Southeast Asia here and Thailand with a 2-0 victory and uh, Vietnam and Philippines they both lost to Thailand here And that should be the conclusion for our uh, Road to Asian Games today. And uh, as we will come to the end of the day, looking forward to the excitement that tomorrow's match will bring. Uh, stay tuned for thrilling action at the Road to Asian Games. And uh, okay, this competition is jointly organized by the Ol Olympic Council of Asia and the Asian Electronic Sports Federation, operated by Digital Sports Asia. And uh, we'd like to thank our prestige sponsors, FAW Audi Q4 Etron, for their strong support for the event. And also special thanks to iQOO, the official mobile game equipment of the RDAG, the professional choice choice to empower hip victory, embrace the thrill of control. Let us also think of our official supporters Omen, New Omen, your journey to the road to the Asian Games. Let us also think of our official supporter out of out of our official gaming chair partner of the Road to the Asian Games, be your own hero. Thank you to the official supporter Eastrock for their support. We would also like to thank our official broadcasting platforms, Billy Billy, We Are Live, Dou Yu Live, Kuai Shou Games, China Mobile, Migu Channels, Tencent Videos, Weibo, Xiaohongshu, YouTube and Twitch for their support. Join us again tomorrow at 12pm for more exciting events. Until then, take care and see you soon. See you soon.